Good afternoon. So everybody here, hopefully you guys are feeling absolutely fantastic today. What are you doing there? Little camera? Okay, can you... Great! Hopefully you guys are doing absolutely fantastic today on this great, amazing... Wednesday. Because it is a Wednesday after all. Who the heck is here, guys? Who the heck is in the stream? Who is in the chat? Welcome in. Welcome in, guys. What's up? What's up? What's up? I'm feeling cute today. I'm feeling pretty okay today. I'm not gonna lie. It was pretty, you know, pretty not too bad. What's up, Kima? What's up, James? What's up, Anger? What's up, Defi? What's up, Beffy? What's up, Mjitsi, Trasic, Adrieth? What's up, James? Volcano, Puke? What's up, to Trubby, Sausity, Cantorilla, First Time Cheddar, Davir, Beltaram, Dreamsight, Billy Bing, Baba Daba Douche? What's up, to Centurius, Pelody? What's up, Villain, Clyro, Sir Clumber, T Cooler? Kong to see what's up, Chef Ryan, what's up, Akuse, what's up, Jeff the Bev, is Sotiso. Fate as Wizard casts a fireball, and are you? What the heck is that emote? What is that emote called? Fat ass wizard cat fat. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Uh, Keytor, what's up, Hamnalona? What is up, Zombie Queen Elizabeth? The Gretelarks, what's up, to Tropi Sausity? Saloa, Loki, everybody who's here, what's up, Irvana, Stompy Dave, Smoke Salmon. Saloa as well. I've been sick for the past few days. Few years ago, it's been picking up the background while I was dying. Starting to feel better now. I might even follow soon. You might even follow soon, eh? Oh, shoot. I'll take it. I'll take it. Thank you for the prime as well, Lord Simon. Appreciate that. for only first time. She had a resp. What is up to Ampel? Welcome in, guys. Hope you guys are doing great today. Today we have a nice, good old plan. Okay, yesterday, you know, actually we ended up street. Uh, you, you know what I keep telling myself, man? I keep telling myself, Guzu. You need to have a day where you just do a short stream and just recuperate yourself because you've been playing way, you've been streaming way too much lately and it's incredible, okay? It's absolutely incredible, but it's way too long. And, I, and then I start streaming, I'm like, okay, short stream today, guys, short stream. And I end up freaking playing eight hours because, I, classic wow, man, like... It, <laughs> Freaking classic wow. But I keep telling myself that, okay, I need to do a short stream today so I can, like, try to sort out my, like, because I need to clean my house. I need to clean my house. I need to, like, do some things at home. <laughs> like, I keep, like, just streaming way too long. Yesterday was good, though. Um, we freaking got Ulderman done. We cranked up Ulderman on the on the Druid. We had a, a lot of close calls as well, actually. It was pretty gnarly. But we survived, and that's fantastic, and my glasses are foggy, so I need to clean those up real fast. Uh, uh, can I come be your personal housemate? I don't need a housemate, dude. You've been playing even off-stream the grind since that good. Dude, it's, it's been fun, man. It's, it's been really fun. I've just been having a blast, so it's been like hard to like put down the game right a little bit. Oh my god, I haven't burped the cabbage. I can do that a little bit later, though. It's not a big deal. Thank you for reminding me, actually. I straight up forgot to do that again. I'm glad you didn't get grieved on what that made my day. Yeah, it was pretty good, dude. It was pretty good, dude. I'm not gonna lie. We had a good time. Uh, today, the plan is simple. We have, there's a little video from Willy I wanna watch about like some uh, classic WoW MMO thingamajigs. And, wow. And then we're gonna watch like a few clips. There's a few people that sent in a few clips in the Discord. We're gonna take a look at that. And then we're gonna get going with the gaming, man. So we're gonna do some, um, some classic WoW gaming yet again. You saw the news I sent you. I didn't get to read through it, uh, Quakon, this morning, but I did see that you sent it. I'll, I'll, I'll take a look right after stream. I did see one specific thing that you sent me though, which is really crazy. Uh, you probably, I'm not gonna, you, you know what I mean, right? So yeah, what's the best thing about Denmark? I mean, can I only name one thing, dude? Denmark is fantastic. It's that, okay, I did I did see that. I haven't gotten to respond yet, but I did see that. Fianco, thank you for the two one sub, dude, thank you. Also hit freaking 3k subs last night, which is freaking ridiculous, man. The hardcore hype has been absolutely ridiculous, man. What the? Oh my god! Dude, oh my god, man! Why does they keep they keep getting worse and worse? I feel like I, I keep cleaning and cleaning and cleaning, but they don't get better, man. What the heck is that? Did he eat some brown cheese today? No, I don't eat brown cheese, man. Like what the heck, dude? Asmund didn't clean his house for 130 years and he was still fine. You will also be fine. Uh, my house is not dirty. I just need to like. There's just like things lying all, all over the place that I need to like clean up and stuff. And I've been. You know, doing some long streams lately, so I haven't really gotten to it. I think the cloth is dirty, yeah. Okay, I think it's good now. I think it's okay now. We, we can rock with that, dude. We can rock with that, dude. 
That's how it goes. Are you live at this time or am I crazy? Yeah, so I recently... Oh god, we're gonna have to yap about early streamers again. Uh, <laughs> I recently started streaming earlier in the day. Uh, like two, about two, two weeks ago, two, a little bit over two weeks ago. Two, three weeks ago. Um, I started going earlier in the day. Instead of starting around like 2 p.m. or so, I, I began streaming at like between 10 and 11. And this is better, man. I've been an early morning streamer. We, we go through that and it's a vibe and it's a good time. So that's what we're sticking to, right? Have you cleaned the cloth you're using? It gets full of the stuff you clean off. No, I probably do need to clean it though. You're right. I'll, I'll do that later, right? Yeah, I'll probably do that later. So we're we're gonna we're gonna do some gaming today. We're gonna crank up with the WoW stuff. We're gonna have a good time with it, and it's gonna be a fantastic time. And then we're gonna see how it goes. I do want to do a Sulfurac today. Yeah, I do want to get into a Sulfurac group and uh, and get through that dungeon. The plan is to probably hit level forty five. And then go into Sulfurac, right? So, that's gonna be a fun time. I'm looking forward to it. It's not early. Oh my god, I ha <laughs> Guys, when I say early morning, I mean it's early for me to start the stream. It's not because I get up at 11 a.m. Dude, I, I get up at 4 a.m., man. You know what? I don't even goddamn sleep. You know what? I don't even go to bed. I get up before I even go to bed. <laughs> Guys, you know what I mean. It's early for me to start the stream, okay? That's what I'm talking about. Got up war today? Dude, let, let me tell you, man. I haven't set it up, okay? I want to do it. I want to do the God of War. I haven't gotten it set up yet, okay? I need to set up like an emulator or something like that to get it working. Haven't done it yet. Today's going to be a WoW day, guys, okay? I'm going to plan on not doing a giga long WoW stream, giga long stream today so I can like do, do some prep up for the... Uh, for the God of War as well, you know, and see how that goes, and we'll figure it out. Have I worked out today? No, I don't work out on Wednesdays. I do not do that. I just, uh, you know, chill it up as we do. See you in eight hours. No, 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 today we're gonna, listen, I'm gonna keep my side. We're gonna do it, we're gonna chill stream today, okay? It is what it is, you know? We all know wake up 10 minutes before stream start. Yeah, I'm like an AI, so the stream is about to start, like I boot up the AI, right? And I, 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 um, I, I get into streaming mode and we go live, and then once the stream goes off, you know, I just, I just shut down basically, and I go to like, um, you know, reboot my, uh, like, re recharge my batteries, right? That's it. What's up, Salmo? Good to see you, man. Hopefully doing great. Wow, they aren't all the days past the days for years. Or like all the wow. Yeah, I mean, it's been a lot of wow, okay? Like I am a wow streamer, what can you do? But I've been doing more variety lately, right? So yeah, that's how it goes. Demo for Octopus City Blues. I have no idea what that even is. That 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 doesn't sound like a game I would play, but maybe it is. I don't know. I feel like you spin the wheel anymore. Yeah, I don't really, man. Not really. It's just kind of there. I've kind of had the wheel ever since we, we got it. Will, will you play Brighter Shores? Oh, it's a horror game! It did, It sounded like a... I, I was thinking like some sort of like a... Uh, like a city building game or something like that. But may, maybe then that would be interesting. Will I play Brighter Shores? Uh, I don't have plans on playing it. I know what it is. It's like that uh, OSRS uh, kind of MMO. Like the, the creators from OSRS made like an MMO. I'm not sure if I'll check it out. I don't know. I'll probably keep my eyes on it, and if it looks interesting, then maybe I'll give it a whirl. But I had I have heard that it, it that's coming out soon. Yeah. You know, plant is looking good, really shiny and green. Yeah, it's healthy. The plant is looking good. Thank you. What's the next variety game you plan to play? Uh, I've talked about this a few times. I want to play God of War, like original God of War One from the PlayStation Two. I haven't set it up yet. I need to set up like an emulator or like something to like actually be able to stream it from the PC. I haven't done it yet. Okay, I've been slacking a little bit on it. Um, I'll keep you guys posted on it. All right, I, I, we, we are starting it this week at some point, you know, but I just need to set it up. You know, I need to set it up. If all things goes well, I could set it up for tomorrow. And then we could do like, you know, we could do like five, six hours of WoW tomorrow into a little bit of God of War. Same thing on Friday and then Sunday if we don't beat it by then. All right, so I'll, I'll try to see if I can set it up. Buy a PlayStation 2. Uh, well, I can't stream it then. I, I, you need to have some sort of a port or some sort of an emulator to be able to stream the old games, right? So I have a PS5, obviously, but I can't just get it for the PS5. So I have to like have some sort of a thing to set that up, right? So we'll see. We'll see. But God of War 1 is the plan for variety. Maybe we'll start it tomorrow, okay? Maybe tomorrow we will commence it. Yeah? We'll see. Played all the OG God of Wars on, on PSP. Feels so long ago. Yeah, I haven't played God of War 1 since I was a kid. 
and I really want to, I, I want to replay it. I just think it'd be fun as fuck. You want to see my drip? Bro, I, I, listen, man, we're just comfortable today, okay? I got a sweater, right? I got a sweater and I got some sweatpants. Yeah, sweater and sweatpants, dude. That's, uh, that's the drip today. Just, you know, we're chilling at home. We're playing some WoW, having a good time. That's it. What color socks? White socks. White socks, man. That's it. Yeah. Get a PS5 and get the HD collection. Yeah, but you still need to be able to stream it, right? Unless I could plug the PS5 into my monitor, I probably could do that. But do I want to buy a PlayStation 3 just to stream one game? Nah, I think I'll get an emulator. Because I do have the original game, and if you have the original game, then you are allowed to do an emulator for it, right? So... I think I'll, I'll set it up, chat. Don't worry about it. We'll set up the, uh, the God of War and it'll be good, you know? Why is the Gusu and Savage's video so chill? Because Savage calls me right before I'm about to head to bed. <laughs> Whenever Savage calls me on stream, it's like I'm literally just about to go to bed. Yeah. <laughs> it's, 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 so, like, I'm, I'm, I'm just, like, kind of, like, winding down about to, like, head off. So, and he, like, calls me, asks me about my whole life story and stuff like that, you know? I lost Uldeman run. I hope you do Soul Frag today. Yeah, that's the plan, dude. That's the plan, man. We're gonna do a Soul Frag today, mate. They make a PS5 remastered God of War? Really? You know what? I'll take a look at the chat, and then we'll see. Um, we'll see. But God of War 1, yeah. Unless you rip the copy yourself without breaking a DRM, owning a copy of the game doesn't make downloading ROMs legal, by the way. You used a lot of words. I don't understand what even is uh, EQ, so I'm not gonna pretend like I know what that is. But I'll, I'll look up the lore about it, and then we'll figure it out, okay? Ammon, what's up, dude? Yeah, I, I, I don't know what that means, okay? But I'm gonna look it up after stream. <laughs> you, you, D -R -M -R -A -R -O -M, uh, you, I don't know, okay. It's just, dude, it's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I just wanna make sure whatever I'm... If I'm streaming a game, I wanna make sure that I'm doing it in... Like, that it's legal, right? That I'm not just, like, yoinking some freaking thing, right? There's a rumor of old God of War remaster, but less evidence than War 3 upgrade and War 2 remaster. Yeah, okay, fair enough. Top 10 reasons after 20 years, Classic is still a top 10, a top MMO. Let's take a look. World of Warcraft is a version of the game that people have been coming back to now for closing in on two decades. Like At this point, it's proven itself as a truly timeless game for so many of us around the mm. entire world. It was the version of WoW that started off this crazy journey so many years oh, ago, yeah. and on its re-release in 2019 it once again dominated the whole gaming market for a second time and whether you i am still i don't know if anything can ever get as hype as 2019 classic release that i mean obviously there was a big hardcore hype lately but dude 2019 was crazy you compare vanilla to yeah. its other options within the MMO genre or just to other WoW expansions, it just does certain things mm. differently. Vanilla was and still is really a unique Frack. experience. But what exactly sets it apart? What are the main things that this version of World of Warcraft isn't mm. shy to do, which typically games these days are? Well, that's what we're going to be talking about today. Mm. Ten of the ways which vanilla plays that make it, well, the vanilla World of Warcraft experience that we know and love. Okay. I did try to put these in order as well, but each one, although not as gameplay impacting as the next, does seem important Fair. to the overall pacing and just the feel of the game. So with that yeah. said, these for me are the top 10 things that make vanilla, vanilla. When okay. You oh, thank you, Parla. I appreciate that. I think you're from Uland, though, so it's going to take a while, but thank you. you first arrive upon the grand world of Azeroth, you're going to be doing a lot of running about to hand yeah. in quests, to get to <laughs> new zones, pick up flight paths, and so on. So Dude, people always meme whenever I stream this game that, like, it's literally just a running simulator. But, and it is, it kind of is, but it's also what makes the game what it is, man. It's... It's unapologetically just itself, and it's just a big, big world, right? It's awesome. Brevok, thank you for the Classes prime. are lucky enough to get hold of a movement speed ability early on, such as Aspect of the Cheater, mm -hmm. Ghost Wolf, or Travel Ooh. Form. But for every class in the game, you need to wait all the way until level no 40 before you can buy a proper mount and start riding around at an impressive bonus 60% speed. Yeah. And your first mount is a big investment. I mean, unless you're a Warlock or a Paladin and you get them for free, but for everyone else, it's 
a big investment. It I is. don't know about you, but oftentimes after I've just bought a mount on a character, I still catch myself running about because I just get so used to it. And while some mm. of those journeys you have to do on foot are super long, such as the first trip from the wetlands up to Arathi Highlands on Alliance, or, you know, just going anywhere in the barrens, it feels like, it gives the world that scope of size which it's famous for. And your Yeah, the, the vanilla world, it, it's not really that huge, but it feels that that big because your character is so slow, right? So, I mean, it, it is a massive world, but like still, right? Try doing 200 jumps in EVE Online and come back to us to complain about walking simulators. I played a little bit of EVE Online and I, I do know that game is also incredibly crazy with that stuff, but I feel like a lot of the older MMOs are like this and that's just what makes them so unique. And I think that's what has a lot of people like wanting to play it, right? Because it is a slow game. It is a very, very drawn out game, but it, God damn it. Do you get invested? It's so good. The first mount will also set you back 90 gold or so after your faction discounts. Yeah. And if you haven't been particularly careful with your gold up to level 40, you probably won't even be able to afford it for some time. Mm -hmm. I'd say on a regular playthrough on a first character on a fresh server, most people are getting their mount somewhere between level 44 to 46. Yep. That wouldn't be unreasonable. To really be able to get it at 40, you have to have it in mind from the beginning and work towards it. Use the It's really, really rare people get their mount at 40. On Unless they have, like, friends give them gold or something. Most people even actually get it towards 50. Auction house, yeah. send things to your bank hey, cult and so on. And that's even before we get to level 60, where your epic mount is going to set you back a crazy 1,000 gold. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, the game isn't afraid to have you run around on foot for ages. I mean, experience-wise, level 37 is about a third of the way to 60, and 44 is about halfway. So just on yep. experience alone, you can tell how much of the game you're going to be running for. But I think that time you spend on foot running around the world is super important for vanilla. For the the thing about that level thing where people say 47 is at the halfway point with the XP, it, it makes sense, but like you also get more XP at the higher level, so it's not really like that, right? But I, I get what he means with it. Yeah. World building for the importance on planning where you're going to go for PvP and so much more. And so that yeah. is why I think it was worth a mention here. Next up is cool. something that we will all run across during our time playing WoW, and those are, of course, item upgrades. In oh. vanilla, you start with essentially nothing and have to work your way up oh. from great quality trash items all the way to epics. And the quest rewards and upgrades in vanilla can feel like a big deal, simply because mm -hmm. there's such a massive disparity between the power level of different items that you are awarded i mean it feels so stupid to say <laughs> but i got more excited on my hardcore druid getting a green helmet from rfd than i was getting the legendary furlack on my retail character i like that i had more dopamine like rush in my in my whole body about getting a green item at like level 30 it's so silly but dude it's weird, man. Like, the, the gearing progress. I feel like this guy right here. That was me right there. For example, That's a cap? Bro, it ain't. It ain't a cap. Maybe it's also to be to because I'm, I'm just more invested into vanilla, right? I'm more like a vanilla Andy. So, therefore, I get more joy out of it, I guess. This gives you a cloth chest with strength on as a reward. By the way, this is from quite a long quest chain that has you going all around mm. the world. Or maybe you get a plate item with a bunch of spirit on. You kind of ask yourselves, what exactly were the devs thinking here? And whenever I say this, I always hear somebody saying that the devs wanted you to be able to distinguish between the good and bad items. Ah. And man, did they go all out on bad items. So you... <laughs> I think so. I think they just slapped random stats on a bunch of shit. I also think it's because they had planned for some classes to do things that they didn't turn out being able to do like rogues you should be able to use bucklers like and, and stuff like that so like a bunch of the stats are really weirdly made right really get to see them yeah. a lot i mean to be fair spirit is actually a half decent stat when you're leveling early game but mm -hmm. it does fall off unless you're a class which really benefits from it such as a shadow off. priest then again in a sea of items with highly questionable stats for flavor there are also some massive upgrades which you will equip as soon as possible and you'll probably Holy. keep them on for about 20 levels or so think of the seal of rin from the long quest chain so on alliance us. the whirlwind axe from the warrior exclusive quest or the rune of the 
guard captain from that horde quest in Literally the hinterlands previous. going out of your way for those big quest rewards is most definitely worth it in vanilla and you really feel the power of your upgrades when your abilities start hitting that much bit more mm -hmm. and having gone on that journey to get them instead of just going to the auction house and pressing buy makes them feel even more satisfying yep. to get and this trend of items being massive upgrades definitely continues at endgame too with certain Stitches items only. being constantly in high demand such as ring of Curia, onslaught girdle chromatically tempered sword drake oh. fang talisman and so many more <laughs> huge item upgrades are a big part of vanilla and yeah. you really feel when you get one next up is regarding classes and specifically those are little things that each class has which although they tend to rarely be useful are small bonuses which make them what they are i'm talking I like that not every class can do everything in vanilla. It's very much like a rock, paper, scissor game, but it's cool because it's like class identity, right? It, it's awesome. Talking about things such as water breathing or walking of on the shaman, did. detect invisibility on warlock, divine intervention on paladin, or eagle eye on hunter. Quite a few of these flavor type abilities were just ideas that were had during earlier stages of World of Warcraft's mm. development, but were left in the game because they added that little extra bit to the it's feel funny. of each class yeah. within the game. And understanding these niche abilities and knowing how they can builds. fit in your class's total toolkit can absolutely make a difference. When I'm playing a shaman, I always ensure I have a stack of each reagent so I can water walking or breathing. There's plenty mm. of underwater quests. Detect invisibility on the wall. Shamans have eagle eye. Yeah, they have foresight. Like shaman and, and hunters have e both eagle eye and foresight. Divine intervention came out of vanilla, yeah. A, a paladin can sacrifice their own character to like uh, DI someone, make them invulnerable, invulnerable for two minutes, but like stand still. What can be used to see yeah. enemy patrols before they end up chain pulling and causing a disaster in dungeons such as Diamond West? Divine intervention. I remember when I saw like uh, Enslaved Demon as a kid, I was like, what the fuck? They can go up to like a demon and just make it their pet. I thought that was so sick. I thought Function it was is a so good last cool. resort when a wipe is occurring so you can save a healer and begin resurrecting. Mm. And Eagle Eye on a Hunter is super useful for finding patrolling mobs or rare spawns within the zone. I mean, speaking Ooh, of unique oh God, class abilities, you can even change your character's language to speak in their native tongue instead of the common languages everyone can understand. RPG. Someone out there needs to be mad enough to do a Night Elf playthrough where they only speak Darnassian, and every time they want to talk, somebody has to translate for them. Over time in WoW, Blizzard would gradually prune many of these abilities out of your spellbook as they were deemed unnecessary clutter and then in more dude it's rpg though like ebbos back in the day was a lot more about the rpg perspective for sure more recent a expansions more. they've started to add them back in again because oh they realized is... actually they're pretty cool but at the start in vanilla these small extra additions did feel as though they made a difference next mm. i want to talk about the open world nature of vanilla world of warcraft whilst it's not by any means a full sandbox mmo insofar as you can really choose your path at all times and build Did anything it? anywhere it certainly has a lot more choice than the expansions which follow it you can definitely travel to areas which are high level or go into enemy territory it's just the case the game will throw a skull level enemy at you that's going to two tap you at which point you'll probably realize that you're not supposed to be there i remember being a kid i had a i had a warrior i think i was a warrior yeah i was like level 11 or 12 or so and my brother had like a guild and they were they were invading south shore you know south shore versus terran mill and i got invited to join and I remember running to South Shore on like a level 12 like warrior and seeing all the skull level mobs. And I was like, what the heck, man? This is insane. There's like th these high level monsters here. And I'm like, I I'm struggling in like, a you know, Durotar. I, I was so blown away by it. It was crazy. Same nostalgia I had playing Morrowind back when I was a kid. I was running around in the whole world of Morrowind searching for like creatures. And there was like those... Silt Striders, I thought they were crazy cool. And then there was also, I remember, some sort of like lobster person, lobster people that like would attack me in the water. It was crazy, man. I never I never did a single quest in Morrowind as a kid, but I ran around and explored the whole game. Yeah. There's also much less of a feeling of hand- When I say the whole game, I probably just mean one zone. But, yeah, you know what I mean.
hand holding and the game putting you on a yeah. set path. This is a big difference from many games nowadays where you almost get the impression that the developers have decided you yeah, need to know me. where to go and what to do at all times, otherwise you're going to get bored and quit. Vanilla isn't afraid to leave matters up to the player in terms of where you'll go, what you'll do, how you'll it's build good. your character, the gear that you'll use and so on. Oh, I mean, imagine shit. a totally new player to Vanilla who's never played it before oh. without add-ons or guides trying to find their way through the world. When the game first launched, that's what it was like for everyone. I mean, for me at least it was, I can say that. It's I not that resources didn't oh! exist online to oh, find oh. things, but my internet was so bad that each Shit. internet page would take minutes to load, and I would have rather just been playing the game during that time. Mom, get off the phone! I'm trying to play WoW! Uh, the freedom to just go up. and do stuff has also lended it quite well to Vanilla's replayability as we've seen through Blizzard's attempts on seasonal servers in Season of Mastery and Discovery, as well as players taking mm. on the hardcore challenge. Overall, Vanilla is a game that's not afraid for you to go out in the world and learn about it, True. and for me that's definitely been a strength. Speaking of freedom within the game and learning about it, that oh. really brings me to my next point. Vanilla is on okay. a surface level, no very simple to play, but there's a crazy amount of depth to it. I mean, for real, you can get so far in vanilla on some basic gameplay. You can be keyboard turning, clicking the lot, and then you get to end. Honestly, that's, I think that's what I love. I love the simplicity. That's also why I unironically really prefer Diablo 2 over Diablo 4. It's a sim. It's a very basic, simple game with a ton of depth, right? There's so much depth to it, but the overall, like, just like the... Just like the base of the game, super simple. Like it's super duper simple. You can play it and with no problem if you know nothing about the game. But if you really are into it, there's so much depth, right? Easy to learn, hard to master. Yeah, I think that's so good. I, 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 it, yeah. Game raids where many classes rotations are about three buttons. And if you're a caster, you literally just stand at the back and press one button on repeat. <laughs> and that is it. You are actually playing the game in an optimal True way bills. because it's just that simple. But there is a near endless amount of extra things to know about vanilla, which of course the game never tells you. Melee leeway, the five second rule, how to make different macros, or, you know, the entire threat mechanic, which is absolutely core to every single aspect mm -hmm. of PvE nice within the game. You have no way of knowing how it works without add-ons. You don't know good leveling routes within the game, which spec to go, which items are the best, and so on. The more you dig into it, the more there is to know about vanilla World of it's Warcraft. Yeah. And the main point here is I feel as though it's a game which primarily rewards game knowledge over yep. game skill. Player ability and skill can matter of course in certain scenarios, such as PvP, but just knowing a lot about the game will serve you super well. And just yeah, when you feels. feel like you know everything about vanilla WoW, you always end up finding something else out so that's yeah, what they they really nailed the satisfaction of this game like it feels very good pressing a button and seeing that big number pop up like they they really like i i think that's the main reason for wow success it feels so good to play like it's so responsive it's so good it, it they really really nailed that so well even mmos that released today feel so clunky compared to vanilla like, dude, a game releasing or being made and released, like, in 2005 feels more clean than a lot of, like, newer releases. It's so insane. I forgot you're doing live early now. I'm here. Yeah, I'm, I'm live early, man. Live early today. I mean, that's For me, usual. vanilla is simple to play, but has so much depth to it, and it really yeah. becomes more noticeable the more you play. Next up is the fact that in vanilla, we have a more dangerous open world, as mm. well as certain elite zones, which can be very difficult to solo. Fresh out your starter zone at level 6, you're yep, probably you. feeling pretty confident. The mobs in starter zones move slower, they can be neutral, and they're generally pretty easy to deal with. And then you step foot in that open world and it becomes immediately <laughs> apparent that you are in fact not very strong at all whether it's yeah dude, when you, it's it's such a big difference that's basically with final fantasy it feels clunky yeah i don't know i they they really nailed the smoothness of wow but honestly pastry you're right what what blizzard did really freaking well is they took ideas that other companies did and they just made it way better they, that dude they were just the goats at like getting freaking like the games right like, yoinking all the ideas, turning it into, like, a new thing, and just getting it, right? It's Cobalt's Re Same with StarCraft 2, right? I mean, StarCraft 2, they literally yoinked half the ideas from Warhammer, right? The easy clap. Same thing with, with World of Warcraft and other, other games, too.
Borny in the Mines in Elwyn, Defias over in Westfall, or the classic Son of Aragold death down in Silverpine, the world of Warcraft can come at you pretty fast. Mm -hmm. Most classes consider anything more than two mobs at once to be a serious threat in vanilla, and oh, you need to use some serious cooldowns, yeah, if you yeah. even have any that is. And at times an enemy mob can just decide they're going to dodge or parry about six times in a row and you just lose a 1v1. And then there's mages of course who can yeah. pull a dozen things at once and AoE them down, but you know, just hero class things. But the open world is dangerous, it feels that way and it never stops being dangerous mm. either, right from that moment when you leave your starter zone all the way to level 60. It's things like this that make the hardcore daughter, yeah. challenge so interesting to people. True. There really is a constant threat of making a fatal mistake. At the same time in vanilla there are open world elite zones to take on too, which are often great for XP and can have some nice quest rewards too. Mm. Though you're not really supposed to take them on solo but it can be a nice test of skill yep. to see if you can do it. Otherwise you do as the game intends and you naturally run into other people in the same place doing the same quest and you group up so it becomes mm. easier. This is one of the ways that vanilla encourages you to form parties and meet other people within the world. But o Yeah, open world dungeons kind of why. They also spend more time drinking than fighting, but that part they usually don't mention. Or oh, in these kind of videos, I think it's a fine thing. I I, I think like the whole the, the 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 fact that the whole process is super slow is is what makes it fun. It's a slow, very just chill. It's like you, you're living a like a like a second life in a way. I mean, it it literally is. Only if you want Tinta, to Lord, do yeah. so, and I think that is quite important to remember. Next is a moment that we have all experienced, I am sure, and on each character when it happens, it feels just as good as the last time. Shoulder it's like a World of Warcraft graduation oh, moment, shoulders. and that's of course when you finally equip your first shoulder and helm slot items. Oh. In fact, for that matter, you don't really get neck items or rings or trinkets and definitely one of my friends in TP- This is not vanilla, this is in TPC, but you guys know the Blood Elf mask in TPC that you could get on- Was it in Horde you could get it, I think, or Alliance? I don't remember. But I remember one of my friends got it, and then another one of my schoolmates was so jealous, <laughs> and he sold it to one of our classmates for two weeks of, of his school lunch. He freaking sold his school lunch for two weeks for an in-game helmet in World of Warcraft. So for every day for two weeks, he would give his lunch to that other guy in turn for a helmet and wow. It was so stupid. It's soulbound. No, I don't think the one in TBC was. TBC, uh, what is it called? Uh, the... Uh, I don't remember the name of it. It's the it's the one that dropped in TBC from like um the Blood Elf like the the Drenai starting zone. I don't remember what it's called. Blood Elf Mask, Blood Elf Mask. Blood Elf Bandit Mask. I don't know. This is like the retail version, but it looked like this. Yeah, it was this mask. This is not the, this is not this one. It just reminded me of that. Yeah. That one is like a super rare drop. It's like a 1% or so. Next time say which one. Well, I did. <laughs> I did say that, with, yeah. Definitely not idols, librams, or totems for ages either, as in the ones you no, equip. You did. I'm pretty sure I did. I said the one that dropped in TBC. Doesn't matter. You're, you're right, I'm wrong. Let's move on. The difference is, though, you can see your shoulder and helm items on your character, so that just makes them better, doesn't it? I mean, I'm even around sure level 18 or so, you might randomly come across a common quality pair of shoulders, but it still feels good to equip them, even though stats-wise they're basically mm. doing nothing for you. As for your helm, well, that comes quite a bit later, and yeah. for a regular character, you'll be seeing that somewhere between levels 25 to 30. Ooh. It's the scarcity of these items at early levels which makes dungeons mm. such as Scar at Monastery good, Armory yeah. such a big deal. It doesn't have to just be your helm or shoulder items either, just getting your first bag in vanilla feels good. There's nothing like starting your yeah. first quest within the game on a fresh character and you instantly just get a six slot bag in your inventory. It's the true sign of a blessed character. True. And even in later levels when you loot a traveler's knapsack, that just Ooh. feels great as well. Even if you want to sell it, you're going to get a few gold. In a yeah. game where your inventory can fill up so fast, that matters. Which leaves us with what I I feel are three of the most important things which make vanilla what it is. Walking into Stormwind for the first time. I wish I could do that again. Man, am I just like a nostalgia? Am I am I gonna live just my whole life being nostalgic about this game? 
Like, God damn it, dude. Like, Jesus Christ. So first up, I've got something which I think can be a little bit overlooked in vanilla, <laughs> but for me, it's always felt really important. And that's having the feeling of going back to a major town or city yeah, after a long go. questing trip and restocking and sorting out your bags before you're ready to head out once again. Imagine the scenario. You've been out in Stranglethorn Vale questing for a few hours and your bags are now full of random cool? meat, troll sweat, wild vine, and about two dozen different other random items. Mm. You're starting to run low on food and water and you've gone through your health pots as well but at the same time for all this work you've got a quest log which is absolutely full and completed to show that yeah. moment when you finally head back to booty bay sell all your trash mail the good stuff to your bank hold turn in all those quests sort out your gear and so on just feels so good to do maybe i actually never noticed that pirate flag that sounds so i never i never i, I was just looking at this picture now i never really paid attention that there was a pirate flag there yeah, I oh don't don't uh don't don't like pin that. That's just gonna make more people like talk about it smooth. Just like yeah, if you pin like a because it's gonna just you know tilt people or something. Yeah, um, I never noticed that actually. Yeah, like it's just, yeah because now now I literally mentioned it and now people are gonna yeah. I don't I don't care about talking about politics, guys. Uh, you know I I know about the freaking election and stuff. I don't care to talk about it. Okay, there's other streamers talking about it. If you want to talk about it, you can go there. Yeah, don't, don't pin that stuff smooth, don't, because, yeah, it just baits people to talk about it. And now I'm baited to talk about it, too. Uh, I've never noticed this, actually. Like, never. I, 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 I know that, like, the shark fang and everything like that, but... Feels so crazy. good to do. Maybe you head over to Stormwind afterwards, check the auction house for upgrades, get more food and water and health pots, go to your class trainer to get new skills. Mm. Maybe whilst you're there, a world buff drops, and hey, you're ready to go. Bags clean, gear repaired to head back out there and get stuck into the world once again with mm. a fresh set of quests to work on. Those moments when you pause to just sort things out, for me, adds so much to the game, and it's something that everybody does. It also encourages that planning aspect yep. of vanilla in terms of what quests will I do now, where do I want to go next, and so on. So for me, this whole ritual everyone does just adds a bunch to the game. Yep. And number two is something which I feel as though ties a number of points that I've gone over together, and that's the fact that in vanilla, leveling feels important. And it yeah, feels as though thing. it has as much or even more at times importance than the end game. In future expansions, Blizzard started accelerating leveling a lot to get you caught up with the current expansion and into the new content as well as the end game. This I think a lot of people could argue that they don't even care about vanilla in game. I, I think the the best vanilla experience is the leveling process, farming all your prebus, doing your first raids, and then doing some world PvP if you're into that. And dude, that's 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 the most fun. The journey of leveling your character, gearing it up, you know, pre biz farming, your first raids, everything like that. That's the vibe. That's just that's so fun. What's up, Household? Good to see you, man. Started as early as midway through TBC yeah. when Blizzard went back and reduced the amount of experience needed between 20 and 60, as well as making some of those iconic open world elite zones non elite anymore. In Wrath, they further squished XP, added heirlooms and the LFD, and well, things just really went from there. Of course, by WoW's current expansion, you can't expect a new player to be spending 100 hours in vanilla <laughs> and the same amount on each subsequent expansion. True. So I get why things were sped up over time, but in vanilla, the world was the main character Bless i think in a way that's where this is what they if they oh my god no i don't want to get into this conversation no no don't do it okay just mention it quickly and move on if they ever do a classic plus i hope that they just focus on making it what makes vanilla great don't try to appease both like retail players and classic players just make a classic game make a game that's you know for classic you know, the classic we world, the classic, classic leveling. Punk. Okay? Household, thank you for the 62 months. We need classic fresh. Maybe they'll do it. Okay? But just make make it for vanilla. Right? Make it for the people that like that kind of MMO. Right? Don't try to please both people. Because I think that's where, you know, some things could go wrong. All right? Moving on. 
character themselves have even said as much. Yeah. And your character's progression, power gain, and growth over that journey is part of what's given Vanilla such longevity over the years, to the point where people are still hyped about going again on a fresh character to this day. Which means that number one, the most important thing which makes Vanilla Vanilla for me okay. is, well, something no expansion can ever do, because it's the fact that Vanilla is not an expansion. Yeah. When you start here, you start at level one with nothing in your bags, barely any gear, and it's a new adventure every single time. I mean, that's also why hardcore is so fun, though. Hardcore is like a mini fresh every time you die. You know, it, it's like a like it's like a mini uh, fresh injection sure if you played the game a lot before you can mail yourself gear yeah. you can boost and so on but that's up to you whether or not you want to do that every single player starts off in the same way in vanilla as the humble adventurer you're mm. a small person in a very big world delivering letters solving small problems and eventually you're led to doing great things towards the end game of wow i mean yeah. if you just stop and think for a moment when's the first time you actually fight a full-grown dragon in world of warcraft sure you've got the whelplings over in the wetland True. There's drakes in bad ones, but a fully grown dragon. That's properly end game material, such as. But well, that's actually a good point. I never thought about that. I mean, the first dragon dragon is Aranicus, but that that's a shade of a dragon. That's not an actual dragon. Yeah, that that's the guys. You're fighting a shade, right? You're fighting a shade of Aranicus. Badlands. Well, if when you go to Badlands. There's Teramus the Devourer, but he's not like someone you just go fight. He's like an actual, like, you know, a big enemy that can, like, kill you. Yeah. And again, Teramus is like a drake. He's not a dragon. This is a dragon, right? Yeah. Teramus is in Blast... Oh, wait, Blast... Blast... Blast. Oh, yeah, Blasted Lands, but uh, Badlands, sorry, I've confused the two. Uh, you mean the two, the, the, the quest where you summon those two big drakes? Again, that's a drake, that's not a dragon, okay? World boss in Ashara, first dra dragon? Yeah, they're also drakes. Yeah, dude, yeah, you, you actually don't really fight a dragon before endgame, except if you count Sunken Timbal, Iranicus, you know? Hillsprat Dragon too. again, that's a drake. You know which one are you talking? You're talking about Nari, Nari Lathstras, whatever it's called. The Green Dragon World Bosses or Veilstras the Corrupt him. UPRS? It's not a dragon. That's a dragonkin. But again, that's in game. BWL. When expansion started, the old world felt as though it changed from the main character of the game to just an obstacle which yeah. you needed to overcome so that you could progress on to expansions and the new content as soon as possible. And when you were starting on- Who the dragon that Ren rides on? The drake he rides on. He doesn't ride on a dragon, it's a drake. An expansion, your character <laughs> was already quite powerful with all your gear and abilities and you just went from there. But that is not the case for Vanilla, and I think ultimately having that progression path from 1 to 60 in a cohesive world is something that truly makes Vanilla mm. the game that it is. And that's it, 10 things which I think have proven their worth over the years in Vanilla World of Warcraft, and have made it to this day this still one fun. of the most popular MMOs in the world. Yeah. Would you replace any of these points, and is there anything else which you think is cool? to the world of vanilla oh. wow let me know below and as always thank you all so much for watching and listening in and i shall see you on the next one very soon dude the, the really videos are like nostalgia for me man like i just it's just, i just like talking about vanilla so it's like they're they're always great to watch man as someone who never played the original back in the day i can still say it's one of the most fun i've ever had playing wow classic is top tier the original dev team was quite possibly the best dev group ever assembled most dev teams back in the day, it seems like it was so much more passion-driven about making good games. These days, it's, you know, more about, like, making a lot of money. <laughs> but, you know, it, 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 it's a different thing, right? It's a different... Uh... Back in the day, different, man. It's different shit, dude. Took the words out of my mouth. Yeah, it's it like, you know, not just games, music, movies, all the same, everything, yeah. Will the video since make me want to go back to Solar Project server? Feels like original world of vanilla World of Warcraft. Yeah, he's like a safe space channel in a way, right? Nostalgia is a hell of a drug. True. True. But I also do think that the games and movies from back then were just really, really goaded for real. All right. Um, before we get into the gameplay, guys, let's just watch a few clips. We have a few people send in a few of their uh, hardcore clips. So we're going to have to take a look at these and then we're going to get going. We, we, we only have four. This is four, four clips to watch tonight.
How is the Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough going? Oh, I'm playing Baldur's Gate 3 with Mordial. And uh, where, where did we leave off? Where, where, where are we in Baldur's Gate? We... Oh, yeah, we're in some sort of mushroom place right now in, in Baldur's Gate. And uh, we're working our way through that. We killed like a bunch of like, uh, there was like some sort of like a big thing with a with a flying, like a big flying eye that was like mind controlling people. We killed that. And then we're like in some sort of like a mushroom place. And we met some people who like kill gnomes or like whatever the heck. Beholder? Yeah, it was a beholder. You're in the Underdark? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's where we are right now. Yeah, that's where we are. We haven't played in, in, in a little while though. It's been a little while since we played, but yeah, that's where we are currently. Are you sexing every character you see? Uh, yeah. yeah uh, I accidentally... Uh, yeah, lay cell uh, a few times. Uh, acid, acid drop. Thank you for the eight months. Uh, thank you so much. All right, let's take a look at this, guys. Uh, a few times. Okay. Accidentally? Okay, she, dude. No, dude. She, no. Uh, okay. <laughs> Mordial wasn't too happy about it, but, like, literally, I, I, I woke up in camp, and they cell was like, You! Bet me now. And then I was like, shit, okay, my bad. All right, and then, you know, that's how it goes. All right, what is this? Hardcore clips, guys. Some people, we had some people send in some of their clips in our Discord. If you do want to send in your clips, you can link them in the Discord. We have a clip channel for hardcore clips and stuff. So uh, feel free to do that. But uh, let's see here. We are in UBRS of the Beast. What do we got? This is uh, Kase. Oh, wait, Kase. Kase K. Oh, the beast does like a charge where he resets threat and knocks people back. And also fears, I think. Okay. Oh, he doesn't have target of target. That is gnarly. Oh, Frosty. Ooh. Frosty, 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 Frosty. Please block. You can't pull aggro. You have to. Are you checking your aggro? Hey, no, he resets aggro. Okay, fuck you. Yeah, we just all got feared. Um, that's... It's just more like an ice block. Not not, I'm, I'm he fears into acro reset. Oh no! One percent. Oh my god! Fuck. Yo, Fuck. Petri, Petri, holy shit! Can somebody heal him, please? Oh, Are you actually no. Oh my god! What it? Oh my god! Petri out! 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 You have to be. Wait, I've never seen a Petri out on Beast before. Yeah, so the the Beast, he does like a knockback, and then he like charges someone, he resets threat. You, you just need to pick up the boss after. Ganger Void died. Did someone, I think it was just one person who died, but dude, they almost had three deaths. You see Saryus and Seagull's Makura yesterday? Did they, do the, did they do a Makura against each other or what? I, I haven't seen that, no. Um, if I, if you want me to take a look at it, you can link it. I'll, I'll take a look at it before we get uh, get playing. I, I like just uh, watching some clips and stuff before we, we play. Yeah, if if there, if if, if sorry, you did a Makura or Seiko to send send the link. If it's a one hour Makura, though, then <laughs> we'll watch the end. Okay, we'll watch the end of it. All right. Yeah. If there's a if there's a sorry Makura, guys, you can link it. I'll I'll take a look at it. I didn't hear about that. I haven't seen it actually. All right. What's this here? Where are we? Oh, this is the keep in the Barrens, right? South Barrens, I think? Okay, what are we doing here? So I guess he wants to kill that, uh, that rare mob. These officers, by the way, has an incredibly high parry uh, ratio. Look at the parries. Yeah, isn't that insane? They are like a bane of like melee. They parry so much. I don't know what the parry percentage is, but they have like a 50% parry chance, I think. Yeah, he popped Retaliation and literally did no damage. Oh god, this is bad. Maybe just fear the- yep, 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 that's a horrible- No, don't run that way! Oh no, 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 no. Does he have- I don't think he has target dummy. He doesn't play engineering. Chat, oh. riddle me this. What, what? I may be your Dane okay. and play the fiddle. But rumor has it I did all the squiggle. What? Some smoked bacon I cannot deny. A hog's feast I surely comply. By being demonic the hogs run away. But who am I, you ask? Don't lead me astray. Dull. I don't know what you just said. Thank you. Hugh Johnson. Bro, like... 
Yeah, I mean, what could he have done here? I mean, this was obviously a re he ass pulled it, right? He shouldn't have pulled that officer on the side. He even had it marked. The retaliation play was really good. But he just did no damage to it. I think he should have focused on the officer and maybe like kite the other guy after. I think a big mistake was not using Swiftness Potion here. He ha he does have a Swiftness Potion. You can't see it or, or, or under my cam. But if he sw if he would he would have Swiftness potted there, and then feared on the way out, I think he could have made it. He also has a broken leg armor. Yeah. I think Swiftness pot could have saved him. In this situation, the best bet. Sticky glue the officer, finish off the soldier, bandage yourself up to full, swiftness pot out. Yeah, I, I think that would have been the best play, but it, it's so hard to make those like snap decisions in the moment. It's it's really, really, really hard to do, right? Uh, Ubi RS again. No swiftness pot at all, just tank it out. It would have been sketched with the officer, but that could have been a play too, yeah. Raxus, you might be right. I didn't see it, no, super. Gith spawns a, um... Or, like, he doesn't spawn, but, like, Rent hops off of Gith whenever you kill Gith, or, like, 20%, and he has no threat, right? Yeah, they were on level, Raxus, yeah. But the officers are actually hard. Okay. How can this go wrong? Oh, shit. Yeah, over acro? P R I E S T R S S F for R F D Eler is dead. I want you to revenge me on Garlish. Oh, you died? Oh, that sucks, man. I'm sorry to hear though. Is there is there a clip of it or Thank you. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Yeah, dude, the warrior over acro, he had death wish which uh obviously makes him take more damage. He got hit with a... It's very hard to tell, but he got hit with a mortal strike into an auto attack. And he just got one shot. He got two tapped, basically. That fucking sucks. I am sorry to hear that, Jim Carrey. I, I really am. Yeah, he, he got two tapped. Death Chris uh, granted, I guess. Alright, what do we got here? Oh, shoot. He's watching the stream. Nope. Okay. Nope. That, that's... Yep, that's not... That's, that's not... That's <laughs> not... Dude, I just listened to myself yap about quests. Okay? Okay. Okay, you just used your vanish, and now you're running into the middle of the camp with all the mobs. And I really talk a lot, don't I? Oh gosh. Why would you... Sir! What is... Um, I'm, uh, you keep it, you don't, you need to target on me, please. Target on me? Oh, you can't. Wait, why can't you talk? No, no, no. Oh, because you. What did you use that put your target dummy on cooldown? Tissle tea. You tissle teed over target dummy in this situation? <sighs> Honestly, I'm gonna keep it a buck fifty. I actually don't even. I don't even remember that. That I didn't even like that it that put I can't even speak. I'm so flabbergasted I can't speak. I actually didn't didn't uh, recall that um, Tizzle he put that on cooldown. Maybe he didn't know either. 
yeah, I, I don't remember that being a thing, but I guess that's that's a thing. Tizzle T puts target army on cooldown. Guess you gotta learn somewhere. I guess you gotta learn somewhere. Damn. Didn't know that what potions put a lot of cooldown. Yeah, it's uh, healing pots and mana pots, I guess, right? Yeah. Um, is there a uh, labadabadu? Is there is there like a um, you you talk about like a clip from Saryu, like some sort of like a like a duel or something? Makarahi did. Is there a way to find that or uh, before we 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 move on here? Oh gosh. Clips twenty four hours. It must have been yesterday, right? At the end of his VOD. I mean, I'm down to watch it before we get going with the gameplay. At the end of his VOD. Okay, what was he dueling? I, I have the VOD here. For 80 pound dumb right? Did Kuzu fall? <laughs> He's talking about my yeah, hole. This is it's a paladin? Or maybe here? This guy? I, I feel like I can handle Oh, is this guy? I could try and wait and get some. This is instant. I'm trying. I haven't if seen this are. at all. Okay. All right, I think here. I think here. Okay, Gradark has challenged you to a duel to the death. So 36 Rogue versus 36 Paladin with Corpse Maker. Okay. Poisons. Yeah, I got him up. Let's take a look. Anything? Okay, watch any, Seiko's Makarada. We, we did watch a Seiko Makarada. I don't know if he did another one, though. Guys, if we die... Oh, man, if we die, then... Ooh, he has Tizzle T, though. Shit, dude, that... Okay. The only thing he... Yeah, I, dude, he has freaking... I think he also has Kidney Shot at this level, right? Yeah, he has Kidney Shot, he has Cheap Shot, he has Blind. The only thing he doesn't really have is, is Crippling Poison rank 2, right? We figure something out. And pre-med. No, he does have pre-med. He has everything a rogue would have, would want almost. I sent it. Okay, let's take a look. How is he gonna open? Is he gonna go for the sap opener? No, he goes straight in for the cheap shot. Okay, into a gouge. Building up those combo points and probably into a kidney shot coming up very, very soon, right? There we go. There's the bobble. He probably would want to maybe... Yeah, either sprint or vanish is what I would say. Yeah, that was dumb to vanish there. Yeah, Hammer justice. Here it is. Okay. Heavy dynamite. Get a re-stealth into a sap and then bandage yourself up here is very, very good. Because the forbearance is already up, right? Or you could just run away and stealth, I guess. Yeah, I would have opted for a sprint in the beginning there instead of vanishing. But, you know, he got it's away nonetheless. Opener, honestly. It's a great opener so far. Yeah, it's good. He traded bo uh, Bobble for Sprint and Vanish. It's not bad. It's actually a pretty good trade. Because now the Paladin is Oom. He has Hajj in like 20 seconds here. He could even go for a Bleed Opener, but I don't know if you want to go for that. Like, sap the Paladin and then build up like some combo points with Cheap Shot into like Garot Rupture. That was close. But I think he just want wants to like Cheap Shot, right? Not, play not do any fancy stuff. Yes, Hammer just is really soon. Miss. Miss. Ooh. Good couch. I got a miss on my cheap shot. This is actually good for Saryu, because now he has two combo points. It's going to give him four combo points off of the cheap shot. Or five, I guess, if he gets the proc into a rupture. That's the bleed. Good evasion. I kicked the bomb. That doesn't work. Yeah. You could just blind off of this and kill him, him, or just kill him now. Yeah, he's got it. All right, all right. I, I honestly thought it was gonna be a little harder. Okay, we're good. I was just scared of that hammer of justice one-shotting me. That's all. I was like, if no. I live the stun, see, I'm fine. I don't even think the paladin lay on hands, right? I I, I think that the paladin really messed up with not like trying to drink after the reset there, and also not doing uh like lay on hands, right? It was just the stun that I was scared about, man. Yeah. <laughs> like it was just the stun, dude. Yep. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, that's nice. Okay, chat, we got him. <laughs> All right, we got. There three. you go. <sighs>
Guzu, I've never played WoW before, and I'm playing hardcore because I want to play alongside OnlyFangs. I've died five times around level seven on different classes. Am I cooked? Uh, shoot. Playing WoW for the first time, and you're doing hardcore? Dude, you're in... Dude, you need... Bro, I'm gonna be real. You need to play a hunter or something. Play a hunter or a warlock or something. Get to level 10 and get your pet. And it, you can crank, okay? But you gotta take a chill, okay? Because... Why a hunter? Because it, it is one of the more easier classes if you're new to WoW. You have a pet, you just stay back and, and attack, right? But you gotta get to level 10. Yeah. Honestly, I'll try a paladin. Paladins are quite simple too. You just have your seals up. And you can heal yourself whenever you, you get half health and you just do one mob at a time, right? Paladin could also work pretty well. Yeah, you gotta just take your time though, man. Frost Mage is easy for new players. Yeah, maybe you're, maybe true actually as well. This is the Seiko clip. Okay, okay, final clip chat. I want to actually start playing as well. Is this going to be a long clip or... Uh, I, guys, whenever we open a Seiko clip, I never know if we're going to be watching it this for an hour long. Uh, what... This is just a one minute clip. Uh, let's put chat there. Wait, what, what is this? These guys just pre raid biz? Yeah. 60 druid? He reached out. Pedro's gonna end. What's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? Oh, he's. Oh my god, my heart is racing. I'm not even in this. Oh, they're in a duel. And the druid is sitting in a pit tree, and there's probably a rogue sitting around waiting for him to get out of the pit tree, right? He took the coward! He took the pit tree off that floor! He took the coward! Oh, uh, he pit tree out of the The people's champion! Oh, gosh. <laughs> An absolute piece of shit, this druid! The people's champion, ladies and gentlemen! The people's champion! Okay, I get the thing. It's a pre biz rogue fighting a full biz gear druid, and the druid petried out of the Makora. Yeah, okay, I get it. I get oh it. Oh my god! The Was this goat! a long duel? The goat! Oh my god! Okay, to be fair though, this rogue ain't bad geared. Alright? I just. I, I, no, do title charm, dark mantle, four piece. You know, Dalrins, he's not bad geared, okay? My man's rocking Mara gear! My man's rocking Mara gear in a bad matchup! He yeah. pulls out the... It's not horrible gear, but it's obviously not the same level as the Druid, right? W! He yeah, the, the, the Druid was fucking decked. Yeah, I mean, if you look at the gear, dude, this guy's full tank piss, right? So, you know, compared to the Druid, for sure. Yeah. They said not to use well buffs, and the druid popped well buffs. Oh, he unbooned and then he chickened out. Okay, okay, I'm a bit disappointed in that druid as well. Yeah, how long was that duel? What what time is it? One twenty-seven. Hold on, dude. We, we're just doing investigation work, guys. We gotta start playing the game. 127 on the hey, clock in game. healing warlord gear. Red. Oh, this is one of the 30 du minutes. How long was this duel? Oh, yeah. Oh, God. Let's see. Oh, God. Easy healing. How, <laughs> how long was that duel? <laughs> okay, I just want to see the end of this duel. Hold on a sec. This was like a 20 minute duel. <laughs> <laughs> like a 30 minute duel. He's a griefer, he kills low Damn levels. Damn kick in. Like IRL. This is an easy, easy shield, easy shield. Right here. This is the wrong VOD? Oh, shoot. Easy heal, easy heal, easy heal. He's easy fighting another right priest, yeah. Dude, he's just collecting low level ears, man. Healing. I mean, he's low level it's too. It's an easy pot if he doesn't heal. Oh, resist fear? Oh, dude, she goes low health. He missed it! Oh, big pot! He has will of the there second, is? though.
He mana potted. Oh shit. And Seiko's fully oom. Does he have evocate? He does have evocate. He's on okay, this is it. This has got to be the evocate all in, dude. What's up, Coco? Seiko 17 years yesterday, bro. A little bit of HP, people see. Seiko has just been what? sitting around What? Why does it always break, dude? Us. No, he can kill him here, though, because the priest is fully oom. He just needs to, like, uh, suck him down, right? Yeah, because the, the mage versus priest... Is he on the it, ropes? It's all about getting the, ropes, the, the priest oom and then killing him, right? Yeah, Somebody's you're fighting the, the mana bar. I think, I think he wins here, yeah. So this was a 20 or 30 minute duel. Oh, good Nova, so he can't get close and fear him. He's also Oom now. Is he? He fucking Ooh. resists, dude. Into us. Yep. Yes! There it is. Woo! Let's go! There it is. And this was the cul play. culmination of 143. When did they start dueling? <laughs> this was a uh, 50 minute duel. That was a 50 minute duel, which is what's the ending of. Yeah. Holy shit. Dude, is he just collecting ears? What? Uh, buffs that aren't. Wait, he's just been collecting like ears. I'm just, I'm just going through the VOD and I see like another. Oh my god, he's standing. Okay, this is a hunter duel. Let's check this one out. Okay. See now, okay. Oh, he's gonna go for the pet. Okay, so he's gonna kill the pet. This is the same thing Peo did. If you remember uh, shit, watching the Peo clip, my sheep instantly broke. Holy shit, this damage is insane. Many people would say you would want to sheep the pet and then going for he's the hunter. Dead. His pet doesn't die, man. But I think maybe since they're so low level, actually killing the pet is more worth. Ooh. Holy shit! Okay. Okay. Look at Seiko perfectly staying in the dead zone, by the way. Not oh, perfectly. Shit, there's, a there's a little range. hit there. It's a heart with a torrent. Please, don't be the R. Yeah. You, you can stay in the dead zone of the hunter and they can't melee attack or ranged attack. Hi, Michelle. It's gonna break soon. This hunter is toast now, I think. Yeah, he's actually toast. Frostbolt probably into Fire Blast and Nova, right? Yeah, and then you just sit in that dead zone. Ooh, outranging the War Stomp. Oh god, look at that melee from the hunter, though. And now it's his Arc and Explosion. Yeah, oh! You just can't leave that dead zone. You can't leave the dead zone. At... Final. <sighs> yeah, so we were just watching a few Seiko clips here, you know, uh, hardcore uh, moments and stuff. Just chilling a bit, you know. If you don't want any ads in the future, you can use your Twitch Prime if you want, you know. But we try to uh, stop it whenever Woo -woo. we can and help out, you know. Easy. So, uh, it's really one of those things where we're just uh, chilling a bit. You know, beginning of the stream. I like watching a few clips before we get into the gameplay. We kind of got caught up in a little bit. And now we're watching this. So, uh, yeah. Unholy Living, thank you for the three months. Shirko Perico. Thank you for the five months. No ads? We're done? Okay, we waited a minute. We should be good now. Let's watch. All right. Okay, okay, okay. Shit. I don't have enough mana to kill him. I'm, it's over. No, he doesn't have a potion, though. He hits too hard, man. No, he can do it. He can do it. It's up to the gods, man. He can definitely do it. Oh my god, he was... Oh, Ooh, there's a trap here. Fuck. Oh, that's bad. That's bad, bad. 
Oh, that was a mistake from the hunter. He should have went in for the wing clip, I think. Yeah, Wap, Wap just wag and wing clip would have been the play there because it's gonna be harder for Seiko to stay in the in the in the dead zone. Okay. Nice. Please don't resist. Oh, the revive pet. Oh shit, the pet is back, but it doesn't have a lot of health though. Yes! And he got him. And he got him. Let's go! Who said I was going to Brill? Who said I was going to Brill? Dude. Which one of you guys didn't believe? Is he just the terror of Crossroads? He's just sitting in Crossroads on a 22 mage and like dueling people. Who said it was a bait? Yeah, Seiko's a beast. Is he doing oh, another duel? This guy's back. This guy's got I it. think I saw another one in the VOD. I'm not sure. I don't think he has any buffs. Oh, buffs from my- Okay, own. now he's dueling a rogue. In class. Duel. Goggles. Alright, 22 mage versus 23 rogue. Rogue doesn't have cheap shot yet. So, um, I would assume the rogue is probably playing combat, which means that they have improved sprint. So they have evasion, or they have vanish, and they have improved sprint. Two ways of removing, moving slows. If Brill... Sorry. If Seiko... <laughs> if Seiko can get rid of those two cooldowns from the rogue, he wins the duel, right? Remove the rogue sprint, remove the rogue's vanish, he wins the duel. Yeah, that's pretty much it. You gotta do a Makara character. I would love to do a rogue or something where we do the character with engineering and everything to try to do Makaras. I think that'd be fun. Yeah. All right, guys. If there's any mobs interfering, please take them away. All right, let's see. Unless guys. like somebody intentionally pulls do them, it you now. can tell. Yeah. I want to do it now. I'm doing my my, my druid right now, right? But no. but if we pull them by accident, like I do a, a AOE or something, and I pull a fucking thing, I might give him his opener as well. Respect. That's, dude, that's why I like Seiko. He actually... Dude, respect to Seiko for that. Giving the rogue the opener. I respect it. All right, here we go. We Listen, I'm not throwing shade at anyone, okay? But... Aussie didn't let Bobka get an opener as a level 40 warrior where Bobka was 35, okay? Just saying. Okay, just saying, dude. So respect for Seiko, okay? I'm not... <laughs> hey, I'm just saying, dude. At the end of the day, it is what it is. All right. Ooh, okay. I think there's just no in-game sound, guys. It's not muted. Sprint has already been used, by the way. Vanish coming off soon? If the rogue vanishes here, Seiko wins. Yep, Seiko won. I got him. If he lifts he this now... Okay, he has gouge. Here comes the abyss. <sighs> Ooh. Blizzard to get the rogue out of... Yep, if this sheep... If he can get this sheep on... Seiko's won. The rogue can win now. Yeah, Sleeping Dust. Will of the Forsaken for Sleeping Dust. Okay, he's got no CDs. Yeah, rogue is dead. Now the rogue is essentially a warrior without intercept or charge. Seiko knows this too. He was just trying to survive the opener and then getting the rogue to use his shit and then now it's uh, it's all over. Little. He doesn't even need to fireball. I was I'm gonna not going to greet my health. Normally you, you already use fireball. Vanish. But yeah, this is a so oh, over for the rogue. Have... Yep. Gonna manage you there for the pushback. Uh, I'm sorry, Wysock. I'm sorry, dude. And there it is. There you go. The rogue versus mage duel is all about CDs. You want to make the rogue lose their CDs. Once they have those done, the rogue is useless. Yeah. The the um oh seven the opener thing chat it's not like a thing that you have to give them the rogues but it's more like a gentleman's agreement thing you know you don't have to give them the opener but you know it's a, it's like a it's an unwritten rule right of dueling For in a why way. so g you know here's is there any knotch on oh, no, Azusa some saw pvp all right cool well that's the Seiko uh, Makaras at least that we have for now okay boys all right, there it is. I just wanted to take a look at those since you guys mentioned them. All right, there it is. There it is. Very nice. Very nice. It's not a duel, though. Yeah, and I, that's what I'm saying. Like, okay, it, it's like not really a thing you have to do. But 
whenever I see people giving the rogue the opener, I'm like, damn, okay. You know, all right, all right, you know, respect it, I respect it. So, uh, so there's that, right? I did more yesterday than the VOD, it was deleted, I think. Okay, I mean, if they're, they're, we'll probably watch them at some point, right? No honor in Markara, fair enough. It's, it's from the CDL rules? No, 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 no. It's, it's not the CDL rules. There's always been like a kind of gentleman's agreement, you know, like you get, you let the warriors get the charge. If there's like a, you know, warrior versus mage or whatever, you let the rogues get the opener, you know. You don't have to do it, but it's like, you know, it's nice to do, but you can do whatever you want, right? You know, you can do whatever you want. Doesn't really matter at the end of the day. Uh. Oh. <laughs> okay, there we go. I like that, actually. I like that. It's like, that's good. Uh, all right, let me boot up the game chat, and we're going to start playing. I am not going to lie, guys. This seems to be a reoccurring theme in this stream. I didn't really plan to do a very long react today. I planned to maybe watch, like, a few clips and then get moving, and now it's been an hour and a half. Okay, I think we should get going. Yeah, I think we should get going. This this turned into a, a longer react than I anticipated. Yeah, nice job on the video. Yeah, Snaggybox Chat is the, the YouTube editor, man. He's been freaking cranking out the videos, so so he's, he's been doing great, man. Crowd Pummeler. <sighs> yes, we're gonna try to get Crowd Pummeler today. We're gonna, we're gonna try to get it today, guys. Alright, we're gonna try to freaking get it. Sulfurag when go to the gym before. You can safely go to the gym, Bunky. Yeah, we will not do Sulfurag before like probably two hours. Yeah, I need to think level 45 first. So we're gonna do a little bit of other stuff before we uh, we start, uh, you know, the, the, the Sulfurag. Okay. Uh, there we go. Cool. Let me log in. Skibidi. Ananas. Let's go. No this work today. I could come on my mage. Okay, we'll see, we'll see. And I buy a duck painting. It's not a painting, it's just a poster. The man fighting the bear was insane. Laughed my ass off in the latest video. Oh, from Snacky? Yeah, we, we were a bit like uh, he when when he, when he added those memes to the intro of the of the video. We were a bit worried if like people would not like it if we like memed it up a little bit for the intros and stuff, but it seems like people actually enjoyed it, so that's awesome. I'm I'm happy about that. You know, we've been adding some memes and some funny jokes and shit like that to the videos. Uh, all right, Ananas Group Assemble. Where are we right now? Uh, it's gonna remember where where we left off and where we are at the moment. Oh yeah, yesterday was a great day. We managed to do Sulfurac. Uh, no, but that's not what we did. Hello. That's what we're doing today. We did Uldaman yesterday. We didn't get any loot really from Uldaman. We did manage to get a lot of XP. We're almost level 45. We got a 14 slot back. And uh, we got a lot of stuff done. Today, I want to go into Sulfurac. Right? That is the goal. I want to head into Sulfurac today. You know, so we got Tanaris leveling down here with all these quests. And uh, we, we got Sulfurac coming up. And also Feral Ass. We got a little bit more things down there. But I think before we do that, you know what time it is, guys. Like, do I even have to explain what we're doing right now? Like, you know where we are. Do I even have to, like, tell you what we're about to go do? We're about to go into Normal again and get our crowd pummeler, okay? We're, yes, we're gonna do it once again. We're gonna go do it. And after that, we, we're gonna get going with the leveling, okay? So, uh, let's see if we can get it. All right, we can start off the day with a little gamba for the stream. See if we can get the crowd pummeler, okay? I've done this six times now. This will be our seventh time doing a No More Again run for our crowd pummeler. And it is yet to drop. I'm gonna get Japlo out. And we're gonna go get our freaking crowd pummeler, okay? <sighs> yeah, we're gonna go get it. We're gonna go get it, bro. Um, oh, true. There we go, dude. Uh, Neox, you whispered me for a guild invite, but you're already in the guild, and you're actually level 2, so you're not even supposed to be in the guild, okay? Uh, yeah, you, guild is 10 plus, guys. Guild is 10 plus, okay? Just letting everybody know. If you want to join the guild, you need to be level 10 plus. Yeah, 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 10 plus. Dude, last time we did it, we got two freaking boots, man. I got a boots for each one of my pants, dude. What the heck is up, my drillers? What's up, Enlock? Good to see you, bro. 
Mm. Oh, we gotta do go to Taka Taka. <laughs> Taka Taka 2. Cotello's Riddle, actually. I wanna. Before. A after we do. Nomer, I'm gonna stop by this place real fast to get Cotello's Riddle. Because it leads us into Dustville Marsh, And then after Dustville Marsh, then there's. Uh, Hinterlands, I think. You know? So, yeah. A few things we gotta do today, boys. Uh, invite to the guild. Guys, if you whisper me for a guild invite, you need to be above level 10. If you if you get into the guild and you're below level 10, okay, if you try to treat, cheat the system, you will end up getting kicked, okay? It's a it's a level 10 plus guild, yeah? So only, only ask for guild invite if you're above level 10, please, okay? Thank you very much. You should get Mallet before you go into Sulfurac. Well, the problem with the Mallet quest is that it requires me to be like level 50 or like, you know, 48, 49 because I got a solo, like a high level mob. And, um, I don't know. I want to do, I want to do Sulfurac around level 45. I think 45 is a fine level to go Sulfurac. So I might end up doing like another run later on when I'm, when I'm a higher level. But yeah, all right, welcome to the guild, guys. You can join the guild, of course, of course. We look at all these members we're getting in, guys. We have a constant, all around the clock, 100 plus members online in the guild. It's absolutely fucking ridiculous, actually. Oi! Have some buffs, mate. There we go. There we go. Okay. Bro doesn't even look at the level of people whispering, assuming they don't lie. I, 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 okay, I, I get, I get spam whispered quite a lot. So I can't really respond to all the whispers, but I, I'm, I'm trying my best to, to get people in that want to join the guild and want to be a part of the community and stuff, right? So, yeah. There's a trinket you can start the quest chain from Westfall. You can use it in feral forms. It's an AoE flamethrower, around 250 damage each, each target. An AoE flamethrower from Westfall? Are you talking about sweet, sweet amber? Is that the quest? I'm, I'm just guessing. I don't know if that's really true. Yeah? Okay, let me take a look at that after, I'm, uh, after I've gotten this crop pummeler, okay? Yeah, after I got the... I am gonna wait. You, you call me crazy. I'm not jumping into that. Yeah, I ain't doing that shit, dude. Today is the day, I believe. Let's hope so, so Jazza. Let's hope so. Uh, there we go. Thank you, thank you. There it is. Today has to be the day, I believe, I believe, I believe. You know, you gotta have faith, guys, in life. All right, you gotta have faith. Can Gamma be changed to Will Guzu have a pair of boots for every day of the week so believers can win for once? Listen, dude. You just gotta believe in yourself, okay? Believe in yourself and you can achieve great things in life, guys. Also, by the way, we got a limited invulnerability potion last night for it recipe. Will drop. So I am considering mayhaps going alchemy. Maybe after we get the wolf shit helm, we could respect to alchemy and then do that. We'll see though, we'll see. Let me give this guy a few buffs here because, uh, you know, maybe that'll help him out a little bit and a little heal. I think he's so soloing a little quest there, so I'll just help him out. Maybe after the devil's arm. We'll see. That would take ages to level, no? Uh, alchemy, alchemy actually isn't that bad to level, dude. You, you, if you, if you have like travel form or like a mount or something, uh, alchemy and herbalism takes no time. It's, it's quite fast to level actually. Whoopa. And it's usually very smaller than normal. Got a little black bars at the sides at the bottom. Maybe you're, you're too zoomed in on your browser, Richie. Hold control and scroll in or out. You know, maybe restart the PC. Pl plug in internet and out if you, you can as well. Turn it off and on. Or maybe you have an ad blocker, you know. I gotta leave. Can you please get the pommeler this time? Yes, I'll get the pommeler, Ammon. How dare you leave, huh? You know you're supposed to stay here forever, Ammon. This is your home. You live here now. You belong here. Who's are you sexy beast? Hello, mate. 110% is the normal zoom value for Twitch on Chrome. Yeah. <laughs> Making me go crazy, man. Oh, God, we gotta turn off the hardcore add-on whenever we go in here. I keep forgetting. There we go. Alrighty, then. Let's go get this freaking mace, dude. Surely. Surely, surely, surely. We'll get it done. What's your secret? You don't look a day younger than 33? Oh, well, that's because I'm not 33 yet. <laughs> 
Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I did sleep in a little bit today, okay? I, I had a day off from the gym, so like I slept in a little bit, you know? But, uh, you know, the body needs a good healthy amount of sleep to uh, recuperate itself. So I figured, you know what? Ah, it's fine. You know, we're fine. Don't worry about it. Okay. Okay, fatty. Are you calling me? I'm not that fat. Hello? I'm still trying to put on a little bit of weight, okay? I'm still quite underweight, dude. I'm, wor I'm working on putting on some weight. Not, not, you know, losing it. Unbelievable. Okay, I'm almost there. Am I Norwegian? I'm not. I'm Danish. I have been to Norway a few times, though. But I'm not Norwegian. Why are the dungeon's loading screen so long? It, the loading screen's the first time you do the dungeon in, in a reset. It's always long. I don't really know why. It, it's usually a thing that only happened on, on hardcore servers. But yeah. Did you burp your sauerkraut? I haven't done it yet. I need to go take a break soon and go burp my sauerkraut so I can keep it uh, fermenting nicely. Yeah. Bling -a -ling -a -ling -a -ling -a -ling -a bling 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 Am I balding? I don't think I'm balding. I think I just have a very, very uh, receded hairline. I've always had a really fucked up hairline, but, uh, you know, it's just, it, it's creeped up a little bit higher the past few years because uh, my testosterone levels have skyrocketed lately. So, uh, you know, that's how it goes. All right. Let's go kill this guy. There we go. Yeah, this is gonna up a little bit, you know, so that's how it is. I have the same hairline and it's cool. Hey man, you own it, bro. Own it. Alright. It is what it is. It is what it fucking is. Alright, don't give me boots today, man. Okay, just give me the give me the freaking maze, dude. Give me the maze. I really want it. This is actually the only time I didn't have to heal uh, mid-fight on this boss. Yeah, I'm straight up just like uh, pummeling it. Get it? Because <laughs> it's the. <laughs> My name is Kuzu TV, and this is how I got the crowd pummeler after seven attempts of doing no more again every reset. At this point, it's a joke. Like, it's, it's actually a joke at this point. That is seven attempts of every day doing this run. I can't do it more than once per day because there's a reset before level 60 on all dungeons. Bro, wait, what's the drop rate? Thirty-two point sixty-two. Thirty-two point sixty-two times seven. I've had a 228% drop chance to get it. And I still haven't gotten it. I, I, I should have gotten it 228%. And I just haven't gotten it. How is that? Like, dude, to be fair, we've gotten lucky with every single other thing in the game. You know, all the loot and everything. But that thing just eludes me. That's not how math works. How, how does it not work like that when I just did it? I literally just did the math. Welcome. Yeah, I just did the math. Stupid boots. I hate them. I hate those boots. Damn it. Safe it's ridiculous, guys. You can't add percentages. I just did. And it worked. I did the math. Whatever. It's fine. So, one guy... We're talking about some stuff in Westfall. Let, let me let me fly down to uh, the next area we're going to here, and we can yap about that a bit here. Uh, yeah. Watch, get back. One guy, yeah, one guy, dude, one guy. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know why I keep saying one guy. I, I, I think it's because my brain has been so twitchified that I, <laughs> I, I speak in emotes at this point. Yeah. You should do a pommeler boot collection soon. Bro, I get seven tries. Seven tries. Yeah. Whatever. What can I do for you? 
Okay, we gotta go to Cotello's Riddle down there. So let's go here. Okay, so what are we talking about? This this sweet amber quest apparently gives you a trinket. I didn't know about that. Let me just thought about this real fast. Oh gosh. Barley, corn, and rye. Okay, let me let me just sneak peek the the last uh, thing. Oh shit. I've never seen this trinket. Wait, what? That's a first. Wait, wait, wait. I've never seen that. Wait, so I gotta get holy spring water. I have done this quest. This is the quest where, where you get the Akira's Reed. Yeah, yeah, you get you. It's where the Akira's Reed are. Barley, corn, and rye. This is Swamp of Sorrows. I can tell by the ground. <laughs> Taneras, and then this is Feralas. I can tell because of the the ground color and the, and the the little tent. Oh fuck! That would have been so cool if I was right. This is Hinterlands. Close one. Wait, so I should. True silver bar. No! I got a true silver bar the other night! Wait, we should go pick wait, wait, wait. Hold on. We should we should go pick up that quest. Yeah, dude, we should do that. Hold on, let, let me go pick up that quest. We can we can get out of a chests, guys. Uh chests at like around level 40 gives true silver quite often. Hey, welcome, Scorty. Welcome, dude. Yeah, it's good because the riddle quest together with that is fine. Yeah, that's that's very nice. Okay, we're gonna go pick up the sweet amber quest, and we're gonna go real fast to um to Stranglethorn Vale. We can get the legacy heart for that quest, maybe if we wanna do that. Yes. Okay, let's start that. Why not? What else did I wanna do? I don't remember. I wanted to do something else as well. Doesn't matter. I guess it's fine. Okay, we're in it. Please burp the sauerkraut. <laughs> going to burp the sauerkraut. Right, I, I think we're. I think we're landing in uh, Stormwind. I, I, I can uh, fly down to Westfall and we can burp the sauerkraut. Okay. You want me to burp it on stream? You made an account on Twitch just to follow my stream, dude. That's. I, I can respect that. Thank you very much. Yeah, can we see the sauerkraut? I, I can show you the kraut, dude. A little burping food you have to do to make... Oh, it makes you makes you nauseous? I, I Dude, I love it. I love fermented food, uh, like, a lot. I, I'm, I'm gonna try to make some kimchi soon as well. Uh, I usually do make some kimchi once in a while, but I, I, I haven't done it uh, quite in a while. But I might do some kimchi. Uh, let's fly down to uh, Westfall. Okay, I'll burp the sauerkraut. All right, one sec, Jack. I'll, I'll give you guys a burp. All right, we got this. I'm making some sauerkraut, guys. I'm making some sauerkraut here. And each day, you gotta burp it, right? Which means that you're opening up the uh, the vessel and you're letting up up the uh, the gases that's been uh, made from the fermentation. Okay, so you do this. <sighs> and each day you do this because if you don't do it, then it explodes, right? Oh my God, it smells so whoa. Wowie! Okay, so now I just bring it back into my, my, my thing and then I let it ferment longer. Oh, it smells a lot. Wow.
I'm back. <sighs> I'm back. Sorry about that. Am I German? No, in Danish we call it Surkohl. Surkohl. You're not adding any caraway to your sauerkraut or cumin? Um, no, I'm just doing it uh, with salt. I might add some like more spices to it when I make it later. But lately I've just been doing uh, salt. Just like just straight up to salt. In Dutch we call it Surkohl. Yeah, we call it Surkohl in Denmark. That's what we call it. I love it. I love it. I really love the cabbage a lot. It's delicious. It's delicious. It's also very good for your digestion. So uh, shout out to digestion. Um, so I got. I gotta go to STV for this quest. I think I can just run down here, right? I think that that's the fast run down and then swim into this place. I don't want to do my soft yet. I don't know if I feel comfortable doing that quite yet. Uh. I don't know about that. We could do Kraki's Mari's feet. Legacy and the heart. Mm, I think I'm going to just focus on this. Because I do want to go back and then do these elite quests. Like the Mari's key. And then also Stranglethorn fever. Mm, but maybe we should wait a little bit. Sweet Amber. This is the quest right here, right? It's the Stiana fight. Bring a holy sprue to Grim Boozle Thunderbrew. In the land of the south where vines twist and creep lies a hidden well where the water runs deep. Pure as the light, sacred daughter, bring me to me some holy spring water. Wait, so is this guy like a poet that's that's drinking or what? Because I think the quest chain is like you're giving him like uh, all the all the ingredients to make beer, right? Because he wants water, he wants like uh, corn and some hops and stuff. Boozle quick, th oh god, hello, Harry Pruder. I'm getting like uh, ambushed here. Okay. What's up, man? Okay. Uh, hi guys. Hi, hi guys. You got, you guys want some buffs? Want to see a photo of Seiko? Wh what? Love the stream. Thanks. From his old class photo. No, 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 it's okay. It's, I don't, don't, that, don't want to like invade his uh, privacy. No, 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 no. No, you don't have to send that to me. No, no, no. Thank you, though. Yeah, it, it, I know it's legit, but it, it's funny. He showed it. Or oh, it's a picture he showed. All right, if it's a picture he showed, then, it, then I can show it. Sure, sure, sure. Sent on Whisper. All right, I'll show it. Dude, what? I'm getting, you're stun-locking me in game to show me an IRL picture of Seiko. Wait, did he put... Wait, is this from high school? Did he put Wrathful Gladiator in his high school picture? <laughs> he put Wrathful Gladiator. Yeah, Ruthful, Ruthful Gladiator Seiko with a G. I guess it's because they gave themselves like nicknames. That was kind of funny. All right, that is kind of funny. Yeah, a Seiko right there. All right, that's funny. Yeah, I see. I see. That's funny. All right, uh, <laughs> good luck on your leveling, bro. I love Seiko. Seiko is, Seiko is nice, man. I, I met him in IRL like two times. He's a very, very nice guy. His name is actually Seiko. I, I, th I think it's Mohammed. I think so. Is Seiko tall? Uh, yeah, dude, he's really tall. I think he's like one, almost 190. Yeah, I said Mohammed. Yeah, I think his name is Mohammed. I think he's, uh, he, he, his heritage is uh, Egyptian, I think. I'm not too sure on that. That might be completely wrong. So if that's wrong, then, uh, you know, uh, yeah, it is what it is. I think, I think Egyptian, though. That, that's his, uh... Do you say heritage? I, I think you do, right? I don't know. All right, let's uh, swim down here, boys. Get the spring water. Man, that's so funny. The qu this is this quest. Because I remember this quest. I just didn't remember where from. You get a trinket if you do this whole quest chain, which is really funny. Yeah, you get like an AOE trinket. If I can use that trinket in uh, bear form, that'd be awesome. My friend Gnome just died? Wait! 
that's the guy we just saw in No Morgan. You remember the guy we buffed and healed in No Morgan on that truck? He died to TechBot. We just buffed him with Thorns and, and um, Mark of the Wild. Oh, shit. I shall grieve, just die. <laughs> Classic. Damn. Damn. Yeah, I think I'm waiting with the Crocky's Maury's foodies. Like this quest. I think I just want to do the Amber quest, right? Because we're going to come back later for this quest. Uh, I think so, right? Isn't my Soth Giga high level? I think he is. Gave him the Danish Hex. I guess so, man. What the fuck? Decent AoE trinket seems nice. Yeah. Okay. I, I'm, a, I'm a bit confused of what I want to do right now, man. I'm a little bit all over the place. Because I, I want to do Soul for Act coming soon. But I guess the, the, I, I'm a little bit uh, aggroed by this quest now. Take my thorns. It'll help. Didn't curse him, guys. Yeah, I, I think we just do this quest and then go back up to Westfall. And then we can go to Swarm of Sorrows because there's a double quest in there and then we'll be good to go. Where's your mount? Uh, I am the mount currently. Yeah, currently I am the mount. You're going to Belgrade in three weeks? Any re any requests? Or like any any suggestions is what you're asking? Uh, I don't know. Uh, the food is great there, man, Scott. I, I would highly... If you can... Um, oh, I don't remember what the name of the restaurant we went to. There's a restaurant in Belgrade that sells like roasted pig and lamb. Uh, it's called Pachenia. You need to go to like a, a place that sells like roasted pig and roasted lamb. So good. It, it is so good, bro. Oh, hello. Attention, chat. This is a serious matter. We have information that a hot dealer is still on the loose. No, I... If you have any information which could lead us to the hot diddler, you will be rewarded. I am not a hot diddler, man. I am not a hot diddler, bro. That is slander. There may be hot diddlers out there, but not me, okay? I'm gonna swim this way. Um... Yeah. Imagine having fishing for that wreckage. Yeah, well, I don't. Okay. You know what? Maybe on my next character, maybe on the OnlyFans character, we'll actually level fishing. Okay. Like maybe maybe we'll we'll do we'll do it all, man. We'll we'll go hard in the paint. Yeah. Honestly, fishing is not a bad profession to really get. Like if if I can if I get can get like some food to eat on stream, like a little snack or something. We can just like whack on a video while I fish a little bit and then I can eat my food, right? That actually doesn't even sound like a bad idea. Yeah. I can just, I can, we, we can just like watch a little video, I can fish a little bit while eating some food for like, you know, 20 minutes or so and then we can continue after. Okay. Doo -doo -doo. Why, are we, why are we whacking on a video? No, just like whack on a video, like, you know, just like slap on a video or something. Oh, this is where we fought Tethys, guys. Feels like forever ago already. Dude, it's almost Friday again. Dude, I can't, I can't lately with with the time like on on, on in real life. Time feels so like it's flying by lately. Oh, I level fifty. I was gonna say, damn, my man out here soloing Tethys, but he's level fifty, right? So he's gonna crank it, of course. Yeah, he's gonna crank it. All right, all right, he got it, he got it. I saw the rogue who killed Brands and Feralus cutting sea giants to quest giver. He almost killed a priest like that. Oh, so he's like a griefer? I figured. I mean, if a level 60 rogue is sitting on the uh, Gurubashi Arena thing, he's probably a griefer, right? Let's be honest. But I will t say, though, that clip was still quite funny. That I, I think it was just how it happened with Brands that made it funny. Like, it, it was just so weirdly perfect timing. What's up, Mana Screw? How you doing, man? Mushy, mushy. What do you think you'll do Sulfurite today? 
Not in so long. I, th I think in like an hour or two. I t I'm more, probably more two hours. Yeah, I want to do a little bit of uh, Tanaris first. Did someone just die here? Or did they just de acro these mobs? Oh, shit. Oh, that's, a, that's an NPC mob. Okay. Yo, you good? Oh, he's over there. Okay, he's good. He's good, he's good. My member gets real level 15. Is he really? He's 46. He's not 15, he's 46. That's at least what it says. You know what? You may be wrong, Lenguini, but I like that you were confident in being wrong. <laughs> you know, confidence is very important in life. Let's bring out Diablo. Oh my gosh. Uh, why don't you bring Jablo on your adventures? I have him. I have him out. Have some buffs, mate. Uh, do you have the mallet? No. The, you, you got a solo like a mob in, in Hinterlands that's like level 50 or 51. Like up here in an outsurf tool. And I. An elite mob six levels higher than me is a little bit sketchy, I think. Yeah, that's like a little bit much for me. So, you know, 45, I feel pretty comfortable doing into, into Sulfurac. We can always go back into Sulfurac later on, you know. Alright, this is the thing we're here to get. This is the thing we're here to get. The thing is, man, I remember doing this quest. I freaking remember it. I just didn't remember what quest it was, but I, I recall going down to that spring and picking it up. Yeah. We'll probably go back to STV at level 46, I think, maybe. And then we, we can do, like, my Soth cracking Mari's foot. We can do, like, the captain's chest and stranglehorn fever and stuff. There's a few of those I want to get done. Cat form, no damage. Oh, okay. Dude, Pat McGroin says he's gonna go try to get the mallet at level 46. Bro... Pat McGrath, if you get the mallet, bro, I'll bring you, man. 46 trying to solo that shit is scary. Cheetah's cat, too. No, if if I'm in cheetah form, I I, I think I do still take uh, damage. Also, Boston, good to see you, man. My brother... The carrot, if you don't have the mount. Yeah, I mean, why bother with the carrot? Well, I am gonna get a mount. I mean, I, I'm, I'm almost at mount money now. So I, I do want to have a mount, like, for, for like, the stuff we just did, like, lo long distance travel, it's nice having a mount for that, you know? I had the best chest pump I've ever had and it feels amazing. Getting a pump in the gym is uh, one of the most satisfying feelings you can have in the world. Yeah, true. How are you gonna get the true silver bar? I actually already had true silver bars earlier, but... I sold it because I didn't think I would have to do any anything with true silver bars, so I vendored it. But you can get true silver bars from chests, right? So I I feel comfortable. I can I can get one. Yeah. Yeah, Sulfurac, or uh, we're gonna head to uh, Feralas and Tenaris, and there's gonna be a lot of chests there too, right? Yeah. So I think we should be okay. Right, let's go back to Westfall, and then this should lead us also into Dust uh, Swamp of Sorrows. I could item restore, yeah. Yeah, I I, I could item restore. Do you be automatically when you do try to breathe where the mouth is you keep your tongue when you don't speak? Oh, I don't really breathe automatically, I don't think about that. <laughs> Getting a pump is like coming. Okay, I don't know why I read that. Uh, someone got a link to Secret Stream yesterday, the Makura. Uh, I think his VOD is not live. Yeah, I, I think his VOD is, uh... He, he hasn't, like, published it or whatever. Yeah, so, I don't know. It'll probably live at some point, right? <laughs> Fuck, Grayson? Hey, Tornskull. Why do you hate Grayson that much? What, what, what has Grayson done to you, man? Druid Petri. We did watch the Druid Petri clip. Yeah, we watched this. We saw this earlier. 
Can I like change a few gear pieces? Because this rogue has tier we 05 saw, we, we saw the end of this. Gear. This rogue literally has Stratholm and Skoloman's gear and tier 05 gear. And he has like a bow from ZG. And a 60% mount. This druid has a ZG Raptor. Oh, he catches him out of form. Yeah. And this druid unboomed in the duel. Yeah. They both said they weren't going to use any, any buffs in the duel. The rogue's got him. He's got him in the kidney. Oh my god, the title charm! No way! And he pitried. Wait, what? Wait, what happened? Yeah. Wait, what happened? What a puso druid, actually. What happened? He petrid? He petrid! Yeah. He petrid all that for? Does he get coward? Yeah. It seems like a smart decision. I mean, it's a little bit of a puso mood. A move, a move if you do a Makara, you know? I don't resent Grayson. His only call to fame is being disliked and having eight fight with the chat. I don't know if that is either that or McDonald's. Oh, that's like a little bit rude, Varexis. A little bit rude, you know? Each streamer can do their stream how they like to do their stream, right? You know? Build up your stream with what you want to do and then uh, go from there, right? You, what is that, what is that, the, the wording? You sleep in the bed that you made? The bed that you, I don't know, you, you, I think you understand what I'm trying to convey, right? You made the bed so you sleep in it. The way you made it. Made your bed so you lie in it. Yeah, <laughs> whatever. Now, man bad, therefore man licker. Yeah, exactly. You reap what you sow. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe. Something like that. That's how it goes. Uh, exactly, exactly. All right, let's go down here. Man, I've never done this full quest chain. Funny. How can I join your guild? You need to be above level 10 and uh, on the hardcore server, obviously. I don't envy him for the bet he made, so I don't add to the abuse. That's fair enough, yeah. Yeah, I I, 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 I mean, we've had this conversation a few times before, but I, I wouldn't want... I, I I don't know, man. Some people don't care about it. Some people don't mind it, like, being, like, a, the target for, like, a, you know, the memes and shit. But, man, I wouldn't enjoy that day-to-day, -day for sure. If I was just sitting getting abused, you know. But, hey, some people are into that shit, you know? It is what it is. It is what it is. Oh, we'll pick up supplies for Netherguard when we head into this place too. So we'll fly to we'll fly to west uh, to Duskwood, and we can pick up that quest on the way too. Is Mordiel doing OnlyFangs? I don't know if she wants to. Uh, if she's if she wants to do it, uh, you know, she can for sure do it. But yeah, it's it's hard with with raid spots in OnlyFangs. I think I think there's gonna be a ton of streamers in OnlyFangs that probably don't get to do the raids, especially if there's only one big raid team. Because it seems to me, dude, I'm I'm in the OnlyFangs Discord. And there are like 20 people joining the Discord per day. Yeah. How many members are in this Discord? There is almost 300 people in the Discord. Yeah. Almost 300 people in the Discord. So it's gonna be quite tight with that, but you know. Talk to me, sweet Work Amber. Hiki hop, ho ho! You want an encore in the land of the south with the vines twist and creep? Lines a hidden well where the water runs deep. That's what we did. Hiki hop, ho ho! Watch your back. Amber is the hue of my life's longest love, like the last embers of dusk in the sky above. Retrieve to me so that my love shall be born. One sack of each barley, rye, and corn. With you. Dude, he's literally making a freaking poem about drinking beer. Be good. How it's how it's his greatest love. Like, what is this? All right. Okay, so what was it? It was amber, rye, and corn. So there's amber up in hinterlands. There's. Wasn't there something in Swamp of Sorrows? Oh, barley in Swamp of Sorrows. And then corn in Tanaris. Yeah. So I say we just go get the stuff first here. I don't think we're gonna like speed run getting this because I don't even have the true silver bar yet. You know, if we manage to get the true silver bar, we can speed run the rest of the quest. But yeah. We do need to go here later anyway. Alright. 
I say we just go pick up the stuff here. And then we go to Dust Willow. We pick up the stuff there. And then we're shilling. And maybe I should should have gotten the freaking other part of that quest. Am I cell phoned? I am. <laughs> Thank you for reminding me. You're welcome. Coins for clouds. Thank you for the tier one. Do, 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 do. Why does he want to leave the corn from the desert? I don't know. Maybe they have like special corn there. Oh, was there ding level 60? Bob Ross means his ding level 60 in the How guild. Are you? Congrats, dude. See you around. Level 60. Why are you leveling in Westfall level 44? There's a quest here. There's like a quest chain that gives you a trinket. So I, I'm just starting the quest chain, right? Yeah, I'm just starting it. Bro, I'm doing so many random quests. The, these quests are not really uh, efficient <laughs> for leveling, but I think it's fun. I think it's fun just like doing some random quest chains like the leecher out of the world. You know, it's a vibe. If you get a trinket and use chili food, then go alchemy for fire damage potion. Oh yeah, I would actually do a lot of damage then. I would do like hella AoE. Emulation pot and shit. Is Meltorius one of the achievements? Yeah, I think you gotta do him before 56. So we have quite a, a lot of levels to get before that, right? Which is fine. No. How is life without coffee? Yeah, I haven't drank coffee now for like three or four weeks. It's a bit weird. I, I, I do find myself wanting to have some coffee sometimes in the mornings, but... Uh, I've just if I had if I've had that feeling I've just kind of drank a, gla a cup of tea or something like that instead and it's been fine Yeah, I, I decided a few weeks back to stop drinking coffee because I didn't really enjoy the way it felt I feel like I got a little bit like Anxious kind of and like my jittery. I don't know. I didn't feel very good drinking coffee. So I decided not to do it anymore So I, if, if I really want something like caffeine or something, I, I just have a cup of tea or something You know How's my energy levels? Quite good, actually. Greetings. Be careful. They're, they're quite good. Uh, I'm pretty uh, pretty pretty stoked about it. It's nice. All right, let's head into Keep Dust Velo. So we got the Nether Guard Keep quest. We can do the Cotillo's Riddle, and then we can go do the Bar Barley. I don't think I'm gonna do the Driftwood. Actually, we fucking we, sorry, we freaking could. Cause we're here anyway. We just need to go down the beach and then pick up a bunch of wood. Let's do it. Let's do it. Coffee is not bad for you. One cup of coffee is actually fine. Yeah, I know. I, I know it's not a horrible thing because I, I would drink coffee black anyway. I would just like take a cup of coffee and drink it black. But I just didn't like, I, I didn't feel like good afterwards. You know, I, I felt like kind of jittery and like anxious a bit. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to stop drinking this now. Okay. Yeah, that's fair, Shoroshi. And I, it, it's not like I'm gonna, like, cut out coffee forever, you know, like, in, in my life. It's not like I'm never gonna have coffee ever again. But I just don't want to drink it daily, right? I If I want to have, like, a cup of coffee once in a while, I'll do it. Eventually, I'll probably just have a cup of coffee before gym. And then on my off days from the gym, I won't drink it. I think that's how I'll end up doing it. Yeah. How strong were you making it? Not that strong. I'm just, I think I'm just sensitive to caffeine, Dr. Brahim. I think I'm just quite sensitive to it. Yeah, I think I'll just like have one before I go to the gym and then that's it. Are you drinking instant coffee? No, 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 no. I, 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 eat, I either ground my own coffee or I made like some, uh, I mean, Serbian, Turkish style coffee, whatever it's called. Okay. Uncaffeine coffee better than normal is. Yeah, that's fair. Doo -doo -doo. Ain't good on an empty stomach, that's for sure. Yeah. How much do you bench? Not very much, man. I'm I'm working my way up to 100 kilo bench press. If my trajectory for uh, uh, for um, progression should be keeping up to date with how it's been, I should be getting my first 100 kilo bench press in nine weeks. Yeah. All right, well, once we're here, we gotta watch out a little bit for the guards. Because if we... 
Ah, these guys, the scouts, rather. Because if we aggro these, we get PvP flagged, and I don't want to get PvP flagged. What's my overhead press record? Uh, I can probably overhead press like 50 kilos right now. So, not, not bad, actually. Pretty good. Okay. Sitting or standing? Standing. Standing overhead press. String drains are not linear. Yeah, that's why I'm saying if it keeps going like it is right now. We don't know if it will, right? It, it probably is going to slow down quite a lot because I'm, I'm still kind of like getting my rookie gains in, right? So, there we go. Uh, solve the riddle. Okay, so this quest leads you to Dustweller Marsh. Now we need to go pick up the Driftwood quest and then we can go to the eastern part and get those done. I'm just really happy to be uh, be consistent with the gym. Is overhead press like military press? Uh, yeah, it, it's just standing and you have a barbell and you just push it up, right? You just push up the barbell. So yeah, it, 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 essentially. Uh, okay. Might as well pick up the Driftwood quest. What is this? Four years ago? What is this nonsense? In front or behind? In front, in front. She looks so young, man. What the heck? Four years ago. Kurats, okay. Hello, can I please have a kurats? Oh, yeah. Let's not watch those clips, okay? Uh. Alright, uh, let's avoid the scouts. Actually, I'll just go this way. Let's go this way. You were just the boy? Boy. Yeah. Lots have happened in the past six years, man. It's crazy. What a what what a what a ride it's been, man. What's up, Momsen, by the way? Hope you're doing great. Alright, so let's pick up we'll just go start from the south, pick up all the driftwood all the way up, and then we're gonna go get the barley, right? Mm, yeah, this is good. This is good. Oppa. You know what? I was gonna sneak past behind Stoneard, but on <coughs> On second thought, you know what? Let's go around. Yeah? The package quest is not on a timer, no. No, it's not on a timer. You can do it whenever you want. I freaking hate Swamp of Sorrows. I, I actually hate this zone. Also, as Alliance. I, I mean, even as Horde, it's horrible, but... Absolutely horrendous place, man. There's those scouts walking around everywhere. There's that freaking dragon on the eastern side. Like, horrible zone. It's an ugly zone. Yeah, it's also just depressing, right? It's like a depressing zone, man. No, we can do dungeons. We can do dungeons. We've been doing lots of dungeons along the way. Yeah, look at that. Freaking. Oh, I thought it was a scout. Why are you here? Because uh, I'm doing a quest. I only go here really for like the few quests there is and I go out again. I don't I don't really stay here for too long, right? So Yeah. Stone Art Explorer, there he is. Second moon the versus someone after Brill. Dude, Brill goes hard. Have you heard the music in Brill? Goes hard, dude. Yeah, okay. Ooh. Dick to phone. 42 warrior hanging out here. Is that an undead? I think it's an undead, yeah. Yeah, if the scout hits you, you go PvP, exactly. There's a lot of war uh, horde leveling today. See, a, a bunch of horde players everywhere. Onkeku! Okay, so the barley should be right here. Yes! Barley! Nice! Cool, Saga Barley, there we go. Let's go pick up the Driftwood, and then we are good here in Swarm of Sorrows. Seiko Survivors, yeah, Seiko has been doing so many Makarovs, man. He's just been farming it. Did you get the Crawl Palm Alert? Bro, I did my seventh run today, Irits. Irits, no Crawl Palm Alert still. Yep. Yeah, Somnus is around here, guys. This whole eastern part, look, 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 heat map. Down here, you see a bunch of deaths. That's because that dragon that patrols around there can kill people, right? What's up, Shiro? 
yeah, I'm still using that mind timer, bro. I've tried every day, but in the in the end, it doesn't even matter. Dude, these crocodiles are freaking big, by the way. All right, let me get some of this wood. Some wood for the boys. Why are we even getting wood? Sun-dried driftwood in a and it's just lying in water. Good job, Blizzard. <laughs> Good job. Man, my quest log is so all over the place. Like, look at this quest log. Oh, he's trying to get driftwood to solve his wagon so he can get to Netherguard Keep. Yeah. Is the guild cell phone only? No, the guild is just for anyone that wants to join and be a part of the community and have people to talk to while leveling and stuff. I'm not the one who made the guild, that was Enyo, but I've just kind of become the poster child for the guild and we have it for the community, so that's pretty much it. How many shots are there nowadays? Last time I played there was two. Are you talking about layers? There are... Uh, depends on the day. On, on reset days, there's actually only one layer. So there's only one layer today. Which is probably why we're going to see a lot more players around the world. Okay. Will I do Jintha Alor? Mm, I don't know. Jintha Alor is not as lucrative for Alliance as it, as it is for Horde. But maybe I'll do a few of the quests there. We'll see. Alright, Blizzard. Thank you. Should be okay, though. We're, we're almost done with the Swim of Sorrows. I'm just gonna. I'm just picking up the wood, and then I'm done. I'm gonna move out after this. Had nine layers on Tuesday. That's crazy. That's actually an insane amount of layers. What level do you think you do Sulfurak? I think 45. I think Sulfurak is is quite around the corner right now. I'm just gonna. I'm doing a little bit of questing, and then we're doing Sulfurak. Yeah, it's just a little bit more questing, and it'll be okay. Good freaking snapper there. Holy shit. You get this from Jinta Alorm? Ooh, yeah, if I can save Shark Beak, ooh, that'd be nice. True. That would actually be nice. Alright, let's go back and turn this quest in. Then we can go to Netherguard Keep, turn in the quest there, and then we can head over to Dustwellow. Yeah, and we're almost done with like all the running around the areas we're doing right now. We'll probably we'll probably finish off Feralas. That we, the Feralas quest that we started, and then we're gonna we're gonna start heading over to Sulfurac. How am I feeling today? I'm uh, feeling pretty okay, man. Feeling pretty okay. Just chilling, dude. You know, playing the video game, having a good time. Oh, did I not ping up the Pen Peranoldi Tiara of the Deep? I need to pick that up. Yeah. Feeling pretty okay. And my body has kind of gotten used to waking up early now. Like, I'm, I'm getting there now with it. And it's it's like, it's becoming more routine for me. So, you know, it's nice. That mace has been with you for ages. Bro, how lucky is it I even got this mace? I've used this for like, freaking, I don't know, almost like 30 levels now. Have I done this creature spirit quest for Solverek? No, but I need to do that before we do it. Yeah, I need to go do the creature spirit quest. I'll probably pick that up before we head into to Feral last today. Oh my god, can we s fucking a? Yeah, I saw the very end of that duel, uh, Nexor, with uh, Seiko. We did we didn't get to watch the full duel because uh, the VOD isn't available. So I can't see the VOD, but we watched the, the, the end clip of it, right, where the, 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 the Druid Petriot out. Okay. Don't forget achievement. Oh, yeah, uh, we gotta do Cotello's Riddle at 46. Yeah, Cotello's Riddle... No, not Cotello's Riddle, uh, Cuerco's Gold. We have to get, get Cuerco's Gold from the pirates in Tenaris, and we have to go do that quest at the southern part of the island before level 46. So, next level we have an achievement we're doing. Oh, you got that hammer from a random mob? Holy shit. That's a nice hammer. The 
The Druid is a known griefer on the realm as well. Good riddance. Oh, the Druid is like a griefer? Uh, well, there you go, I guess. Almost crazy how, like, uh, the griefer is, like, uh, not really that a good pvp -er, but, you know. Literally full best-in-slot feral druid loses to a pre rogue. Okay. He got a 72-hour debuff, yeah. He camps in Swamp of Sorrows, waiting for people to get PvP flagged. Bro, it's... I mean, dude... Is that even fun? Like, bro, I'm, I'm just thinking, like, I mean, he, I mean, it, seemed, it must be fun since they're doing it, but, like, you're just sitting and waiting for someone to get flagged so you can one-shot them. And you're just spending all day doing that. I mean, they must enjoy it since they're doing it, right? So, you know. Okay. This is vanilla rogue gameplay right there. Yeah, a lot of people play this game to grief. There we go, Driftwood. And now we got two quests to turn in in Nethergard Keep. Yeah, double quest. Nice. It feels so good whenever you get to line up a few quests together and get like double XP. It feels like you're almost cheating. It's so nice. Which one to keep my highest level two in yet? Yeah, it is, you know. Vanilla WoW is a game that attracts a lot of people that like like disrupting other people's gameplay. You know, so happens a lot. You go to Tenerus to pick up the other part for the Trinket quest. We go to Theramore because after both quests, you need you to Hinterlands. Yeah, 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 yeah. So what what's the quest here? I gotta go to Hinterlands, and I gotta go to. I, I'm gonna go get the corn as we're picking up the creature quest, just so we have that done. Yeah, this is where freaking Theramore is. Yeah, the druid in the duel unboomed every single world buff in the game as well, I heard. I've watched Sword Art Online. I, I watched a few episodes, but uh, not, not uh, the full thing. Okay. Yeah, chat, I don't care about discussing politics in this stream, okay? There's gonna be a lot of uh, streamers going live later if you wanna talk about uh, the politics and stuff. Can you show the trinket you're gonna get from the quest? It. I, I can't. Sh I, I don't have a link for it right now, but it's a uh, trinket that does like make you belch fire in front of you. It's called Sweet Amber. The quest chain. Sweet Amber. It's a quest chain that starts in uh, Westfall. Man, I wish I had that true silver bar. I don't want to recover it, but yeah. Okay. What can I do for you? Life bless you. There the we alliance. go, and there Be we careful. go. Nice! Like 6k XP almost. Good stuff. So now I guess we just fly to... Yeah, I just fly to Booty Bay and then we take the, the flight pad. Oh, we take the boat to Ratchet. Yeah. The star and the hammer. Wait. Quest is there. Quest is there. I have quests everywhere right now. Okay. Let's just go down to uh, Booty Bay. There it is. Censorship at its highest. No, I just don't care to talk politics in a stream that is about video games. I don't think everything has to be about real life and the politics and uh, news and uh, everything. It's not about censoring what we're doing. It's just about I don't care to talk about it in my chat. Yeah, just don't care to talk about it. Okay. Mm -mm -mm -mm. There is plenty of streamers that's gonna talk about it all day. So if you wanna go vent your frustrations about something, go do it there, okay? Your stream, no rules? Yeah, I'm not here to get my, my takes on political drama and political stuff. I'm just here to play a video game and talk about beef jerky. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> yeah, we, play about, we play video games and we talk about the beef jerky. You know, it is what it is. All right. 
What should say again? Norwegian brown cheese. Listen, man. Okay, I, I don't hate brown cheese. It's not like I have a big uh, problem with it. I just don't think it's very nice. I just don't think it's like a super delicious thing. Man, I'm thinking if I want to do the start of the hand of the heart quest, but it doesn't really give us anything crazy. It gives us like the skull of impending doom, but it's more like a PvP thing. I think for now I gotta just focus on prepping for uh, Sulfurak, I think. Yeah, yeah. That's the move. That's the meme. What about blue cheese? I actually haven't had blue cheese since I was a kid. I remember I didn't like it when I was a kid, but I haven't had it since then. Maybe my palate has changed, right? I mean, it has. I hate it personally. Blue cheese is awesome. I actually do want to try it at some point, just to see if I would like it. Because I, I do like a lot more food that I like nowadays than I didn't when I was a kid, obviously. Mm hmm. You will like it? It's an age thing? Yeah, probably. It's one of those things where you get used to it when you're older, right? Blue cheese with broccoli is such a good combo. Really? Dude, broccoli actually goes hard, man. You can use it in so many ways, dude. I made like a... Um, I made like a really, really good... Like pasta, dude, where you get like some freaking broccoli and you blend it into like a little sauce with some uh, some cream and some cheese and shit, and you you put it into the you put it into the pasta, man. It's so nice, dude. Collateral chatter. No, he's good. He's good. You ate that yesterday? Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. I can't have Prime on mobile. I don't know. I I, th I think there's some link you have to use to use your Prime on, on phone. Blue cheese and ginger bit is bit uh, of a Oh yeah, we, I gotta do some Christmas cooking soon. I usually do like a... I have like a... Tradition with my mom. I, I go to her house and we bake Christmas cookies. We're gonna do that at the end of November, man. It's gonna be hype. I feel bad for you getting timed on, on yesterday just for offering a great deal on your merch. Wait, why did you get timed out, Coherent? Oh, you're the one asking me to have your way with your girlfriend. Yeah, because that's a weird fucking message to put in a chat. That's why you got timed out. Yeah, it's because you typed a really weird ass message. You know? Won't happen again. That's good. <laughs> that, that's good. English cheese over blue cheese? English cheese. Mm. Oh, there's no shot on making that boat, right? Yeah, there ain't no way. Or, unless I have sprint? Oh, I think we're gonna... Oh, there's a fellow rogue sprinting as well. No, dude, come on. Shit. Whatever. All right, we're gonna have to wait a little bit. It's fine. Actually, I can clean up my bags while we wait. Why not? Let's go clean up the bags. Ah, <sighs> it's fine. It's fine. Just uh, you know, clean out the bags, eh? Well met. Actually, you can buy a big stick here. For the Where's alliance. the stick at? Let me take a look. Time is money, friend. Ironwood. Mo oh, he doesn't have it for sale. He. This guy can sell a big stick that you can use. I'm gonna just vendor these. Salt, we don't need that. Sesty clam meat, no. I'll keep the wicked claws. Banana bread. I'll vendor these. I got so many good healing potions now. It's not even a problem. Leather bag, we're gonna vendor that. We're gonna get some more bags later anyway. I can sell these and then just make some more. Have a good and then one. we're good. Ba ba ba. Okay. There it is. Okay, landing up the firing squad today. What the heck, man? <laughs> Thank God I'm an early morning streamer, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Later today is gonna be a shit show on Twitch. All right, very cool, very cool. Did you do no more again today? Uh, I did, and I didn't get it, man. I've, dude, I've tried for seven days in a row now to get the crowd pummeler. 
Yeah, ever since level 30, we've tried, and we're 44 now. Ugh. It doesn't want to drop, dude. It doesn't want to freaking drop. Could I make some food here, actually, as well? I could make mystery stew. What the fuck? Who would eat this? Uh, toast raptor, no. I need some more sack flames. Small flax slicks, whatever they're called. I need some more of those. What does the pummeler do? It's just a better weapon. Like, first of all, it's just a better weapon than what I have. It's five more strength, it's one more agi, and then it has the, the proc. It has, not the proc, it has the unuse, which is a three charge unuse with 50% attack speed for 30 seconds. Which also works in cat form and also burr, right? So it's just a really good weapon. It's just, it's just good. It's the best weapon you can get as a druid, honestly. Yeah. It's gonna drop next time you do no more, just wage. Wait, yeah, true. Do you know Olsen Band was made up in Norway? You're just. That's actually rage bait. You're actually rage baiting, and I will not stand for it. It only has three charges. Still is the best weapon. Loving the HC content again. Let's Thank you. have a great day. You have a fantastic day, and I will try to have one too. Okay. Do do do. Am I Norwegian? I'm Danish. You have a great day too, Rumsrum. Maybe maybe just like time them out for like a week or something like that. No no no. Just give them like a week. You know. Yeah, give, give them like a week or so. If if they're if the people are like trying to bait some stuff, you don't don't have to perma them, just give them a week. Give them a week, right? Because may, maybe it's just some people memeing, but I, I don't want to like just, you know, they're, 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 the memes turned into like the chat turning into something else, right? Just, just like give them a week. Or if you feel if you if you really don't like them, give them a month, okay? Barsh, what's up, mate? Yeah. Permanents are funny, though. Nah, because, like, you know, I I think I have too... I, I, I'm too soft, you know? But give them a week. Give them a month if you really don't like them, you know? Or 14 days. I think that's good. I had to yell down the GG at 5 a.m. yesterday. Oh, gosh. Esme, what, what kind of... You're like an alien, man. How are you... Did You woke up at 5 a.m., right? What are the pros and cons living in Sweden, in, in Denmark? Um, pros is that, you know, amazing, amazing uh, school system, really good people, you know, great, uh, great, great, uh, great nature, awesome, um, just all around awesome everything. Cons? Your neighbors with Sweden? Yeah. That's what I would say. That's it. <laughs> that's a big one though okay that's a big con eh? <laughs> no, so it's, it's a big drawback on that one all right yeah 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 jesus what about norway i like norway man i listen i i, I can tolerate sweden all right um Um There you go. There you go. Just stopping something guys, sorry about that. Some business. A fancy here to do. Zico's gonna makura you for saying that. Yeah, probably true man. Zico is a powerful man, dude. Alright, he's a powerful man. I didn't expect it. Yeah. Leo Pustai and the Dude, I like that, dude. That's really good. Alright, so I think when we get a rat shit, we kind of just run down, right? I could do this part of the Star of the Heart. Yeah, I actually could do it. We just need some sea kelp and then kill like a, a mob, right? Yeah, I do want to do the other parts too. But. Since we're in Dust Willow, we'll see. We need to kill a bunch of Murlocs and get some stuff. Oh, Mo crashes is up, guys. Oh, shit. Hercules! Come out, Hercules! 
God damn. You think the food tastes bad in Denmark? I bro, come on man, dude. We have good cuisine in Denmark. We got potatoes, we got freaking meat, we got the the gravy, man. You don't like the gravy, dude? Shit. Ooh, could I just jump here? Bro, it's crazy. I'm actually scared. Not because of like, I know I'm gonna, uh, I think I'm gonna die. It's just, look, look at this. Oh, it's so deep. Oh my God. <laughs> it's just so deep, man. Like I, I really have a problem with like deep sea. Like I know there's nothing down there. It's just, you know, but it's just like the fact that it's so far down freaks me out. Yeah, it just freaks me out. Subnautica playthrough win. I actually beat Subnautica back when it came out and whenever they're doing Subnautica 2, which is in 2025, we are going to do a playthrough. Yes, we are. We're gonna play Subnautica 2 in 2025. I am absolutely horrified of the deep sea. But I'm also fascinated by it. So we're definitely gonna do it. Co-op? I'm not sure. I don't know yet. We'll see. Maybe. I mean, that's, I don't know, half a year from now, whatever, whenever they release it. It's such a good game. It really is. It's like an unintentional horror game, right? I didn't play the Quiet Place game, though. I didn't play it. Yeah, I thought it's called Thalassophobia, exactly. It's like a, a, a fear of, like, deep, dark oceans. Go up with Savix. Freaking Savix, man. Dude, he, he's calling me late night a lot lately on stream and asking me a lot of really weird personal questions. And I'm like about to head to bed. I'm like sitting there like falling asleep in my chair, man. Not yet, Boston. No, not yet. I do need to do it though, actually. I'm gonna try not to do too long of a stream today, I think. I've, I've really been pushing the envelope a little bit too long with it. Because I haven't cleaned my house, dude. I'm so behind on everything in my freaking house, man. I keep telling myself, you know what, I'm gonna do a short stream today and I can actually get my IRL stuff sorted so we can like get back on the schedule with the variety gaming too. But bro, I keep just playing way longer than I thought, okay? And I keep doing like 8 hour streams, 9 hour streams, 10 hour streams. I'm just a bit too addicted to, uh, to, the, to, to, to the game I think, it's fun man. Fire pit soon? Yeah bro, I wanna get a fire pit in my garden, yeah. You live with your mother in her basement? Can't she clean for you? I actually live in uh, in my own house. Believe it or not. I live in my own house. Yeah. I do. With your mom. What, not, with, not with your mom. What the heck? Okay, so all these murlocs can drop the kelp. Enchanted sea kelp. And then this sea kelp you use to summon a level 43 elite. Which we're gonna go take a look at right now i think it's all the ah. Uh, i think it's the oracles it's only the oracles that can drop it yeah so these guys we need to kill right you could just get lucky and get it first try Fuck, that would have been so cool wouldn't it <laughs> that would have been so cool all right what about second try Oh shit, alright. Well, I guess uh, we'll start the timer. The classic timer has been started. We'll see how long it takes us to get this, guys. Oh, a chest! We could get true silver from here. Yeah. No way to stop the heal, sadly. You can get an or or pair or or you know, like a maid. No, I don't like the idea behind having someone clean my house for me. I don't know. I know a lot of streamers do that shit. I think it's kind of weird, dude. Like, I don't know, man. Like, having someone, like, go around my house and clean up for me. Like, like, it's not that bad, my, my, my house. Like, it's not that messy, okay? Like, sometimes, yeah, it's a little bit messy in the kitchen and stuff, but, you know, it's not that bad where I need someone to clean up for me, you know? Let me check the chest here. Yeah. It's not about messy, it's about time saving. 
Yeah, I, I mean, don't get me wrong, I get it. I do get it why they do it, but it's like... I, I, I don't mind just cleaning, dude. Just cleaning up my... It's, it feels good when you're done, right? And it also feels like my house then, right? I'm cleaning up my house, dude, okay? I know I made a mess, so I clean it up. Yeah. Oh, wait, that was really freaking fast, by the way. That took us a minute and a half to get that. Okay, that was... <laughs> what the... Okay. I'll take it. Oh, well, there it is. That's really... Oh, I got another one. What the f... <laughs> I got two of them. All right. We're, we're actually going above what you what you normally get. That's kind of crazy. All right. You back from the police station? Wait, are, are you being arrested or something, Major? What's going on? Okay. All right. So let's summon the big boy. Yeah, let's summon the big boy here, dude. This is for a uh, quest where we're gonna get a bunch of stuff around the world. Um, yeah, summon Dagun. I would like to... Heal myself? Oh, there he is, there he is. Actually, I'll... Oh, I didn't know he was like all the... I didn't know he came from there. Dagun the Ravenous. Okay. Okay, I'll just regrowth myself and rejuve. Get a little bit of my mana back. Go cat form and we can start shredding him. Okay. How much does he hurt? Oh, he actually kind of hurts. Think we should be able to get a nice shred off though. Yes, 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 yes. Dude, we're fine. Something I want to do now is I want to pop bark skin so I don't get like pushback on my regrowth. Pop this here, pop my little thing, do a little one of those, and then go bear form. Yes! Bark skin is so dope, dude. I want to stealth up with hot sum, just blast. I think you're right, honestly. I think I'll start mauling him. Yeah. This ain't, even, this ain't even a problem, bro. What's your armor percentage? Uh, this is my armor. 74... No, what did I just say? 47.8% armor reduction. Insane, dude. Or like uh, damage reduction. There we go. That's easy as fuck. So, we got that done, which is nice. Now we just need to go get the... Cotelo's Riddle all the way down there. So a little bit of a journey now. The goon runs in fear, what a puzo. True. Just check my left. It's like when you're crossing the uh, intersection, guys. You're crossing the street. You watch for the shark. Eh? You you watch for the coral shark. Yep, yep, yep. Bear vibes in chat. Oh, we like the bear vibes, dude. We like the bear vibes. Is there a slash dance in the water form? I don't think there is. No. Uh, okay, there we go. Nice. Yeah, who's this? Oh, it's a troll. There's a lot of hard players lately. Yeah, a lot of hard players. Give this guy some of this. Hey, Guzu. Hello. It was a hawker moment for that was one of the mages in the group where the tank jumps first and the dies to fall damage. Oh, is the one in... Do you mean the one in Marauden? Flutzi? I was so confused about that one. I think it's because he bugged, right? The one where he... Uh, in Marauden where he fell down, right? Yeah, I think he like bugged through the floor or some shit. Really odd. Really, really odd. I actually have Ironforge off cooldown again now. But it's fine. Bing, bong, bang, and a boom. Lately, Classic Era has been full with players, and it has been fun to see. I, I I think, in general, right now, Vanilla is just really hyped. Like, people are just playing hardcore, they're playing Era, they're just loving it. Yeah. There, there seems to be, like, a big interest in, in Vanilla lately.
which is cool. You know, I I, I love it. I'm I'm a I'm a vanilla enjoyer. Bing bong bang and a boom. Hardcore hype. It's a cycle. Yeah, it it does kind of happen like that. You know the. Vanilla hype comes and goes. Like it, it, like every like few years, there's like a big influx of players wanting to play again. You got rank 14 in classic era. It was annoying, dude. Rank 14, bro. Don't 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 even don't even get me started. Will you make me breakfast tomorrow? Maybe. I'm not much of a breakfast person, but I'll try. I know I'll try. You did rank 14. I did. Yeah, I did. I did it in 2019 Classic, and uh, I think it changed me a bit inside. It w I, I think it was a tipping point for a lot of uh, decisions in my life. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> do you have time to walk the dogs before Sulfurag? Oh, for sure. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I need to do some stuff in Feralize first. I need to do these quests down here. So Sulfurag won't be before an hour's time, I think, realistically. Yeah, I, I think in around an hour, probably. A little bit more. We'll do a soul frack, so we we got time, we got time, no worries. I'm not gonna adopt you, Brick. Brick, we're almost the same age. I'm not gonna adopt you. You're you're a grown man. Where's Japlo again? Bro, I forgot about him. I'm so sorry. Yeah. What? You're not 40? Bro, you're like 21 or something. Dude, trust me, okay? And I'm, I, I sound like an old boomer, man. But when you reach your 20s, you're gonna, it's gonna be a blink and you're 30. Okay? And you're, you're not even gonna like look around and suddenly you're 30, bro. Okay? It's fucking it's weird, man. Like time flies by. It's so crazy. Yeah, I'm in my mid-30s now. I don't feel like I'm 29. I'm, I'm from 1995. I don't feel like... Because like when I was a kid, right? It was like, oh, you're 30, man. You're, you're, you're like one foot at the grave, man. But like, I don't feel like 29, dude. I, I, I don't know. I feel like I'm still like around 20 like or so. Damn. Okay, guys, come on. <laughs> 29 is young, dude. What the hell? What do I do after I go down here? Do I, I think I just run to Theramore and fly. Yeah. I'm 31, but I feel 20 still. Yeah, you're officially old when you tell your young people when, when you get to my age. That's true. That's true. Elaine, wow, 88. You're probably, what, like 35 then? Yeah. 35 or 36? You're 36? Yeah. Craziest thing is, man, my older brother, my, my oldest brother is 35. I think. Yeah, he's 35. And I'm like, damn. My brother is almost 40. That is insane to me. That's so crazy. I'm like, wow. Holy moly. I remember being a kid and like cutting out like cutting out like magazines with like st stuff on it and under like I don't know. I remember like that's yeah, crazy. It's crazy. That's so insane. My oldest sister is 44. It's crazy. She's more immature than her daughter. Yeah, you get a. I think you get a different perspective on on life and like stuff because older people they aren't like old people. They're still like young at heart, right? They're they're just, you know, you just get older. It is what it is. Okay. Nice little stealthy boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yep. We're in here, we're in here. Dude, these raptors are actually fucking massive, by the way. Beep beep. Okay. Stealth is so nice, dude. It's so sick. I love it. Just being able to like sneak past a bunch of mobs and then like going straight for the for the cash money prize is, is really nice. Yeah, Druid feel Druid almost feels like a hero class in some ways. With all that movement speed you got and like just being able to travel so fast. Is that a rogue? Oh, it is a rogue. Oh my gosh. Hello? You want a little buff or something? Oh, you're also doing the little riddle. My love for this stream. Well, I'm glad you like it here. I'm glad. Musty scroll. 
And this is for Hinterlands. No. Yeah, Hinterlands. Cool. Let's go. And now we gotta stop by... Yeah, Tenaris. Tenaris now. So the plan right now is go to Theramore, fly down to uh, Feralas, run into Tenaris, pick up the quest that leads us into Feralas, then go down, pick up the sack of corn, finish off Feralas, and then we're doing Sulfurak. Okay? Also, let's pick up the Paranoldi ti Tiara, uh, or Tiara of the Deep, because this is a quest for Feralas, too, or for Sulfurak, too. Isn't there also a quest in Ironforge? Uh... Tierra of the Deep. Baba. We don't need that's a prequest, but you don't need it. I didn't make Nightscape armor. I have Raptor Hunter Tunic, so. Heal the Raptor on the left? No, I don't think it has anything on it, man. It hit me when my doctor and my accountant is younger than me. Damn! That's crazy, yeah. I don't know, I, I, I'm i not like, um, I'm not like dooming about it. it I'm, I'm, I, I appreciate what I'm doing right now. I'm, I'm happy in the moment, but it's just, it's a, it's an interesting thought. Like, damn, dude. Because like, it's like a different phases of your life, right? But it's, it's interesting. I'm happy. I'm really happy. I'm, I'm, I'm doing great. I, 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 I love, uh, I love life, man. It's great. It's a good time. Serendipity White, what's up, mate? All right, I think there's also a big ass white crocodile somewhere around here, but uh, I think he's a little bit further south, actually. Okay. Light Tierra of the Deep. This is a quest for that. Uh. Nah. Okay, let's go to Theramore. You love life, that's also unusual as someone to hear. That's unusual? I don't know, I think life is great, man. You know, it has its ups and downs, you know? There's some bad days, there's some good, ga good days, sorry. But... I'm happy, man. I, I, I think life is great, dude. I, I think it's awesome, you know? Alright. Oh, isn't there also a quest here? Man, I keep thinking about different quests all the time, man. You know? Imagine your doctor Sumer that used ChatGPT to graduate and saying Skibidi Gyat. Oh, God. Well, you're one of them, Brick. You're one of them, man. Little Sumer. Zooming around. What's the best quest? The best quest chain? Depends on what you like. I, I honestly really like the Stitches quest chain with Abercrombie. I just think it's kind of funny. It's like it's like some old hermit that's like secretly hiding that he's like a uh, I'm not a witch but he's like a necromancer and he's like role playing that he's like an old uh, crep, uh, like you know old man and you're like helping him like build up like an abomination to attack stitches it's kind of funny you know I I highly recommend reading the quest chain with uh, Abercrombie if you've never read it before and you're leveling in in, in vanilla. Go go read the whole quest chain when you're doing it. It's it's quite funny actually. Yeah, Legend of Stalvin is good as well. Okay. I need your help. I effed up pretty bad. I dropped from the boat from Minithil Harbor to the Elven City and I fatigue I'm in fatigue now. I just locked out. Is there a way to survive? Um wait till your heartstone is off cooldown, lock in and use your heartstone. Yeah, your Hearthstone continues cooldown, even if you're lock locked out. So, just whenever your Hearthstone is off cooldown, just lock in and then Hearthstone instantly. You can also use the website to unstock your character. If you feel uncomfortable doing that, you can do the unstock. Yeah. I, I will just lock in on Hearthstone personally, but you can unstock on the website. I, I, I would personally Hearthstone. But that's me. You you do you. Because, like, yeah, Unstuck can some sometimes be a little bit janky and teleport you to places and stuff, but, uh, yeah. You you figure out what you want to do, and then do that. Nearest friendly graveyard? Yeah, there can be a shark by here, by the way. I see if you didn't know that. 
Uh, Desertos, Box, Shadow of Short Fragments. Oh my god, a freaking Maraudon is coming up as well. Wowie. Okay, let's head to Feral Ass and then go down to Tenaris now. How do you like Druid so far? I think it's really fun. I think Druid has been a good time, man. It's been a great time leveling Druid. All overall, it's just been fun. Yeah, good fun. Doo -doo -doo, doo -doo -doo. Okay, when Sulfurak? Uh, I would say realistically in around an hour and a half. It, it, it depends. I, I'm just doing a few quests in Feralas first. Like, I want to do these quests that I haven't done down there. I need to do a little pre-quest. And then after that, we're probably making the group. So, not too long till we do uh, till we do it. Not too long. Yeah. Improved. EA, scuffed, mutilate rogue. Oh. You're talking to someone else. Is it two hours, an hour and a half ago? No, I didn't. Crowbax. With the prime. Thank you so much for the 20 months. Was the question with the dragon dude and Yunguru in vanilla? Oh, with uh, that has like Zelda references? Yeah. Lincoln's uh, boomerang, whatever the heck. Yeah, that's a good question too. It starts like with, when you pick up like a little thing down there and you lead it into Ma Marshall's refuge and shit. Good quest as well. He said 30 minutes ago, 5 hours ago. I wasn't even live 5 hours ago. You think I went live at like what, like 7 a.m.? Okay. I'm not that early of a streamer, okay? I've been streaming around 11 a.m. lately. That's been my starting time currently, you know? <laughs> Am I taking a break from retail? Yeah. I'll, I'll, pro I'll probably come back to retail whenever there's some new content, like a new new raid or new patch or something. I'll probably pl play it again, but... Yeah, I, 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 play, I play retail more seasonally. Whenever whenever they release a new raid or a new expansion or a new, co new, new patch or something... I do the new raid, we do some, some mythics, and we have fun with that, and then I play for a few weeks, and then I'm kind of chilling with it, you know? That's kind of how I do it. You know? Check gear in Sulfurak. Bro, Sulfurak has some nice gear. Yeah, that's some real nice gear. Mainly, I'm hoping for the helmet. And to Sul, there's the lifeblood necklace, right? There's some gloves there. There is... I mean, this is not bad. I wouldn't really be hyped about getting that. But there's also Cyrilis, which is a rare mob. Can drop some really nice feet. I would love those. That would be amazing. Uh, Sandscalp can drop Embrace of the Lycan, which is freaking crazy good. This is, like, insanely good, actually. Super good. Then there is something else. Is there more stuff? Not from bosses, but there is, like, random drops. You could get random greens, right? Yeah, a lot of people focus on, like, the boss drops in dungeons, but, like, greens from, like, rare, or, like, normal mobs is also really good. Have I done Ulderman? We did Ulderman yesterday, yeah. The staff for the stun. I don't know if the stun works for uh, cat form. I don't know. If it does work in cat form, it could actually be kind of, like, a funny weapon. It does work? Really? Oh, there's a... If anyone needs Steel Snap, guys, on, st on Stitches, he's right here. Yeah, Steel Snap is up right there. If anyone is leveling in 1k needles. There you go. Heading towards uh, down there. Nothing works in cat form. Ah. It doesn't work in classic. Ah, okay. Well, I, I don't know. I never... Uh, that's why I'm asking. 1k needles? Yeah, dude, 1k, dude, 1k. Are we gonna get the, the cow dancing music soon? I think we are. I completely skipped Shimmering Flats, by the way. I completely skipped a lot of zones, I feel like. Yeah, we did no more in the beginning of the stream, Falcor. We did it. We did it. Didn't get it, but we did do it. Why does 1k needles have such a bad rep? It's a fine zone. Oh, by the way, rock a limb right here. If anyone needs rock a limb, uh, right here. 1k needles. There you go. On stitches. 20, 39 coordinates. How did I find both steel snap and rock a limb? What the fuck? But I need layer. There's only one layer on Wednesdays. So if you are on stitches, he is here right now. Yeah. 
Reset days only have one layer. I feel like as Alliance you can skip a good amount of zones compared to Horde. Yeah, Alliance have a shitload of uh, choice, I feel like. Yeah. Stop the cap. No, it's true. Reset days only have one layer. How do you know there's only one layer? Because I know. That's why. Yep. Yeah. I know because I know. Do, do, do. I got you, bro. I didn't know that. No problem. But why? I know. I just know. There's no reason for it. I just know. There was five under five pillagers today. Yep, but it's not reset day today. That was yesterday for NA. That's what I do. I touch hawks and I know things. No, I don't touch hawks. Whatever. CB, man. I mean, vanilla leveling is so comfy. When do I come back? I don't know, man. I think that's probably why a lot of people like the vanilla WoW streams. Because it's so easy to just whack on in the back as you're doing something else. You know, if you have the in-game sound on, you're playing the game, it's like... It's just chill, dude. I don't know. You just whack it on, right? How many fingers do I have? Ten of them. Ten of them, man. I don't know how far south the, the guards in free wind post are, actually. I'm gonna just keep going this way. And the streamer can interact all the time, which is nice. Yeah, it's really difficult to interact constantly playing uh, other versions of WoW. Right. Obviously, there are some moments where, like, I'm a little bit more focused if I'm, like, soloing something or something. But, you know, that's, like, you know, not all the time. That's, you know, kind of rare that you're doing something that intensive. Are you missing a pinky? Oh, that's not me. That's another WoW streamer. Did we get the pommeler today? Bro, I didn't. I didn't get the freaking pommeler, man. It sucks, dude. I, I've tried for so long now. I'll get it tomorrow. We'll, we'll get it tomorrow, surely. How many teeth do I have? I don't know. Full set. Teen Hao, thank you for the prime. I'm go also going to try to set up the God of War for tomorrow. I'm going to try my best to set that up too. Hulk roast. Hog, hog roast. Oh my god. I'm actually getting haunted by freaking hogs. Frostamus. Is that Frostadamus? Yesterday you said tomorrow. I am aware of that. But I ended up streaming for nine hours yesterday almost, and I, I didn't get to set it up after stream. I told myself, Kuzu, I'll do a short stream today, and I'll set up the God of War stuff so we can do some variety gaming as well for the coming streams. And then, you know what Kuzu did? Kuzu ended up streaming almost nine hours. Because Kuzu really likes Classic WoW. And Kuzu kind of forgets time when he's playing it. God of War 1. Yeah. Addicted? I'm not addicted. I just really like the game, you know. Arcanatros, what's up, mate? Good to see you, man. We've really done a lot of traveling today here. Holy shit. Good to see you, bro. Are you gonna try Prider Shores? New OSRS style MMO by OS OSRS Creator? I don't know. I have thought about it, but I'm not too certain if I'll give it a try or not. Or if I'll stream it. I'm not sure. You're almost outliving the unemployed. Okay, bro. <laughs> what the fuck, man? <laughs> Throwing shade. Playing Forest of Wild and takes two hours to set up the emulator, then only two hours of God of War. No, I, dude, I, I need to set it up. Okay, off stream. Shimmering flats, boys. Oh my god, look at that freaking. No way. Is that a Japlo? Oh my lord, he was running fast. You guys saw that? He was fucking sprinting! Wowie! He was having a freaking field day with that. Okay. Speed Demon, you could even call him. When Classic WoW... Does Will you think Elsa's finish doesn't get off? I mean, that's why it's like... It's a second life playing this game. Because you, you literally lose yourself. And then suddenly you play for 8 hours. Because like, oh, okay. You know what? I'm gonna just... Let's just do Feral Ads, guys. You know, you go there and you do that. And then suddenly 4 hours have passed. And you're like, oh, shit. You know? 4 hours later? Oh, my God. 
All right, let's just do a real fast dungeon. Turns into an eight-hour escapade. Can I help you? There we go. I don't know Talk if we can do me. this quest. It depends if someone in the group that we you make a has a car or ha has the thing, but we'll see. Oh, Erval, hello, mate. Wanna charm my guild? Charm my guild. Yeah, that's better. I saw that tabard being all grayed out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice. All right. There we go. There we go, dude. How many characters have I leveled to 60? In, in general? At least four. <laughs> I don't know. A lot. I've been fiending in Sekiro lately. Almost up to M NG plus 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 plus. Jesus. Hello, this is Andreas from Beskeftigelses or Ökonomie Kontor. Just checking in how to ask your job hunting is going. We haven't heard anything from you in a few years. Let us know if we can help you getting a way to apply for jobs. Uh, I have a job. I'm a professional video game player. Mm hmm. That's it. Yep. It's called an E athlete. That's why I need to stay in peak shape whenever we're playing this video game because we need to. Uh... Wait. What is the. Wait, I have a suspicious, weird feeling about this place, guys. What is. What's that town down there? Is that. Is that the hardware store? Oh my god, guys. It's back. Wow. Oh, wowie, wowie, guys. The hardware store. We're really up here now. Get low down down ba 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 da ba da bam bi ba da ba da ba di 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 ba Laden Duke land, that's for later. Ben soon. What up? Keep it real. Yo! That's also Keep a good going. ring. Talk to me. Go into the hot right back. store. Put my heart stone here too. Dude, if you don't know this song, guys, you are an old uncultured wild player. Okay? Let's go down here. I would be first in line. Alright. So we want the Screecher Spirit quest down here. Yeah. You wanna join? Yes, yes, yes. Oh god, let's run away from this guy. I can't wait no more. When they gonna open up that door? Our fellow, hey, forty-five gamers, let's go! More nature's grasp. Fifteen levels to go. Let's go, dude. Do do do. Wait, I wonder. Wait, what do you guys think they sell at a hardware store? I wonder if he could list what they were selling.
Oh, by the way, if you're listening to the VOD channel, guys, there's no music on the VOD channel, right? But we're listening to the Hardware Store by Weird Al Jankovic, just in case you're wondering, right? So that's that's it. If you want to, like, we're vibing right now with the stream, so that, that's the song we're listening to. Yeah, just letting you know. Yeah, guys, I'm just helping out the VOD viewers, right? Yeah. What can okay. I do for you? Uh, safe travels. Going to the hardware. How you doing, man? Be seeing ya. There we go. We had to play it, chat. Okay, we had to play it. At this point, it's become a tradition, okay? Ah, the hardware store. What a great song, man. From an old school machinima. From an old school machinima. We can relax and calm down now. Ah, you should start doing the map quest so you don't overlevel it. It has a shit drop rate. Yeah. Uh, probably true on ironically. 48 yeah. years of variety content. 48 months of variety content. Veep. I'm glad to have had you at a part of the community for such a while, dude. You are definitely tight as hell. I appreciate it, dude. I do appreciate it. Thank you. Alright, so... What are we gonna get here? Sack of corn. Alright. Sack of corn, you say. Can you play some old Oxhorn machinimas? Dude, those are also just old school as fuck, man. Like, I feel like... Old WoW YouTube used to be so... I mean, just YouTube in general used to be so different back in the day. It was such a wild west of, of content. You know? So different. Oh, there's a chest right there. For moi? Oh, yeah, these guys, by the way, under the tents are, like, super... You didn't. You auto looted it. You auto looted it. You didn't even check first, Phineas. He's actually yoinking. Makurahim. I honestly, I fucking might, dude. At this point. No, I'll let it slide today. Okay. You wanna do Makurahim? <laughs> He's actually yoinking? Puzo... That's ridiculous, man. I can't believe that. You know, I guess good things happen to people, you know? So at least we got the, the chicken escort. At least we got that. So there's that. Okay, whatever. Alright, so, we were going to Feralas now, guys. We got the corn, we got that quest, now we gotta fly to Feralas, and... I'll do the quests over here for the Screecher Spirits, we'll do the High Wilderness, we'll do the Knolls, and we'll do the Freedom for All Creatures, and then uh, we should be kinda ready for Sulfarak, alright? Yeah, we should be ready for Sulfarak. Yeah. Corn is so nice, dude. I love corn. We say if you got person's gold items if you win a Makara, or like you could loot them. Isn't it's in Diablo 2 where they drop their uh, gold, right? So if you kill someone in Diablo 2, they, they they drop their gold too. Any luck with Nomer today? Nope. Yeah, and an ear as well. I think the ear thing in hardcore is like a shout out to to Diablo. 
Have I ever had Mexican street corn? No, but in Serbia they have a lot of corn as well, like grilled corn and stuff on the streets. So I've had it. Uh, I have had. It, I've had. Bop, 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 beep, 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 beep. I've had it there. You're eating smoked salmon with Two remolo. years and at least three since I watch you every day. Thank you for all the content and try to not die from a rune this time. What do you mean? Thank you for the two years. I will try not to die to a rune. Are you eating smoked salmon with remoulade? That is a bit weird. Pipsolini. Okay, I'ma just be real. That's a bit weird. Achievement check. We need to do Quergo's gold before 46. Oh, frick. I don't have my add-on on right now. Yeah, it's a little bit of a weird one because we need to get the drops. I don't know if it's smart doing this before Sulfrak. Maybe it would be smart. Because it's like a drop and I gotta go down there, right? Mm, I don't know. We'll fly here and then we'll, we'll work our way over there. Assuming smoked cold salmon remolel absolutely belongs on it, that's... no. No, it does not. I don't think you need anything on smoked salmon. Welcome. See you soon. I really don't think you need anything. Yeah. You could put dill dressing on it, which a lot of Danish people do. I think it makes it too sweet. I like it just raw, personally. What's up, Night Elf fan? Yeah, I, I like it raw, personally. Or, like, not raw, it's more like... You know. Like, put a little bit of butter on the bread. Like, a little bit of butter on the bread, and then some salmon on top, and I'll, I'll take it. Dill's too sweet? Bro, 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 bro. A fan of the hill, but that's dill sauce. Uh, what, no, what is it called? Dill, dill dressing. This shit. Is fucking sweet as fuck. Sorry for the double f bomb there, but this thing is so sweet. This is insanely sweet. Yeah, this is this is what people put on like uh, salmon in Denmark. You get like uh, you get like uh, rye bread, and then you get salmon. You get this on top. This is incredibly sweet. This is very 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 sweet. It's called deal dressing. Yeah. It's biz. When I was uh, a kid, I used to like drench this on my salmon. But I, I kind of stopped liking it as much because it's very, very, very sweet. It's, yeah. I love I can understand written Danish, but when you speak it, I can't understand shit. <laughs> really? Honey mustard? I think it's like similar because I think there's like honey and stuff in it. Yeah, it's real sauce. That's what we call it. It means like a uh, fox sauce. You see the sequel went for four years to 14 years? Yeah, I, we saw some of the Seiko Makaras. I didn't see the stream because for some reason Seiko is streaming. <laughs> I don't... Bro, he, he starts his stream at like 10 p.m. and he streams till like the morning. <laughs> He's crazy. I thought he meant dill too. No, it, we, it, it's just called dill sauce, like dill dressing. Deal dressing, right? Do I have a TikTok? Oh! I, I have a TikTok where we've been posting like some wow clips and stuff like that. But uh, I don't really use TikTok personally. Yeah. My, my most used social media platform, if you don't count YouTube and Twitch as social media, which I guess they are, it's probably Instagram. I. And the main reason why I use Instagram is because I just look at uh, shorts that uh, Mordial and Index sends to me. So, yeah, I, I, I use Instagram mostly. Shorts, oh, it's just reels, whatever they're called. Reels, yeah. Yeah. I, I like having Instagram because I can also like kind of interact with people from the community like if I post a story or something like that you, People usually like respond and I have like little convos with people. It's kind of it's nice. I like it 
No. Oh, you're sorry you TikTok editor? I do have one. Thank you, though, Taylor. Thank you for offering, but I, I do have one that, that sorts it out for me. Don't use Twitter. Uh, yeah, I don't like Twitter. I, I, I actually really, really dislike Twitter a lot. I, I have a Twitter, uh, but I only have a Twitter because I'm a streamer. X, yeah. I don't have X. It just sounds stupid. I, I have Twitter, but I, I, I don't use it. I literally only have it because I'm a content creator, right? So you gotta have social media. I don't like using Twitter. Yeah. Okay. Dumb people. It, it's just a bunch of people arguing with each other and like random shit. So I don't really care about it. You uninstall Instagram? No, I mean that's good. If you if you feel like it's not productive for your life, that's good. All right, so we gotta do the troll, the gnolls down here. This quest I think leads into like a quest in Yunguru eventually, which we gotta do for like an achievement. So we might as well start this too. Pling 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 pling. Uninstall Instagram was the best charge ever. It fair enough. I do think an over over usage of, of social media can be very unhealthy for you, for sure. I, I use Twitch quite a lot, obviously, and, and YouTube. Th those are like my main things I spend time on. But yeah. Oh. A little buff, mate. There you go. Too many ads and buttons, some of those getting recommended, so stop using it. Yeah, so exactly. Is PvP balanced right now? That highly depends on the context. What 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 PvP? Retail PvP, Kata PvP, Sod PvP, Era PvP. Alright, so I think we gotta go steal a satchel here, right? Yeah, steal a little satchel from these guys. Hardcore PvP. Oh shit. Okay, yeah, it's that one right there. Saw PvP is balanced that in that everybody can get one shot. Uh <laughs> dude, Seiko has 15k health on like a shaman, bro. I don't even know how he has that much health on a shaman. Yeah, I, I don't even understand how that's even possible. Gonga. You like my shirt? Thanks. I want to get some more, like, knitted sweaters. I like knitted sweaters a lot. Uh, there we go. Yeah, into the rhythm deep, boys. Into the rhythm deep we goes. Not today, no SG World. Not today. We don't, wa we don't water it on Wednesdays. Wait, it's a Wednesday? Bro. Forgot. Jesus. Zeke has 15k health and 90% avoidance when he presses Flame Shock. Yeah. Sod PvP is crazy. I don't know. I, I, I personally don't really uh, have a big desire to do it. But, you know, there's people enjoying it, so that's great. Okay, so we gotta go into this place here. We gotta just slowly clear through it, right? And it'll be fine. <clears throat> I am wondering if I should do Quergo's Gold, though, before Sulfurac. I think it might be smart. So I don't have to worry about dinging inside of Sulfurac. Because it is a random drop from the pirates. Right, so I think after we finish Feralas, we should go do Quergo's Gold. Because it is for an achievement, right? Oh, that's Sting Lasher, okay. Yeah, do it before. Yeah, so I think we gotta finish Feralas with the few quests we're doing here, and then we gotta go get that achievement, and then we can make a, make a group for Sulfurac. I, actually, let's kill this guy. Yeah, let's kill him. I think he has, the, he has a stinky smell. 12 hour stream? Dude, I told myself today... Like... Like, max 7 hour stream. I, I really, really, really gotta chill. I, I've been doing way... I've been streaming way too long lately, man. Like, my brain... My brain is, like, not used to it. It's But it's just because I'm having fun, right? I'm just enjoying myself a lot. It's a good thing. I'm just having too much fun, right? Alright, we gotta go free some Night Elf in here. 
should just innovate myself. So have we... Dude, it's always been... This is what I mean, dude. It's already been three and a half hours. Like, what the heck? We're just vibing. Yeah, I saw some Makara stuff. We were watching it earlier today, man. We didn't get to see all the all the stuff with the Makaras because Siku's VOD isn't available, but yeah. God of War later? No, I'm gonna set up God of War today, and we could hopefully do some God of War tomorrow at the end of the stream. God of War 1, that is. Okay. Tunneler. Okay, there's some stingers. We just watch for the patrols. Yeah, God of War 1. The old school one, SB. Yeah. Sure. Beware for sexual content. Yeah, no, you, you, is it Aphrodite? You can go and then you get a spam like a uh, circle and then you. Like, yeah. <laughs> what? Which profession are you on your druid? I am leatherworking and skinning right now. Oh. Okay. Okay. Nice. Bro knows the exact scene. Dude, I played it as a kid, man. Okay, wait, wait, so we we we, we bark skin? Dude, it does make my cast slower, but not getting pushback is so nice. I should put it. God, God of War one tomorrow? Question mark. I'll put it in the title so I can commit more to it. We're not gonna do uh, when I'm saying God of War tomorrow. I don't mean like we're doing a full stream of it. I just mean we're, we're gonna play like a few hours at the end of the stream, right? So we're gonna finish off the stream with a little bit of variety. Okay. This hive is chill. Yeah, it's not that bad. It's the one in Yunguru that's a lot more scary. I've been on Twitch since 2013. I think I have to touch some grass. Uh, we have a saying in Denmark, brick, that's called Eltigmemul. Eltmemul. And it means like all things in... All things in... Um, it means all things in... Um, fuck, I don't know how to, what it means in English. Hey! Distress beacon! Moderation! Thank you. All things in moderation, right? So, yeah, it's fine to spend time on Twitch and do things, but like, you know, as long as you don't like it consume you, right? Still be productive with your life. There we go. What? Isn't he supposed to come out? Oh shit, what are you doing here? Go look at my accountage. You've, you made your account in 2008. That's crazy. It's a bug location? Oh. What if I leave Gat form? Maybe my Gat form is uh, bugging it out. This means we can do the escort as well when we're done with this. Oh, that, that did it. That did it. Nice. Cool. Freed from the hive. Alright, we, we definitely need to do the achievement before Soul Frag. For sure. Have you ever done an escort before? In WoW? Yeah, yeah, plenty, bro. What do you mean? No, you don't have Mangle in Classic. Oh, that's a good one sussy guy. Uh, let me put this guy down and then do that. Okay, so what do we do now? We go kill the ogre. No, we do the freedom for all creatures next. So we do this, we do the ogres, then we do the veils creatures, we escort the, the bird over, turn in everything here, and then we head to uh, Tanaris. Yeah. The Swiss Beacon is one of the worst escorts to do alone. Yeah, but we can do it. We can do it. We can survive, man. Dude, my druid is so freaking good. Like, we're, we're tanky as fuck. Don't worry about it. Don't you need the map for Queer Ghost Gold? I do, and that is why I don't want to do Sulfurac before we do the achievement. Since we are trying to do this, the, all the achievements, we gotta make sure that we do it appropriately, right? As a British person, is there any Danish food or del delicacies you would recommend we try? 
I mean, the, the basic stuff, right? Go try some Smurbrot, which is like an open-faced rye bread sandwich. Go try some Fleskestai sandwich, which is like a pork roast sandwich you can get at most grill places. Try some Danish hot dog. We have amazing street food hot dogs. Um, try some pickled herring on your Smurple sandwich as well, if you if you are interested in that. And um, that's like the main things I would recommend. And also try like our pastries. We have really good pastries in Denmark. Yeah, like cinnamon cinnamon buns and like different like uh, different Danish pastries are really good. Tr try some tr tr try some pastries. Try some pork roast sandwiches. Try smurple and pickled herring if you want, if you're into it. And then also try some hot dogs. That would be like my top five. Yeah, that's what I would recommend you go try. Steaked flesk. Yeah, I mean that that's uh, the the flesk is die sandwich. Yeah. Grød grød med flødeskum. You don't put flødeskum on grød grød, man. You put you just put fløde. You don't you you just put some pour some fløde inside. Uh oh yeah, freedom for all creatures. We gotta do that one. Steak flesk and flesk is that sandwich not the same. I yeah I guess. If if you are really if you want to try you you should try some eule flesk. Some eule flesk. Eule flesk is like uh, apples that are like roasted, like roasted kind of like uh, cooked apples, so they're really soft. And then flesk is like uh, pork, right? So it's like uh, pork with like apples, apples and pork. Show picture. Eule flesk. Eule flesk is what we call it, right? Like, it, it looks like something like this. Right, so it's like apples, and then it's like a pork. Apples and pork. It's quite good. Uh, flesk is... I think flesk is pork belly. Yeah, I think so. Alright, freedom for all what creatures. You uh, You have six minutes to this before Kindle decides it is time to retreat and you fail the quest. Alright. Oh my god, our quest log is actually yeah, full. Wowie wowie, okay. How may I help? Alright, let's go free these creatures, boys, real fast. Yeah, so fir first we go free the creatures and afterwards we go slay everybody in the camps. Sounds great. Six minutes? Dude, I'll, I'll be done in like 10 seconds. What the heck? There we go. Yeah, I'm already done, dude. Easy clap. Hello. We're good. Oh shit. I think we should save six. It's six of these just needs to get away. Okay. He's killing some over there as well. Was a good oh there we go, got it done. What's well, a good level to do song and temple? 53. Last boss is 55, so I would say 53. Yeah. Should we save this one too? Yeah, let's save it, let's save it. Latest WoW has consumed my life at a dream about WoW and my hardcore mage dying. That's when you know you're really into the game, bro. Oh, hello Kira. Hello. Hi. Double fiery weapon rogue, man. Holy shit. You seen any... <sighs> no, I've not seen any pigs around, okay? XD. Yeah, you like that one, Jablo? You think that's funny? <laughs> Fucking A. Alright, don't die out there. Alright, don't die out there, Kiera. Alright? Jesus Christ. Much love, much love, man. Unfreaking believable, dude. Okay. I think mastering your emotions when you lose a hardcore character is something to work on. You mean me? My emotions are completely fine, thank you very much. 
Alright, let's go kill a bunch of people. Yeah, for the quests, of course. Why aren't you just telling us to eat pigs with apples? Yeah, but you know, I'm Danish. I, I love pigs, right? Like, like I, we eat a lot of pigs here, right? Like, we, a lot of, like, like, lots of, like, sausages and, like, you know, pork roast and, like, things. All right, we, we, we eat a lot of pigs. You know, it is what it is. Okay, whatever. Let's get this quest done. All right. Little bit of work to do before we do, uh, I almost said Wailing Caverns. Before we do, uh, Sulfurac here, boys. We can also go to the other side here. This maze. That's nothing. The Rock Pounder. Oh my god, dude. Is everybody just getting, uh, okay, whatever. Fine. I don't, I don't, I'll, I'll get, uh, I'll, I'll get, I'll get Rock Pummeler tomorrow. Do you know about the Danish flag pick? What's that? What you get? What you? Pet the hawk. Oh my god, guys. Crim totem compound. Let's go. To add the movable quest log window. Uh, I'm using quest team personally for my quests. Uh, quest team is what I use personally. Want me to hello guys? Is day drinking? No, do not start day drinking because of hardcore. What are you on about? Hello? Calm down, man. I have had dreams about dying in WoW though. And I don't know if that's like reaching a very bad point in my life if I'm starting having like dreams about doing that, but. Yeah. Oh, I I'm just doing solo bolo. Oh god, I feel bad like not accepting the quest, but I'm, I'm just here solo bolo. You know, or like not like teaming up, but I like to solo boloing. Are they gonna talk to me? I'm gonna run away so I don't have to talk to them. <laughs> right, I'm gonna buff them. I'm gonna buff them. There you go. Yep. They ain't bred a pig to look like the Danish flag to protest Germans. Really? I didn't know that. Okay, I want me to do the long dig walk to Thunderbluff. Oh, from, uh, from Durotar? See, this is where it's super nice. Having bark skin, man. Even if two guys were on me like that, I could still just, like, cast spells easily. And I guess it's also good for Hurricane. Okay. Tigrex, thank you for the 17 months prime, guys. A prime a day keeps the doctor away. Thank you very much. Ooh! Hmm. I saw the necklace, I'm like, damn, is that something good? But nah, I won't take it. Not bad. It's okay. It's not just, you know, nothing I really want. We gotta be careful we don't ding, though, before the achievement. But I don't think we should ding from Feral Ass. We should... We're probably, like, almost halfway through the level when we're done with this. A prime idea from keeping Anas from his skiff deals in the way. Oh, you mean, like, freaking so I, can, I have to go get a job? I think it is a job, right, guys? You know, but... What achievement are you going for? I need to do Quergo's Gold. Uh, this quest before level 46. So it's like I gotta go to Teneris, kill a bunch of pirates, get like the... Get the map or whatever for Quergo, and then we gotta go dig it up. And there's like four or five mobs we gotta kill, right? Yeah. Wait, did someone get Itch Masters? Holy shit! On a hunter though! Fucking A! Happy Doomsday, Mr. Strymer. Happy Doomsday! Yo, someone Vada, thank you for the 20 months. Someone just got the Edge Masters, guys, in the guild. Dude, yeah, bro, if you can sell that at, at level 60, man, that people are This is, like, actually insanely piss. Yeah, this is so good. That's that's worth a lot, man. That That's literally almost a free epic mount. Yeah.
Yeah, you just looted an epic mount, pretty much. Why are these good? Because they give you weapon skill, and weapon skill makes it so you, makes it so you can't get glancing blows. Right, so you want to have like a certain amount of weapon skill at max level to remove the chance to get glancing blows. And this, uh, these edge masters makes it so that you basically hit that level so you, you don't get glancing blows. Yeah, it's really good. It, it, it looks shit when you look at it, right? So, okay, wait, dagger skill, sword skill, like whatever. But it's actually in incredibly good. Divine glancing blows. I don't know the exact definition definition of it. it. It's essentially a glancing blow. Is essentially like if I don't know the percentage, but like if you're hitting a mob for a hundred, and then if you get a glancing blow, that one hundred damage turns into fifty damage, right? So instead of I hit a mob for a hundred, I hit it for fifty. So a glancing blow just does less, like way less damage. You still hit the mob, but it's like a partial resist in a way, right? Yeah, it's like, yeah, a reverse crit. Yeah, that's a good way of putting it. 60% less damage? Yeah, something like that. So it's, it's like a reverse crit. And ha being above the, the weapon skill cap makes it so that you don't get those uh, anti-crits. <laughs> exactly. Combined with Maladeth and your plus 10? Yeah, Maladeth is really good too. Maladeth is a sword from Blackburn Lair that gives uh, weapon skill too. Yeah, you still get them, but it's like a lot less uh, likely to happen. Yeah. That's why hitting higher level mobs, even if you hit them, you do less damage. Yeah, exactly. That's why. That's why you, you remember when I was fighting uh, the guy here at the uh, at the the boats, the pirate dude, and we were doing like no damage at all. That's because all my attacks were glanc glancing blows. And Bangladesh, also Bangladesh. Yeah, all my attacks were glancing blows, so I did no damage. Right. So instead of hitting them up for 70, I would do like 20, right? Even if I could hit it, right? Yeah. Man, this fucking game. This game is such a big part of my life, it's crazy. Okay, uh, yeah, that's how it goes. I need so many more naturalists. The glancing blow does not change, it's the damage penalty that does. Yeah, it probably makes sense. I, 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 again, I don't know the full on math about it, I just know glancing blow is bad, right? That's what I know. That's also why uh, hunters are incredibly good for dungeons and for like, even if they're lower level, because hunters don't have glancing blows. Yeah, so they, they hit like mobs that are high level really good if they hit the mob. Yeah, ranged attacks can be glancing. They do? Yeah, of, of course, if they melee, they have glancing blows. But uh, a bow or a gun or throne can be glancing. So you, you can attack high-level mobs as a hunter. That's why whenever you're doing dungeons, it's usually okay to bring a lower-level hunter. Because they can do damage anyway. Alright. And they also get don't get parries or dodges or uh, resist or whatever the fuck, right? Or once I don't know if once can glance. I don't think they can, but I might be wrong about that. Plus five weapon skill basically raises your character level by one for attack rolls. Yeah, exactly. Is that the same rogue for us earlier? Any asking? Do you literally have twenty minutes for? What the fuck is this greedy rogue? Asking for rebuffs? You have 20 minutes on the mark? Unbelievable! Wowie! Damn! What's the max weapon level on 60? Uh, it's 300 baseline, 305 if you're an orc and you have axe skill, uh, or uh, human or mace and, and swords. And um, you can. I, I think to not get any glancing blows for the most part, you want to be... I don't know the number, man. You, you want to be like 310, I think, or 305 or something like that to like have almost a no chance of glancing blows. But yeah, 300 is baseline, 305 if you are an orc or whatever. Is it 308, 307? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, around, around that. 
I need way more of these. Uh, I just need the naturalists. And then one shaman, and then we're good. How do you get past 300? I just explained that, Pixie! I don't get it. You have 300 weapon skill at level 60. You get an item like Itch Master's handguards. So now instead of having 300, you have 307. Because it goes on top of your 300. Yeah? <laughs> It go it you you add the seven to the number you already have. Yeah? Can I get What the f Jesus Christ man You're welcome. So you need gear with plus whatever weapon skill? Yes. That's exa Have I not just ranted about this for ten minutes, Pixie? I've just went on a 10 minute rant about weapons. Pixie! Oh my god, no wonder you killed Peo. Holy shit, man. God. Alright, I need six more naturalists. Goose reminds me of a substitute math teacher. <laughs> With a rowdy class. <laughs> Dude, honestly, being a substitute teacher must be the worst fucking... I, I mean, I don't know. I guess in a way, it's like free money because you don't really do much. You kind of just chill with the class. But I remember, man, when I was in middle school and we had a substitute teacher. It was like, boys, we got a free class today. We, we can do whatever we want. Yeah, I remember that, dude. Yeah, today we do whatever we want. Hell yeah. He's done, exactly. Now usually usually they would just take it out take us out and play football or something. Did oh like the classic substitute teacher thing to do was put on a movie. Yeah. Just go go play like football or something or put on a movie and just let them watch a movie for an hour. And then the class is done. And then they, the, the teachers just sits in the back on their phone or something. Yeah, easy job. We had that one sub-teacher that just wanted to act responsible. Yeah, and it was really cringe, right? Because you're like, oh my god, dude. We're, we're supposed to have fun now, you know? Shit, dude. Ronbald? Yeah, we would play Ronbald. I don't know what Ronbald is in English. Ronbald English. Engelsk. Round ball? You know when there, there's like a square... It, it, it's like baseball, but without the the crazy uh, hard ball. Yeah, it, 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 it's, it's baseball, but without the insanely like uh, aluminum bats. It's like with a softball? Yeah, probably. Kickball, whatever. Yeah, we call it Rundbald in Danish. Yeah, it's like baseball for kids. Exactly. Yeah, baseball for kids. The rounders. Okay. Rounders? Okay. Yeah, that's the that's the thing. Okay. How's the druid going? Uh, pretty good, dude. Pretty good. We're prepping up for Sulfurac right now. I'm kind of... I've kind of just been doing a lot of like uh, quests and pre-quests and shit, but we are getting closer and closer to doing Sulfrak. I'm just finishing off a bit of stuff in Feralas, and then we can uh, we're gonna start going to Tenaris, do a little achievement there, and then it's uh, Sulfrak time. Yeah, we have a lot of achievement points, 170. Do the Malak quest. The leader's level 51. I don't know if I would want to mess around with that. Yeah. I hope you will not be as unlucky as I was on that achievement. Yeah, that's why I'm going over there as soon as I'm done with Feralast to do the achievement before Sulfurac. Just so I can hopefully get the drop. Yeah. 
Realize I didn't do my fishing by 47 mage. Yeah, I'm bad at doing fishing. I keep forgetting to do fishing. I don't... I'm not a big fan of fishing in WoW. Because I, I get anxiety staring at the, the bubble thing. Yeah. Because I'm just... I'm just... I'm just staring at it, waiting for it to pop. I don't... I'm not a big fan. I like fishing IRL. But I don't like it much, very much in WoW. Oh, one more here. What, what are you doing? You already got buffs, okay? Grace for days says he loves fishing. Yeah, I get, I bet. It's been my first druid, Grace, that I'm leveled above level 20 in, uh, in vanilla WoW. And I, uh, I will admit, it's a little bit of a hero class, okay? At least 1 to 60 feels so strong on druid. It feels so powerful, dude. It's crazy. Wowie! Okay, so let's turn in what the justice quest. This is for darn asses. Do you want to get it buffed again? Is that what you're waiting for? Oh yeah, you only have 23 minutes left. You know, I'll buff you. Here you go. <laughs> oh, unbelievable. Hail to the night. There you go, man. Have some buffs. You want to do Makura? <laughs> <laughs> All right. He's not SSF, yeah. <laughs> he has double fiery weapon. He would shred my ass. Uh, he would actually shred my ass for sure. He has the Peta Sandala. <laughs> Shit. Double ethic. No, he's not cell phone. Do like Makarang, uh, not cell phone people is scary because you never know what they have up their sleeve. E even just non, non like uh, cell phone people, like cell phone people. Sorry, even cell phone people, you you can never know, man. Fuck, man, I want to make a character where we get engineering and everything and go hard in the paint. Maybe after OnlyFangs, that'll be like the vibe. I want to make a rogue and try to like Makarad up. Rogue or a mage or something. Maybe a mage could be fun too. That was my idea. My idea now. Yep. <laughs> yeah, ma mage or a priest or a rogue or something. Yeah, ma I, I was thinking rogue initially because rogue is like what I'm best at in vanilla, like for PvP. I'm, I'm that's my the class I'm the best at. But. Maybe mage or priest could be fun, because I would like have to like, oh my god, we got a wand, we got a kite around and shit, you know? That'd be fun. So, we gotta kill some brutes, but let's go find the shamans first. You did say mask from TBC. Thank you! Yeah, there was this guy earlier we were talking- thank you. He- yeah, thank you. One guy in the chat earlier was trying to gaslight me saying that I didn't- that I said something I didn't say, but in fact, I did say what I said. So he said I was saying something I didn't say, but I said it, right? And you know what he said after I said to him that I said it? He said, Oh, I was just joking. Classic. Classic. Man is wrong, says, Oh, I was kidding, it was a joke. Yeah, my brother typed it. Yeah, exactly. Uh... So these shamans usually never... Oh, there's one right there, dude. Yeah, I was just trolling. Exactly. Unbelievable, dude. Yeah, whatever, dude. Hopefully you're doing well, by the way, Mordial. Did you already end your stream? You did a short stream today. I hope you had fun, though. Oh, should we give this guy... Okay, I I'm gonna give it to him. Yeah, I'm gonna give this, this mob to him, okay? And I'm gonna leave the group after. Just, you know, being friendly, chat. Giving him the little mob we were killing and then leaving the group. All right. As Peo would say, PPC. Yeah, let's go up here. Are you shaming me? No, not at all. Grouped outside dungeon, I saw it. Oh, he grouped! He grouped! I saw it! Mm -mm -mm. Goes over to the 10 hour stream just like he does. He can afford more Lambos. Yeah, more real, more streams, you know. I'm trying to buy a second house here, okay? Uh, there's no shamans here, okay?
Do, do, do. Second? Are you broke? <laughs> God. Uh, unfortunately, my efforts to procure a mallet has failed. I escaped with my life narrowly after response thwarted my attempts. There will be more mallet today. That's okay. I'm just glad you're alive. This paladin was trying to get the, the mallet quest earlier, guys. But as long as he's not dead, that's all that matters, right? Just do a scamathon. Oh, a sabathon? Nah. I'm not gonna do that. I, I don't. I'm a, not a big fan of sabathons personally. I think. I would rather just stream till I'm tired and then, like, stop the stream when I'm tired and then go next day. That's it. Uh, if you live in Yulet, two houses and nothing. Not true. I did, I did, whenever, whenever I was uh, looking at houses in Denmark, I actually was considering moving to Yulant because you can get a lot more for your money in Yulant. You know, you, you can buy like a whole lot of land and stuff like that for like not a lot of money compared to here. But, yeah. Oh. How much in euros? It highly depends on the house you're getting. Highly depends. Your student on the nose, yeah. I don't know. At the moment, I'm I'm pretty happy with uh, with where I am. So, and I don't really need a, like a lot of space at the moment, you know. Whenever we get the uh, more deal imported and stuff like that, then we'll see. Oh, shaman there. Oh, ah, yeah, yeah, for helvel. This freaking uh, hunter is younging all the shamans. Oh, this one over there, though. I live in Chilan. I live in Chilan. Ma mainly, main, the main reason why I, I decided to, to get a house here is because I have a lot of my family around in Chilan. But it doesn't really matter. Because Denmark is so small that, like, you can pretty much live anywhere in Denmark and be within, like, a few hours driving of anywhere else, right? Because <laughs> it's a super small country, right? 8 million Danish crowns is 1 million get a house of that valor. A million dollar? No, 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 bro. You don't need to. No, no, no. You don't need that much money to buy a house here. Are you crazy? It's not that expensive. Jesus. I mean, you probably can't. You can get houses for that expensive, but then you're buying a mansion, bro. I live on the top. It only takes five hour drive to Copenhagen. Yeah. From, from one end of Denmark to the other... Like, the very end, like, the furthest you can probably drive is, like, six, seven hours. And But that's, like, from the very top to the very bottom, right, of the whole country. That's eight-hour drive. Maybe. No, not, not even eight hours. I think, like, six, seven hours. If you go all the way from Skane, all the way down to, like, Moon. From Skane to Moon. Which is like the furthest away you can get. Six hours. Yeah. Six hours, I think. You drove this summer? Okay. Yeah, it's really it's really tiny, guys. Hey, Gus. My last month before buy my new home. Hopefully end of the year. Holy shit. Wish me luck. And Dude. big chat as always. Bro, man. Congratulations. I mean, I... I'm not, you know, you haven't got it yet, but that's awesome, dude. Really, really awesome, man. Yeah, dude, cancel that sub, get that house, man. Bro, li listen, you don't have to be be sub to support the stream. So if you got some stuff going on, man, cancel the sub, do, focus on your own thing. You can still watch the stream, you know? That's awesome, dude. I'm really happy for you, man. That's really, really sick. Uh, I need two more of these. How's leatherworking going? Uh, I have a decent amount of leatherworking leveled. Uh, I'm at a little bit of a, of a point with leatherworking now where I gotta go farm uh, the tribal leatherworking. So I haven't really decided to do that quite yet, but I might at some point. I'll be watching as always. I appreciate it, dude. Making some big moves in your life. That's that's really commendable. He's right. If you cancel the subs, we can afford a house. <laughs> no, I mean, I'm just saying that, like, you know, you don't need to do anything for me to support me I, I i'm i'm really happy with people just watching that that's that's really chill for me watching and a few twitch primes right and then we're good Pling, ling 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 
I don't even know why I'm doing this quest. It's so annoying. I need two more shamans though, and then we're good. Two more here. I cancelled my sub to buy 20 piece twig and nugget from McDonald's. Okay, if it makes you happy, man, then go for it. Tantrop, thank you for the three months prime. A little tier one. Nah, I'm, I'm good, man. I'm good. If people want to support and they want to sub and they want to prime, do it. And if you don't uh, do want to do it, you, you, you can't afford whatever. Doesn't matter. That's okay, too. Either way is completely fine with me. Black Tuck, thank you for the prime. Bro, should I just wait down here? I think I should. Yeah. I have a Twitch Prime, eh? There it is, dude. There it is. If you meet Upset Faction in the world and he kills you, does that mean game over? I, for some reason, I thought you meant IRL. Holy shit. Uh, yeah. Yeah. If, if you die in any way, it, it's game over. Yes. Doesn't matter if you DC or if you get ganked, if PvP flagged or whatever. Yeah, any death is dead. So, I don't know. I think. The little yeah. prime for the favorite guzzler. Thank you for the prime two months, Murloc. Appreciate that. It's a warlock up there. Man, dude, I hate these spawns here. They're so obnoxious. I guess we just sit here and wait. Do you guys remember when we did the freaking rune here on Shaman? There was like that totem. Shit. What's up, Kicks? What is the time at MMO you played the other day was sponsored? Terrace Land. It was called Terrace Land. Cross-platform MMO. Free-to-play cross-platform. Pretty decent. The raids were actually quite fun. I enjoyed it. Yeah, there's a... I think there's actually a link down in the panel still. I haven't really removed the panel quite yet. But there, there if you want to check it out, you can check it out clicking on the panel. Yeah, it's still there. Mage Lord. Uh, Mage Lord. No, we need shamans. No, we need some shamans. You plan for yourself. You also live with the day. You feel like living. Uh, oh God. I th okay, you guys are like talking to yourself. I'm not gonna intervene in that. Yeah. No, I haven't done tool frack yet. Oh, mate. That's the last shaman I need. I'm not gonna buy them. I'm, I'm, you know, I'm mythical. You know, we do as we do. Is it this one? Gonna, watch this one heal mine as well. Bitch. There's a cave with more shamans. Yeah, down there, there could be some more shamans in the cave. I just checked it though, and somebody had cleared it, right? One more. One more. One more. One more. One more. That's a private conversation. Sorry, sorry, sorry. My bad. I'll uh, stay out of it. Where's the brutes? The brutes are up north. So I'm just doing the shamans first, and we can do the brutes after. And then we do the little screechers, and then we escort the chicken, and then we're done with Feral Ass for now. Illy Gazoo less than three. Oh, Hunter, two months. Thank you very much. Kill the ogre so hit the cycle. Yeah, I think they share respawns with the. Uh, Warlocks, I believe. But if we just wait, if we're just patient, patient here, we'll get it. Should I sub to Yaguza? What do you think? If you feel like it, you can do it. If you don't feel like it, you don't have to. It's up to you, man. It's uh, completely uh, your your decision, man. I guess the nice thing about subbing is that you have like no su no ads and stuff. But they could, you can also have like a turbo for that, you know. If you say my name correctly, Neo so Neo Cycloned X. There you go. Crimson Carrot, think of the prime. Brother, I need a shaman. When's the dehydrator giveaway? Dehydrator giveaway. I don't know about that. No, I'm not sure about that one. Failed. Ah, oh, shit. Next time, man. I'll check up here. Surely there's a shaman up here. I'm actually dashing for this. <gasps> I see one. Oh, he's up, dude. I appreciate it, dude. Thank you. Plunderstorm hype. Plunderstorm is fun. I probably won't like main Plunderstorm when it comes out, but I'll play it. I'll I'll, I'll do like some uh, some Plunderstorm games here and there, for sure, dude. 
vibe it out with a few games of plunder. It's pretty fun. Asterox, what's up, man? Oh, is that Chops? No, that's Grimso. You look like Chops for a second. You're a very purple wizard, aren't you? Hey, hello. Opa, thank you. Alone be praised. Have a good one, mate. Have a good one. Bacon or buchan? Water the plant. Not right now. I, I don't want to overwater the plant, dude. It's gonna. It that's gonna kill it as well, man. You know, gotta be smart about that stuff. Eight brutes is coming up. There's some white stuff on my jerky. It's so dry, it's hard to even eat. It's probably the the sinew. Yeah, don't eat sinew. Try to g get around that. I am not in danger, Skyler. I am the danger. New Cyclone! Oh, you're coming in with the freaking, freaking five gifted subs as well, man. Jesus Christ, man. Well, I appreciate it, dude. Thank you very much. God damn. Dude, over 3k subs is ridiculous, man. So crazy. Thank you, Neo Cyclone. Gotta support my second favorite streamer. Who's your favorite? Huh? Who, 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 who's your favorite, huh? Better be someone cool and handsome. I'm waiting. It's Handsome Savix. Okay, I can respect that. You know, I can respect that. Fair enough. Okay, okay. It's always Savix Sash. Oh, okay. Uh, I'll respect it, dude. Have you seen this hardcore death clip? What are you linking? Give me a sec. I don't know what the heck that is. That does not look like a death clip. You think Savix is a fraud? Why is he a fraud? Okay, we just need the maulers. Or the brutes, sorry. We don't need the maulers. Is it worth buying a new PC? Highly depends on how much money you want to spend on it. A lot of the times, it's it's probably worth just upgrading uh, like a GPU or like a CPU or something. You know, instead of buying a whole new PC, you can upgrade like the parts that are like outdated, right? He's a wolf in sheep's clothing. Oh shit! You think Savix is a wolf in sheep's clothing? Okay, shit, that's a, that's a bit of an accusation. Damn. So you think he's like a bad boy underneath all the, the, the innocent... Uh... Yeah, okay. Is it because you watched some of his videos with Pilaf and you saw some of his, his dark sides coming out? Ooh! Oh, male, the little lord, man. Oh, that was such a good item, though. Monkey. But it's male monkey. I want leather. Damn it. Need some more brutes. I'm instigating. When he gets angry, he has a dark side. Holy shit. Nah, Savix is a good guy. I've known Savix for... Uh, almost seven years now. He's a good guy. He, he is a good guy. Yeah. Two more brutes here. How much for a decent computer? It depends. I mean, computers are expensive nonetheless, right? But you don't have to get like an end game PC, right? Okay, would it be fun to make a challenge where a druid can use gear with strength on it and war with no agi? Yeah, could be fun. I mean, any like self kind of like limiting challenge is quite fun, I think. On the druid here to, with this, I kind of decided not to do any of those. And just do like the achievements. I think the achievements have been really fun to do. But I didn't want to limit myself on a character I haven't even played before. Or like a class I haven't even like kind of played before anyway. So, yeah. How much? 10, 20, 50? Oh, for like in Danish money? I don't know, dude. Like, what can you get a good computer for? Like that can run most games? I don't know. A thousand? Fifteen hundred? For like a decent PC that can run most games, like okay graphics. 2K? 
12,000 Danish, 8k Danish. 8,000 Danish is around 1.4k for reference. Uh, yeah, like a, I would say between 1 and 2k USD. Or like Euro, right? Yeah. Okay, so we need to do the Veil Screechers. So kill the Gorps. And then do that. Funny story about this. On some private servers, guys. You used to be able to spam talk to the NPC here. Or like the ghost. And you would get the quest done in one Veil Screecher. Yeah. It's pretty cool. So like obviously you do this. You summon the Screecher Spirit. And you could spam spacebar like this. And you would get it done in one quick one thing, but you know, this is not a private server, so yeah. all right. Uh let's do this before we do the chicken escort. Frog shining, 100 bits, thank you. Classic, you need to run it over for two thousand. Bro, you could probably run classic on an actual you know those NP like like dude, literally like an old ass PC with a hamster running in it. Like you probably could. You would play on a very low graphics, but you know, classic is uh, pretty chill in that regard. Diamond, the ones with the floppy disks, yeah. Some janky private server that allowed that. Uh, most private servers are pretty janky. Nostalrius was the first private server that did it good. Yeah, that's why it gained so much popularity too. Okay. I tried to integrate it into 2000 graphics and it didn't work on my work PC. You tried to install World of Warcraft vanilla on your work computer? Bro! Dude, unbelievable. Yes? Well, you're trying to like, you know, farm a little bit of hardcore as you're working or something, or... Shit. Okay, okay. Let's go here. Ba -ba. Okay. But I give up my beard for a better hairline? Nah, I'm happy as I am. Okay, there we go. You release the spirits of the screeches, then you skin them. Exactly. Exactly. Okay, let's go do the chicken escort. And that's the final thing we're doing in Feral Eyes. Then we're gonna go get that uh, achievement done after. We probably should clear these guys, I think. <gasps> Wait! Oh shit, this is like a rare drop. I didn't even realize I got this, by the way. I think this is a rare drop from one of the mobs that we killed earlier. I think? Or is that from the quest? I don't know actually. Wawa. Wah. Uh, what do people brag about hairline? Give them a few years, man. 50% of them will have a worse hairline than I will. Yep. Yeah. Give them a few years. It'll come for them, too. <laughs> Going to Turkey soon? I'm happy with how I look. I don't think I need to do anything for myself in that regard. I think I look good. It's not the most uh, exceptional hairline, but, you know. I think I look fine as I do. Okay. Did I stream Sekiro? I do. I did. Okay. Yeah, I, I streamed all secure. I don't think there's a... Uh... What is it called? I don't think there's any bots of me doing that. I think you look better when you're with a shaved head. There's not even a hairline jerk when I say that. I've actually thought about uh, keeping it really short. Like bossing it. Yeah, I might, I might bust my hair. Like, just bzz, all the way short. Mm. 
I've been doing that for years. Honestly, it's not even anything to do with the hairline or anything like that. It's just so fucking easy having pretty much no hair. Like, dude, I don't have to worry about it being wet. I don't have to worry about the wind blowing in it. If I go take a shower, if I go swimming, like, it literally doesn't matter. It's always the same. It's it, like, it's just so easy. <laughs> so I, I think I might just keep it bust, man. I'm not gonna lie. You look great, bald. I've been very blessed with a with a good like head, right? So. Yeah. Like a dome. Yeah, a good dome. Exactly. And I can grow a decent looking beard too. So we got that rocking for us. Now I just need to get jacked and we got the Trinity, right? That's the holy trinity. Yeah, the buzz cut, the beard, and the jacked physique. Holy shit, I'll ascend, chat. I'll ascend. You'll see. Okay. Kratos build, yeah. Holy shit. Ares! <laughs> Holy. Are many things working in your favor? Yeah, 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 that's how we do it. Don't forget the tattoos. I don't know, I don't have any tattoos. I have thought about getting some someday. Uh, I don't know if I'll ever do it. I, I might at some point get some, but I don't have any currently. Okay. Do a plink tattoo, plink. Uh, feral scar, oh wait, oh, my, oh, of course it's full. Uh. Doesn't matter with that quest. Okay, cool. Let's do the escort, guys. This escort can be a little bit sketchy. It does give us some actual quite decent shoulders. We don't need those because we got flesh hide. It's like, uh, I think it's like some yetis and some gorillas. And then afterwards, it's some other mobs too. But we'll figure it out. All right, let's do this, boys. Let's do it. Should I... Protection, intellect, spirit... Let's do it, let's do it. This escort brings back bad memories. Yeah, I, I pre- Oh shit, I, I was gonna say I pre-cured these mobs beforehand, but I guess I didn't really do it properly. Oh, Miskiv died here? Oh, classic. Wait, did he actually? Oh yeah, I think he did. Oh, you hope you don't? I don't, I mean, if it happens and happens, Carlos, I wouldn't stress about things that is outside your control. Stuff is, some stuff is outside your control, man. Don't worry about it. Okay, so something I wanna... Oh, and there's the bear there. Something we could do here is, let's try to do this. Okay. Oh shit, okay, never mind, never mind, never mind. Okay, this is bad then. I, I, they were not, they were in aggro range. It's bear time. It's bear time. We gotta taunt these guys. Oh, another ape! It's fine. We are tanky, we are tanky, so we got that rocking for us. Okay. Gazoo Dinko 7. Didn't innovate. Shit. Okay.
You know what? I, I wanted to be really cool and I wanted to like uh, do a cool strat where I brought around these yetis and I didn't have to kill them. And instead, I freaking pulled like two extra mobs. Yeah. That was incredibly stupid. Yeah, that, that was really dumb. Okay. Okay, I can't really get to skin these guys, I think. No, it wasn't even content. I guess it was content bring because I wanted to show you guys like that you could bring the mobs around. All right, we got it though. We got it. So we don't have innervate. We do have potion coming up again. We should be able to do. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. We just we just passively regen our health right now. I do want to buff my thorns again though, so let's do that. Yeah, no innovate. It's fine, it's fine. Yeah, dude, bark skin is awesome. Like, I, I don't get pushback. It's so great. Yeah, it's really, really nice. You can skip the last pack. Yeah, you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah you can skip it. I still don't know if I want to do it. I feel like... Maybe I just send it and actually kill it. I think I can kill it. Rate my setup? <laughs> what is this chair, man? Dude, I, that's, uh, that chair is almost too comfortable for a gaming setup. Are you like sitting like this gaming? Like, what are you, you're sitting like this here, man? Like, I feel like my arms are gonna get messed up if I sit like that. That's the throne? Yeah. Okay. He said he rates his setup, not talk shit about it. I rated it! I, it is... It's okay. Okay. Grotok apes. Let's kill these guys. <gasps> okay. There he is. Do, 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 do. I could literally stall this till I have innervate again. But I think we're good. <laughs> okay. The gaming position? <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's what I meant. Alright. Uh, Nice. Bam. Oh my, can you calm down, bro? Oh my god, okay, no more skinning. I gotta keep up with this little chicken thing. Chicken little looking ass. What are my key bindings on number one in bear form? Um, I don't remember what I have there. I can take a look soon. Wait, he got it? Dude, he got the fucking valid. He soloed it on a 47 paladin. Dude, he might have a spot for the Sulfuraki if he wants to come. Shit, dude. What a chat, dude. What a freaking chat. Let's go. Pling a ling, pling a ling. So. I think. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Little lore. <laughs> it's funny. Yeah. Oh, watch up there, Kak. Watch up there. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, they're good. Yeah, you can literally just run past them. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. No, oh, he's fine up there, guys. Don't worry about it. Oh, you did it with the uh, Gusu wife. Oh, dude, that's the rogue we didn't bring to freaking uh, SM. And I did promise him to bring to another run. But we'll see. Let's, let's, let, let, first things first, I gotta do my achievement. I'm not griefing anyone, guys. I'm just playing game, okay? You gonna fly off? Why doesn't it fly off? I swear one of them flies off. I think it's the one in Hinterlands. 
Okay, let's go turn in these quests in Feral Ass. And then we gotta go there, turn the quest into Thalanar. And then we can go down to here, turn in that quest. And then we gotta go do the freaking pirates for that achievement. Okay. How does everybody want to kill this chicken so badly? I don't know. I think it's because it has like some information. I think the lore is you're just working, you're just running through the wilderness and the mobs that are in that wilderness is like ambushing you, right? Because they want to kill you. Yeah. Did you watch the OnlyFans update video? Only it last eight minutes. Uh, is there another video or what? Or is it the other one that you, you talked about? Because you said an hour, two and a half hours ago. Okay, so Topper, here's the thing you got to learn about me. And I'm really trying to get better about this in my life. I am way too... Um, when it comes to time management, I'm really bad. Okay? I, I, I think I can get something done in an hour that takes me three hours. Yeah. You know? Uh, I don't think I watched the P Sharks. Not that I remember, at least. That's why you don't have a real job. Ba ba ba! Hey! <laughs> hey, hey, yo! What about fans? Get him to. Hey, yo! This is a real job! Can you go through last words? Uh, I don't have any prepped, Moriel. Yeah. Just, just in the add-on. Uh. I would rather, uh, maybe not right now, if that's okay. Are you feeling cute today? No. Why not? Because I don't want to right now. Hello. Farewell. Okay, heroes, welcome. Cool. There's actually not a bad dagger, by the way, yeah, for rogues. You can get here. When are you gonna die today? I got moving into my apartment. I'm hoping you do. Oh, that's oh, the, the setup is from your new apartment, dude. We should do a setup review again. That was actually it's been really fun. We've we've done that a few times before, where people link in their setups and we mine. review them. Pretty fun. Cool. Good luck, darn asses. So now we have two quests for darn asses. Rise of the and then in search of knowledge. Cool. Let's start heading to Tanaris. Pling ling ling a ling, pling a ling 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 a ling, pling ling ling a ling, pling a ling a ling a ling. Be careful. Yeah. Set up review with all the grease and the 40 Red Bulls. Yeah. That's the reason so many people are playing hardcore again. I think there, it's just the hype is returning and there's only fangs happening, which is like a streamer. Uh, Event, I guess you could call it. So yeah, that's the main reason. I like to compare my million dollar mansion to people's apartment. I don't really have a million dollar mansion. I do have a house, which is very, very fortunate. But it's not a mansion. It's just, you know, a small house. You know? I send on Discord. Yeah. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll take a look at that, but just not right now. But I, I, yeah, I would like to know how to do it and stuff before I just, yeah. Okay. A house in Denmark equals mansion. Uh, maybe true. Uh, you can you can get some nice houses in Denmark. If you if you live on the countryside and shit, you can get some pretty decent houses for not, not crazy expensive. But then you have to live on the countryside, right? And mo most people have jobs, I guess, that requires them to go to the cities and stuff. So it kind of sucks living on the countryside. That's a nice cat. How big is my house? Uh, 90 square meters. Which is... In square feet, for all my American viewers, is 960 square feet. 960 square feet. That's my house. I do have a garden. I have a garden, yes. That's smaller than my... Wait, what? Uh, where in Denmark do you live? Uh, Norseland, Casper. 
It's right now, dude. It's perfect. It's perfect size. I, I I got a room for myself. We have a room for Mordial. There's a bedroom. There's a living room, and there's a kitchen. It's like at the moment, I that's really all I need. You know, it. I I really don't need more. Like I I it, you know. One day, I, I also a bathroom. I have a bathroom as well. Yeah, but I, I really don't need more. When I lived in my apartment, it was a 40 square meter apartment, so half the size, a little bit under half the size of my house, and I was even fine there. It just wasn't nice when when Mordial was there because we were so cramped, right? Okay. There we go. I am listening. Gachistan. Let's go. Yeah, this was my bathroom in my apartment. Yeah. No, not my bathroom. This was my shower. Sorry. Yeah. It was a hole in the wall. I. Right. Who's that in the picture? That's me. All right, I'm gonna BB one sec, chat. One sec. Sorry about that. I just have to go to the lavatory. Yeah, we can all assemble now, guys. We're here. When is Sulfurac? <laughs> very soon. Very soon, okay? Very, very, very soon. Yeah. When... As... Okay. <laughs> as soon as I have done this achievement... Here, this, as soon as I have done this, then we're doing it, yep. Love the content man, Bye banana hours power. Later. Billy, thank you. Do I like saunas? Why are you calling me Tin Tin? Thank you Billy for the 14 months. I, uh... <laughs> yes, I, I like saunas. Yeah, I do like saunas. Dude, look at that place right there, guys. Holy, what a place that is. Don't do- Nah, we've already played the song once today. I'm not gonna overdo it. Yeah, we've been- Yeah, I know where we are, guys. I know where- That is- That is what it is. Yeah, it is- You know what it is. You know what it is, dude. It's the little hardware store, dude. I'm not gonna lie. Okay. So, I think- I'm gonna do something a little bit silly key that I don't normally do. And I'm gonna skip some of these quests here because we're kind of just trying to do the pirate area because that's what we need to do for our achievement. You know? Play the song. Fine, I'll play it. There you go. There you go. You guys get the song. There you go. There you go. Alright. <clears throat> okay. Bang 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 Oh, can I buff? Oh, little buff for me. Thank you. The news. A little bit higher. And we can do ba 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 ba. There you go. And I really don't care. I have sixty-nine gold. 
There we go. Are you guys excited? Yeah, you guys are hyped for the song? Yeah. Then soon. Um. There we go. Oh, I can imagine. You guys got the mallet done, dude. They actually got the mallet of Sulfrak, dude. Let's go. You're viewing from a sauna in Dallas, Texas. Bro, I fucking love saunas. I want a sauna one day. I want to have a sauna one day in my garden. Yeah. One day. That's the goal. Yeah. I have a sauna when you can give it away to us. Hey, yo. To play sauna golem? No, just... No. Mm -mm -mm. Let's get Diablo out. Got the best deals anywhere. Ah, Going to the hardware store. I get morning Donny morning morning Donny glue now. Would you look at all that stuff? Relax. This is for the sulfur act thing. So now we got that prequest done as well. And we can get Caliph Scorbit's thing. We got turn the video turn video bit a bit of boopa beep a beep a papa poop a papa beep a papa poop a papa. How you doing? Keep it real. Oh! Am I a supporter of the arcane dream? Uh... I don't know. Uh, what does that mean? Bing, bing. Let's go check for Caliph. See if we can get his head before we go. Mitch Jones meme. Oh yeah. True. I am going to the hardware store. Caliph. Where are you? Bam. Where are you, Caliph, you little piece of shit? Um. Mm, no. Maybe someone else is looking for him. Yeah, maybe they are. <gasps> there he is! Alright, he does have two friends. I'm actually gonna be smart. You know, chat? You may, may not believe it, but I'm gonna do this. Right? Which will pull the two guys next to him. And henceforth activate what we call a split pull. Yep. There we go. And now we can just solo bolo him. I think these guys are tied to uh, Kalos Scorbitt's thing, so they might come back. But at that point, I'll over already have him, like, super far down and he's, like, pretty much dead, right? I don't really know if they actually are tied to him. Guess we'll see in a few seconds if, they're com if they come running. Nope, they're not. Alright, free quest. There you go. Split pulling is such an OP thing. Like, it, it's... For, for hardcore, it's incredibly powerful. So now there's like two, just two stealth mobs running around. Yeah, there is. Oh, fuck! <laughs> hey, 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 hey! I'm good, I, I don't need help. I'm good, I'm good. Don't worry. No, I'm good. <laughs> Let's help this pilot then real fast, guys. Yeah, let's... Um, yeah, let, let's, let's help this pilot then out. He accidentally pulled some mobs, so let's just, uh, you know, help him out real fast. There we go. Ah, uh, uh, it's fine. 
fat boy. Thank you for the prime, fat. Am I a supporter of the Blast Wave Dream? I, I think Fire Mage is way cooler than Frost. Yeah. Thank you, Fat. Thank you so much, Fat Boy. I prefer Chunky. Okay, sorry. You aren't planning on reacting to the OnlyFans update just so I can stop typing? I don't know. I'm just not doing it right now. <laughs> I do want to watch it, but I, I at the moment, my uh, my brain is like in questing mode. Do I like marshmallows? Only over an open fire in the evening. Yeah. Apart from that, no, I don't really like marsh marsh uh, mar marshmallows. But if, if it's over an open fire, and you're sitting outside, and you're, you're toasting them a bit, then I like them. Alright, so what we're doing for this uh, achievement now, guys, is we need something called... The Fragment of Cuerco's Map, or something like that. It's a little bit of an RNG drop, which means that we could just get Giga Unlucky and not get it at all. But, then we would have to be incredibly unlucky, right? So, we should be able to get it, I think. All right, hopefully. What's the heat map like down here? It's quite red. It's, it's because that's where all the mages AoE farm. Do I like Piwakea? Um, yeah, they're pretty good. I, I'm not much of a sweet tooth. I, I like salty things more than sweet, so like, I would rather have like, you know, some chips or like, you know, something like that than like something sweet, I think. Yeah, more of like a salty snack kind of guy. Like beef jerky, yeah, like beef jerky. Okay, let me just heal myself here. Jerky main? Yeah, I'm a jerky main, I think. Okay, I think all of these mobs can drop it, right? It doesn't really matter which one of these we kill. It's just all the, the pirates or whatever. Salty licorice. Oh, I do like salty licorice. I, I, it's not like I hate sweet things. I, I do like like cake or like, you know, candy or whatever, but I, I, I'm more of like a salty guy. Denmark. Okay, 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 okay. Oh my god, that's a big warrior, isn't that? What's this place? I was stuck at my 49 warrior and got killed from a ranged mob, couldn't do anything. Yeah, the freebooters are ranged. You gotta be careful here. An aquamarine! Let's go. Oh, that's back in the day when Joker, a uh, Joker, sorry, was farming uh, Maraudon, man. Okay. Pets. Good times, yeah. Good old Joker. Oh, wow, yeah. Okay. Mana neat. Yeah. We need that thing. Hopefully, we can get it. But then Joker didn't ban all his perks. I think he got fed up with it, probably. I don't know. Maybe he got fed up with it, the ch chat being very spammy. Not sure. Uh, I need some poirates, mate. Need some poirates. Man, I gotta... If we find any chests, I gotta make sure we pick it up. Because I really need a true silver bar for that quest chain that we started earlier today. Hopefully we can get it. Show me your gear. We're looking pretty decent, like on gear. Like, we don't have the most insane gear, but we've gotten overall quite nice pieces of gear, you know? So, it's good. He couldn't beat the monster he created. Oh, Joker, do you mean? Yeah, same with Grayson, man. Maybe one day Grayson will snap as well. Dented Footlocker. 
So that's Smite Smiley Hammer. It is freaking Smite Smiley Hammer. It freaking is, dude. I haven't gotten a Crawl Pummeler. I've farmed it like for seven days now. Thanks for the tip. Sparking at Grayson now. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Okay, have fun. Maybe you should solo Nomer. Oh, really? Good idea, man. You trying to get Grayson to work out with Knut? I don't think that's ever gonna happen. Bobble Bobble just died. F. Pat McGroin. Dude, that's the guy that got the freaking mallet. Well, you already got the carrot, so I guess you did a run earlier. Yeah. Okay, I'm a little buff, McGroin. All right, all right, all right. Hail to the the girl, I need to keep grinding though, man. If I actually want to do soul for act today, I gotta get this stuff done, eh? You're Denmark's biggest streamer. I don't think I'm Denmark's biggest. No, I don't think I'm even close to being Denmark's biggest streamer. I don't think so. There we go. Who is? I don't know, actually. I'm not sure who is. I mean, I don't stream in Danish. I, Simba Prisen chat is uh, something in Denmark. It's like... What is what, what is the reference to, like, Amer uh, uh, English? It's like a content creator award or some shit? Where, like, all the Danish content creators, they go get, like, uh, awards for being, like, the biggest or, like, the, the most entertaining or whatever the heck. Yeah, something like that. There's a lot of Facebook streamers that stream to 20k daily. Really? That's crazy. Holy shit. Okay. Is the Fran still going strong? I honestly think the Fran is full on just retired mode. Bro, the Fran just streams like World of Warcraft in the morning. He 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 he's used to be like a Overwatch streamer, but he he's just gaming well. You must have so many rewards then? Oh, I don't have any, no. I don't really mind. I mean, I don't really have to go on a stage and get, you know, applauded for what I'm doing. I feel like just being able to do this is, for me, a reward enough, as it is. You know, I get to do this for a living. I'm absolutely fantastic. I do great, I feel like. I don't need more validation about it, you know? Okay. Feels more like a popularity contest than anything. Okay. Man, I haven't gotten a single piece. I think it's like, I don't know what, I don't remember what it's called, the thing we're trying to get. It's like a little paper that we're opening and then we get some map, frag map fragments. Any advice for moving to Denmark? Highly depends on where you're moving from. I don't know. I've never moved to Denmark. I've lived here my whole life. So maybe I'm not the best to ask. You get the fragments from the footlockers. Yeah, you can get a key and you can get a fragment that way. But you, they can also drop the fragments, I think. You're from Czech. I don't, I don't know how the process is moving into Denmark. I know it's a, it's a bit of a doozy actually getting a, a visa and shit. But yeah. You know what? I think we're going to have to do this into that into this and then go in here and then do this yeah we have thorns okay we have thorns thank god think of it like you would move to norway that's not really the same break because i can move to norway with no problem i don't need to go through an, an immigration process to go to Mo norway okay we're fine, guys. We're fine. The bears, you guys don't realize how strong the bear is. Okay. Yeah, that's really fucking powerful, dude. Dude, it's really eerily quiet here. Like, listen. 
it's just quiet. Okay. We build up the rage and we heal up. Hell yeah, brother. Do this. The loot weaving boys, and then we can go. And I really hope we get this freaking fragments. The Tenaris pirate trap, yeah. How do you disarm a pair? A bear? You can't get disarmed. I think if you're a rogue, this quest is really e like this achievement is really really easy. Elias is from Sweden. Grubby is my second favorite Danish Twitch streamer. I think Grubby is uh, from from Netherlands. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, he's Dutch, I think. Same thing? <laughs> that is not the same thing. That is not the same thing at all, okay? Same, that is not the same thing, dude, okay? Oh, nice to meet you. Are you from the country Europe? Oh, yes, I've heard a lot about it. I want to visit Europe one day. Seems like a great country. Hi, Bingo. How you doing, bro? Yeah. Yeah. Just finished your exam. Did you uh, farm W? So what happened, uh, Muffer? How did it go? Will I get? I hope I will get this. Uh. Dregor, thank you for the prime. Pr prim, thank you for the prime. What do you think about the pool and jacuzzi streams on Twitch? Do you think it's fair compared to other streamers who make content and interact with people who come without having the desire to ask for donations? Twitch is more than a gaming platform these days. I don't really care to watch any of that kind of content personally. I, I mainly go on Twitch for gaming, but it's really more than just gaming these days, so it is what it is. At the end of the day, I, I don't think... I don't know if anything is unfair, because ultimately people will watch what they want to watch. Right? So saying something is like sucking viewers out of other streamers because they're doing it is, I think it's wrong. Because people will watch what they will, right? But I'm, I'm on Twitch for gaming. I, I watch gaming streamers, right? People can watch what they want. I will say though, I wish, I wish Twitch was more of just gaming. You know, I, I do wish it was more a little bit more than that. Uh, more just like that, but... It's just changed, right? It's a different, different platform these days. Yeah. Yeah, I remember there used to be a rule back before I streamed, but there was a rule where, like, you had to have, like, a certain percentage of your stream being gaming. Oh, just yoink! So you couldn't, like, uh, you, you couldn't even, like, sit in, in full cam for a long time. Aquamarine, come on. Huh? Do you ever consider moving to another platform like Kick or YouTube? I don't think I would ever go on Kick personally. I, I I could see a world where I was streaming on YouTube, but not currently. I I, I think kind of like my home when it comes to streaming is on Twitch, right? That's where I like I have my community. That's where we stream. If I were to change platform one day, which I don't think I will, I could see YouTube being a thing. Because I have a YouTube channel, right? But I, I think Twitch is nice for streaming. You could dual stream, yeah. You could do that, but I, I kind of like... They're like, okay, you want to watch my stream? You go on Twitch. You don't watch my stream or on Twitch or Kick or YouTube or, you know... I like that, like, okay, you want to watch the stream, you go on Twitch, right? And that, that's where everybody's talking in the chat, that's where the whole community is, that's it. If the Twitch drama kills the site, I don't see a reason to swap. Oh yeah, you mean unless Twitch, like, actually dies down? Yeah. Kick equals more money, think about this. I, I, I make enough money, man. I don't need to like go to a platform to try to make more money. I, I, I'm completely fine with what I'm doing right now. You know? 
I'm I, I'm I'm okay, man. I I, I make I, I make a good amount of money. I'm I'm fine. Right. Enough money? Yeah, I mean, I make enough where I can I can live comfortably. I, I I'm definitely I'm not a millionaire, no, but I I live comfortably, right? I, I'm fine. Okay. Do you own a horse? I don't. My sister does, though. Rich. I'm not a millionaire. I, I, I do not have a million dollars, chat, okay? But I, I, I am comfortable, right? I'm definitely, uh, you know, I'm chilling. I'm chilling. Okay. Mm He's got nine. <laughs> yeah, I, <laughs> no, I don't. But I, I'm, I'm definitely fine, right? For sure. So, very, very blessed to be able to do what I'm doing. I also think it's also, like, I have my community here, man. Like, Twitch is where we have, like, the whole stream. That's where, like, everybody comes to watch and shit. I wouldn't want to, like, you know, sacrifice that. I feel like it's nice. What's up, Himano? How you doing, mate? If I retired, how long would I have survived? I don't know. I, I feel like I've done quite well for myself, so I'm, I'm very, very blessed for that, right? Okay. Dude, what is this guy? Little? Is this Chops, dude? That's Chops with a, a little, like, staff of Jordan, dude. Holy shit. God damn. Did he ever go to university? Nope, I didn't. Yo, NNS. What's up, mate? You know what the chest for this key is, Captain's Key? Uh, in the boat. In the, in the captain's room, in the boat, there's a locker. Go in there, Chops. Yeah, he has a uh, Staff of Jordan, guys. Cell found character, by the way. Staff of Jordan. Really fucking lucky. Yeah, insane, actually. Do do do. No texting now. No other tips. Uh, you, you can't really divide 3,000 subs into $5. Uh, Twitch takes a cut, and not all subs from each country is the same. So it, it doesn't equal like that. But yeah. It's more like two bucks. Yeah, it's more like two dollars. And then Twitch, there's taxes and shit, right? So. Okay. It keeps giving me a little buff. You know. It's not a rip up. It depends. Like, some people pay more for a sub, some people pay less. If you have a, a better sub cut, you get a higher cut, right? So I get the. Uh, I think I get 70, 30. Yeah, I get I get a 70-30 split. Yo, Ananas, yo. <laughs> hey. What's up, man? Got two arena masters. Yo! Just putting it out there, bro. Casho, you're putting a market on your back, dude. Okay? You would don't you gotta be careful, man. Be careful out there, dude. I saw people on Twitter complain how they got a bunch of gifted subs and it was two dollars, so they got less than fifty dollars out of it. Well, I mean, I don't know. I mean, any support is support, right? It doesn't matter if it's like you know. You like some people are very privileged, man. <laughs> like shit, dude. Like you're you're playing video games, man, and you you get to like do it for a living. People support you monetarily. That's a freaking blessing, man. You know. Right. Yeah, it's very entitled. That's why I always try to, in, uh, you know, emphasize that watching is enough, man. Boop. It's hard work, not a blessing. I, I don't know. I, dude, obviously it's awesome to be able to do it, but it's still, like, you're still very lucky to be able to do it, you know? For sure. 
What's my favorite expansion? Vanilla. If you're talking about like outside vanilla, then probably TBC. Uh, okay, I've killed a lot of these and we haven't even gotten a single one of those things. I really hope we can get this. I, I really freaking hope we can get this shit, but we'll see. It, it depends on RNG, I guess. Boa Dog donated $25 with no message attached to it at all. Thank you? I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Jesus. I appreciate that. You don't got lucky, you just grinded and made it. Please correct me if I'm, you think I'm wrong. Uh, I mean, I don't know. I, I do think I put in a lot of effort to, for the stream and the YouTube, for sure. But it's a mixture of effort and consistency and also luck, right? It's a, it's a mixture of everything, I think. There, there's a lot of luck involved, but there's also a lot of work involved into it, if you're doing anything, I think. It's, it's a mixture. It's a mixture, for sure. Tuki, thank you for the prime. It's like a lot of like being at the right, the right, the right place at the right time, and then you know utilizing the opportunities that you get correctly, right? Like I, I started streaming Vanilla WoW on private servers before Vanilla WoW was even announced. Like I, I didn't know they were gonna announce Vanilla WoW and make it official. I just really loved the game, so I started streaming it, right? And I was one of the streamers that like. I was one of the few early streamers of the game, right, on, on Twitch, so... Yeah, it was a mixture of a lot of things. It's definitely a mixture of a lot of different things. Man, I really hope we get this shit. Because we... I mean, yeah, I, I can... Farm these mobs for a while, right, but... How many subs did I have before WoW Classic? I mean, I, I don't know how many subs I had, probably like 50, maybe? I don't know. There we go. It's an interesting combo to have though. But yeah. Man. I don't know if any of these mobs have a higher drop rate on it. I'm not sure if they do. The Danish goat, man. I I don't know. I'm, I'm really, really happy about the whole everything, man. I get to play and stream a game I absolutely love and do it for a living. That's freaking crazy. Uh, let me heal myself here. Get a little heal off and then we keep going. Mage weave. My bags are going as well. Very bad, very bad. Any tips on how leech viewers, I mean networking, leech viewers. I don't know. I, I never was really good at networking with people. I kind of just always did my own thing, man. And I made some nice friends within the community, but... You know. I just made friends with people in the streaming community because it's like they played the same game that I played, so we ended up playing together. Right? I, I, dude, I, I met Soda on a freaking private server, like, a dueling. You know? Okay. Are you winning, son? I don't know. I'm trying to get this freaking ship schedule. Or, like, whatever it's called. Hail Warmane? Not Warmane! Hen House. Those, those who knows, knows. Oh, I forgot to buff back. Now I feel like an asshole. Shit. I'm sorry. I'll, I'll, I'll buff you, mate. I'll buff you. This is the freaking priest we met in the goddamn... Tiltrasil cave, by the way. What the fuck? Oh my god. I remember you, man. Henhouse was goaded. Henhouse was a uh, dueling server. Strictly for duels and like uh, PvP. Oh shit. Dude, there's so many people here, man. This is insane. Oh god. Where, where is it? Do you say COVID 19 is going to a breakthrough? 
Yeah, COVID was huge, I think, for like any streamer, because it's like everybody just stayed at home, <laughs> so they had way more time to watch Twitch. But it didn't like boost my numbers like crazy, I think. I don't know. Dead Zone Hunters and Hen House, yeah. That's where I like. I, that, uh, Hen House and like those private servers was where I learned how to play like PvP in vanilla. That's where I, I spend a lot of my time. Okay. Brother, man. We're definitely gonna finish this quest before even getting any of the ship schedules. Is there any of the mobs that has a higher drop rate? I don't know. I'm late. Have we already been streaming for five hours? What the f Jesus Christ. When soul frag? I'm trying to do this achievement! And then we'll do it, but god damn it, it's not dropping it! It's not it's not dropping it, man! I asked you two hours ago. Dude, I am horrible at time management. It is my biggest, one of my biggest flaws in life, I think. Being able to communicate properly and time management. That's my two biggest things. Yeah. And they go really bad together as well. It's like a wombo combo. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I would like to call myself a time optimist. You know what? That's a really good way of putting it. I am a time optimist. Yep. Oh, man. Can you lose the schedule? I'm trying, man. Shit, dude. I'm trying to get it. Optimus Prime. South Street dock workers have the best drop rate at 10%. Okay, dock workers? Okay, gotcha. Alright, so we'll go slay a bunch of dock workers. How many parts does he have? Zero. I have zero parts. Oh yeah, thorns, true. What are you, what is happening here? Alright, so dark workers. They're around here, right? Soul for Equin. Soon, my child, soon. We are about to go into <laughs> Sulfurag very soon. Just a little bit more leveling. Yeah, I have to do this achievement before 46. That's why I am kind of trying to get it right now. I did. Key red hat. Wait, what? I don't... I'm trying to start a club. You have freaking... Wow! What the... Two cell phone staff of Jordans! From the fucking... The, the same guild. Our guild. A warlock with staff of Jordan and a freaking priest now? Dude. That's insane. Easy. <laughs> and there he is. Look. Yeah, you guys want to touch staffs or what? Yeah, go touch staffs, guys. Where's your weapon, bro? Oh my god. Look at that. Look at these plips, man. It's two Staff of Jordans. Staff of Jordan is like a rare drop, rare world drop. That's essentially pre-rate this. And you can use it at level 35. Yeah, it, it's like a level 60 weapon for level 35. It, it's, it's like that good. Find a warden staff, bro. Imagine I find a warden staff. <sighs> Are we ever gonna get this Quergo's gold? 
This could be the only achievement I could see myself not doing, just because we can't do it in time. Who was Jordan? Probably some worker at Blizzard, I think. Should have started sooner. Well, I have 64% XP, and I just I'm just grinding mobs, right? So either we get it or we don't, right? Why are you swimming out there, man? Bitch. I started fresh level 44 and did that quest right before digging 46. Skill A meta. Eight fine cheddar. Do they just have cheddar in their pockets? I guess they do. It's a 10% drop chance and then a 20% drop chance off of a piece of the map dropping. Some pocket cheese. Yeah, you guys have some pocket cheese just lined up. I saw the achievement on 40% and then I didn't get in. Oh, really? Fuck me. I don't know why I thought it was so easy clap. I think it's because whenever I've actually leveled here, I've gotten a lot of the, the, the map fragments just casually. But maybe that's just because I've had good... Hey, Gazoo. Are you still on the fence on dropping LW for Alk? That fucking scared me, man. That sound just scared me for some reason. Uh, <laughs> oh god. Uh, yeah, I have been thinking about swapping leatherworking for alchemy. Maybe after I get bullshit helmet, because I got uh, lip as well. I got a lip recipe. Yeah. I don't want to know about that, Sponge Girl. Do I like snooze? No, I don't snooze, so I lose. Yeah. Some new healing shoulders. Oi. Oi! First pirate wood footlocker! Yes! That's one, that's one, that's one! Cool, we got the middle fragment, lower fragment, lower fragment. Now we just need middle and um, and upper. Yeah. So that's the thing we want. We want the pirate footlocker and then we want to get the fragments out of that. That's it. That was the one with 10%. The rest is... Oh. Here is a large push to make the choice easier. Shit, you really want me to go uh, alchemy though, huh? I appreciate that, dude. I appreciate that, man. Uh. Um. All right, let me just do that. Dude, there's a guy doing a freaking one defense challenge where if his defense goes to two, he resets his run. I told him he can join the guild once he gets level 10, and he says he's gonna. It's gonna. He, a week. He, yeah. That, but by the way, if you don't know what that means, that means basically if he gets hit once, he pretty much levels up his defense. So, if you guys know who the Happy Hob is, he's essentially doing a no hit run in World of Warcraft. Yeah. Okay. Drop your stupid pirate locker, you... Dammit. Swash Buckler. Did I just pull the whole ship? I think I did. That's, uh... Oh, it's only one guy. Okay. Hi, Parsh. Oh, swingway. Oh, thank you. Rats attack back. I learned that the hard way. Oh my god, you lost the challenge to a rat. Oh, Phantom Blade. That's fucking hot. Okay. 
A little rat, dude. Okay. Sounds like Hop. The heavy Hop. Hey, he's like a Dark Souls... I don't know. Person. How am I doing today? Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. I'm here trying to do my achievement and I'll be struggling a bit. I'll be struggling a bit right now, but I hope we can get it done. We have almost a full half quarter of a level that we can get this done with, right? So it should be okay. Andre gives you a box. Yeah, but Andre is dead all the time. Do I like Peyo's humor? I think Peyo's a funny streamer. He is definitely a funny streamer. A full half quarter. Yeah, exactly. I'll wait for this guy to spawn too. First floor of the shop. Oh, in there you mean? I could also go into the, the boat here. There's actually a load of people here. I guess it's because it's reset day, so... Uh, People are kind of just uh, on one layer only. Barangian guard, Fenderus. What do you have to Way, say? Why, me scallywags? Rumor is the yep. hog diddling druid is near our ship, and I be wanting that head on a pike. Bring be the shapeshifter's head and a cask of old rum. Plenty of gold awaits ye. Oh my. Pirate, he's here. Follow that sound. Follow the sound of the pig. Is that what you're saying? Uh, okay, I have like a pig in my pocket or what? Whatever, dude. Come on, man. Dude. I'm at work and Jolene by Dolly just came on. Oh, sure. Jolene. Jolene. Okay. Where's Japlo? Oh, he's in my pocket. I should get him out though, to be fair. No, I should get him out. Where's Japlo? He's in my pocket. Okay, I'll get him out soon, okay? Man, I could start be stuck here forever. I actually could. I'm I it's starting to sink in. I See, I thought it would oh, Never mind. I thought it would be like quick maybe 15 minutes get the ship schedule and move out but i didn't account for rng yeah have you thought about doing a streamer meet and greet here in denmark uh i don't know i i I don't feel like I'm like uh, at that level where like it's like I don't know maybe it's just yeah I don't know I've thought about it but I, I I'm not sure if it's like not not awkward I don't, I don't feel like like why would people want to meet me that's what I'm thinking like I'm not that important I'm just you know I, I'm just a streamer you know I just <laughs> I'm not that exciting, you know? I'm, uh, shit. Maybe people not want to meet you, you're awesome. I don't know, I, I I have thought about it. I'm like, nah, I don't know. I, I don't think people are gonna be interested or whatever. Okay, there you go. You put yourself in a position to have fans? I, I guess that's true. I just, I don't, when I see like other creators and stuff. They feel like very big and extravagant and stuff. I don't feel like that. I'm kind of, I'm just kind of just playing games, dude. We're just vibing, you know, it is what it is. But maybe one day it could be cool. I, I think if I did something like that, it would probably be at an event already, right? So like, it, it would be like, if there's like a Twitch con or like, maybe some event in Denmark or whatever, and I would go to that, I'd be like, hey guys, I'm gonna be at this place if you wanna co come say hi or something, right? That, that, that would probably be it, I think. 
Let's see who died. Teskelas died. Hey. That sucks, man. That sucks, dude. F try to finish him off the with a ranged attack. That helps. I don't know. I mean, either you get it or you don't, right? Is this guy coming for me? He is. All right, let me just heal myself then. What happens if you don't get the achievement? I mean, nothing happens, but I would like to get it because I put myself on a challenge, right? Doing it as long as the amount of people is manageable would be smart. I, I do think I do think I do think it's fun, like meeting people from the community and the stream and stuff. I, I feel like whenever I went to TwitchCon or BlizzCon or something like that, all the people I've met have always been very very nice. So it, it is definitely nice and fun meeting people from the stream and the YouTube and stuff. Like it, it's like uh, wholesome, right? But I haven't set up like an actual meet and greet ever. You know. <gasps> please. Please, 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 please. That's actually not bad. I don't know if the pirates... I don't know if this thing can have, like, fragments. I think it can. This is actually pretty big. The captain's key you open up in the, in the chest in there. Don't know if it can have fragments, but it can have loot, so... And I think it can have fragments, too, actually, now that I think about it. Yeah, that's pretty huge. Well, let me let me just clear my way in. Back to the boats, boys. He hates us. No, I don't know. I just I don't feel like what I don't. When I look at other streamers, they feel like very important, right? Very. When I see them at like events and shit, they feel like they're very, very, very important and like, you know, shit like that. And I'm kind of just, <laughs> I just play fucking classic WoW and like some variety games here and there, you know? I'm just, uh, I, you know? Okay. Do this here. Alright, alright, alright. Okay, okay, okay. Drunk stream in Copenhagen? Oh god. I don't know about that. I don't know if that's a good idea. The boats are so quiet. Oh, I need to buff myself with thorns. You know the narcissist that needs all the attention? I think a lot of people, a lot of streamers probably are very attention hungry. For sure. Okay. You have 4k people watching you smash classic well, you should feel important. I, I think it, it it can be very scary letting stuff like that get to your head. Right. Okay. Is it in here? No. Yeah, it is. It is in here. Nice. Oop. There we go. Psychopaths are overrepresented in content creation. Probably because it's like a, a kind of line of work where you have a lot of people like attention and shit, and they like that. Okay, 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 okay. Something good, something good. Come on, baby. That literally couldn't be worse. That actually just couldn't be worse. What the fuck is that? What are you doing in here with all those mobs? That's straight. I got a wooden leg. Like, what is that, man? A wooden leg. Wow. Great. That's just fantastic, isn't it? Absolutely great. Okay. You stream WoW to 4k viewers, you're not important. I can tell you're a Grayson viewer, Torden. You have a lot of hatred inside of you. Can you get multiple keys or just one? I could loot another key and get it again. Yeah, yeah I could. So we could just get lucky, right? You have 140 kills before leveling, you have 100 chance per fragment, you need two different fragments, you won't do it in time. Hey, bro, either you do it or you don't, okay?
Either you do it or you don't, dude. Okay, and I'm I, I wanna do this achievement, so I'll try to do it. <sighs> Soul for act today, by the way. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, like bro. Okay. Oh, wow, that's a good thing for like uh, clothies, actually. What the fuck? Dude, if I was a mage, man, I would be all over that. Short stream today, by the way. Shut up, shut up, shut up. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, baby, like Yes. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Juice me up. Juice me up. Juice me up. Okay, middle or upper? Yes! Yeah! Okay, just need middle now. We just need the middle now, boys. Skibbity! Let's go! Yahoo! Okay. Why don't you use spend the time to upgrade bags? Uh... Fine, I'll delete the fish oil. Fine. Because I, uh, you know, it is what it is. Uh, ah. Oh, I'm low health. I didn't even realize that. I think Gazoo is the most talented streamer. He managed to play golf in classic. Wow, Gazoo is. <laughs> Shut up, man. <laughs> Whatever. Alright, let's buff myself. Don't forget you have a standing disc. Oh yeah! Wait, true! Thank you. Nice! Oh my... Oh! Holy crap, sorry for that. Jesus Christ. Oh. What was that noise? Sorry, I was just letting letting go of some uh, tension. No, my my back is sore, guys, because I I'm uh, I had strained my my back muscles, my incredibly powerful and strong back muscles, so I'm just a bit sore. Yeah. Alright. We are two for two. Two two out of three. Two out of three so far. Do you own any turtleneck sweaters? Yeah, but I don't wear them. Because whenever I wear them, people make fun of me. Okay, so I don't wear my turtleneck sweaters. I have one. I have one turtleneck, and when I was wearing it, people made fun of me, so I stopped, I took it off, and I put on another shirt. Yeah. Whatever, man. Don't let the bullies win. No, they didn't win. I just didn't want to deal with it, okay? I just didn't want to listen to the comments, so I took off the shirt. Yeah. Swift, thank you for the tier one. It's not about letting anyone win, okay? Oh, I'm getting hella, hella XP just from grinding these guys. I'm saying everyone turned 30 and have back pain one day later and we watched this. No, it's not back pain. I, it's just my, my latissimus dorsi, this back muscle there, and that back muscle there is very sore. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I need to kill freaking Andre. Did you skip upper back? No, my true PC is Maximus is still very, very well developed. Another month, another month to ask for the beautiful feature called Media Share. No. And on the next one. No, 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 no. Media Share will happen with Media Share happens, okay? And 
I don't plan on doing any media share anytime soon, okay? I, 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 not anytime soon. Oh fuck, did I say God of War tomorrow? Okay, let's go here. We need... Okay. Media share when he needs cash for the wedding. <laughs> We're gonna do don't... Guys, let's have a dono goal for my wedding. Guys, dono goal for my wedding. Everybody. No, 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 no. Mech Swift, thank you for the gifted. Oh man, this is this feels to me like gambling. Like I, I don't, I'm not like a gambling Andy IRL, but like this is probably the closest I'll get to gambling. Like, like farming for the ship schedule and map fragments in World of Warcraft vanilla. Ow, for Satan! Sorry. No media share, but what about the sink giveaway promised a while ago? Sorry about that. Sorry, sorry about that. Uh, Varaxor, I'm not. Didn't promise a sink giveaway. <laughs> didn't promise that. No, I kicked my chair accidentally because I was stretching my uh, my hamstrings. I am not in danger, Skyler. Dingus Swingus. I am the danger. Thank you for the five gifted subs, dude. Three lower parts. Oh my god. Is everybody out here just farming these uh, fragments, man? Like, hello? Thank you for the five subs, Stingus. Thank you. Appreciate it, dude. Thank you. Have you ever considered getting into acting in a serious way and moving to Hollywood? I would never want to move to Hollywood, man. No. That sounds like the worst possible thing in my life. Okay. Yeah. If I ever want to move somewhere else outside of like the house here, I mean, probably, I mean, probably like we're looking at you know something in the countryside more, right? That's pretty much it. Okay. Chocolate, what's up, mate? Atika, thank you for the gift of up to Brick. Wow, you don't want to live on the countryside or what, Moriel? Come to Brazil, okay. Countryside of Serbia. Yeah, man, we'll, we'll have a double mansion, guys. We'll have a mansion in Denmark and a mansion in Serbia. Ship schedule. You freaking got it, mamma mia. Grant, that's like a bonus quest. Yeah, just two mansions, man. Easy club. Hey, 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 hey. Middle, 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 middle. Come on! We have to smell. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Dude, how lucky is that? We got three foot lockers and we got three fragments. What the fuck, man? There it is. Cuergo's treasure map. Woo! W, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. This map shows a stretch of beach with a southern face. Below the map are words elegantly written. South of Weedle, south of home. Find the mast and flag and bone. Take you there if you're bold. They can claim Cuergo's gold. A key you'll need and a key you'll see. The men you face take blood as fee. This is the next achievement. Before we do that though, uh, we have to kill Andre Firebeard first. Because like once I'm done with this place, I'm going to just uh, Hearthstone to uh, Gachistan. Oh, quest log is full. Oh. Uh... <laughs> I'll delete. 
Uh, this. I'll just pick that up after. Damn, it's been months. Can you give quick recap for the past six months, Kazoo? Lull. Six months? That's impossible. So much crazy stuff happened. You wouldn't even believe it. Yeah. So much crazy stuff happened. Okay, I, I just need the Andre. Ep, 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 ep. Do you need that one? Do you need him too? You need him? Grenada. Do you have a macro that says Grenada? I right, got some hit. Nice. Wait, what the hell? Oh my god, I was wondering what that was. It was like a minion, but it, it didn't look like a minion. I'm good? Alright, it's a mind control thing. Alright, uh... Let's go, boys. Let's go. Look at that quest log, by the way. Wowie. Got head from who? From Andre Firebeard. He got his head. Can I see the gun you found? Yep. I got this gun. An owl gun. We got it, boys. We got it. They said it couldn't be done. But we did it. We did it. Are we gonna think from all these quests? I feel like we might. Unless we're gonna go Soul Frag 46. Yo! South of Weedle, south of home, find a mast and flag and bones. Dig you there if you be bold. Dig and claim the hog diddler's gold. A key you'll need and a key you'll see The hog you face will give bacon as fee For helvede lorte gris <laughs> Thank you Thank you Thank you Go on I think I can recap for you all Okay, go on Six months of broken promises How? Six months of no son Dude no sink, no Dude. blender. Six months of a dying plant. What? And six months of playing a 20 year old game. We also played other games as well, dude. What are you on about? Chocobot, thank you for the four months. Mana Screw, thank you for the three and a bits. I don't, I'm not gonna give you a sauna, okay? Dude, one of my IRL friends recently got a sauna, man. And like, he invited me and all the boys over for like a sauna session together. But I couldn't come that day because um, I had to stream. But yeah, he, he got like a massive sauna. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Like a sauna session with the boys outside, you know? Who's a guild to kill? Kata, Sot, and Retail. How did I kill Retail? And what heat do you do sauna? Dude, I don't know. Very warm. The, the, the play is, man, you sit in the sauna, right? And you sit for as long as you're just about to pass out. And then when you, when you get, like, dizzy and, like, right? Then you go out and you take a cold shower. Oh, my God. That's, like, giga. Yeah. Or, like, you hop in the snow or, like, you, you hop into, like, a, a cold plunge or something. And it's so good. Oh my god. It's so nice, dude. No joke, that's terrible for your heart. Okay, no, not till you pass out, okay? But just until, like, you, you're like, oh, damn, I'm kind of, like, sweaty a little bit. You know, it's dripping a bit from me. Then you, then you go take a shower, right? Maybe not till you pass out, right? Just till you, like, get sweaty and stuff. Yeah. You know what I mean, right? Just till you, you're sweaty. Who asked? Okay, I'll... You know what? I'm not gonna talk about Solmas anymore. It doesn't matter. No, whatever. <sighs> doesn't matter. Right, I'm gonna sit down. Oh. Sulfur Egg win? Soon. Your chat is too mean. They just don't like my hobbies, okay? Like, I don't know, man. I plant potatoes in my garden. I make beef jerky. 
I like saunas. You know? I'm, a, I'm building a fire pit in my garden. God damn it. Hi, comics. You're so handsome. Ooh. I think this should be doable. Growing all your food is one of the best things you can do. Yeah, exactly, man. That's what I'm saying, dude. That's what I'm saying, man. Let's go. It's not as a goat. Just don't try to play that let's almost pass out game. Yeah, true. You know, true, 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 true. Cooking stream when? I don't know. I'm not sure when I'll do a cooking stream again. I don't really know. We'll see. So we're looking for like a little... Little flag. Be careful with the sauna, speaking from experience. Just make sure you bring a lot of water, you know. Stay hydrated. Don't be the guy that died in the sauna world. Wait, there's a world sauna championship? What the fuck does that even mean? Oh, is this guy doing it? Hello. Greetings. Are you about to do the... I am here to warn you. The pirates are extra salty today. Oh, okay. Ten pirates may spawn instead of the normal ten, I guess. What? Why would you say that? Why would you say that? Bro. Did it for me today and the rogue. Uh, should I kill the surf clatter first? This is this guy's like very very too close. Okay. Oh, he's not gonna trigger. He's in the guild, man. He's uh, uh friendly. Oh my god, the surf clatter is really tanky. Okay. There we go. Big bleeds, big bleeds. Can't even kill a freaking turtle, man. God damn, dude. Tiny violin was in the guild. Don't say that. You should kill this turtle too, right? I'm gonna pounce on this guy. Probably wasn't worth pouncing, honestly. But I figured the bleed would be worth damage. Yeah. How much did it do? Not really anything, I guess. And don't forget... The chest will despawn. Okay, thank you. I don't know if I'm supposed to be worried that you're saying these things to me. So, we do this, we heal ourselves, and then we bing bong bang in the chat. Okay. Full heals, 
faster. Benny buff. Okay, I'll click off the stamina. There you go, man. Are you happy? Okay, five guys. Okay, that's a lot of guys. Oh my god, he's right! Holy shit! Okay. Actually, I don't know if I really... I think I need to reset this, actually. No, I don't want you to help! Wait! Split pulling, easy clap. Yeah, there you go. Easy split pull. There we go, guys. Popping off. Popping off. Split pulling. Nice. Uh, why didn't they? I, I, I think I accidentally split pulled. Okay, I got the key. But there's five guys on that. Why? I gotta kill the five guys there, right? I guess I gotta split pull and kill them one by one, but like, bro, what if the thing despawns? Yeah. Despawns, you can't hand in the quest. What the fuck? Is it because it took it from both the spawn points? I think that's why. Okay. Ten seconds. Go up here. Exit yeah. stealth. Is it still up? I don't know. It is, nice. Fuck you, bitch. Sorry for that language, guys. It, it, that's so unfair, like, it double spawns the freaking things. Like, bro. It's only supposed to be five mobs, but I guess they were too close to each other, these two. Man, that was a good strat, though. Doable. I need to kill kill that and then that one, right? Wait, 
Why did the do Dude! Dude, that's so bullshit! So it double spawned the mobs, and then I just couldn't get it, because, like, I can't kill ten of them before the chest despawns. Like, I, I cleared all five. I literally killed all five mobs. That's so... I mean, I, that's so shitty. Go again? Bro, you realize I gotta farm all the fragments again. I gotta farm all fragments again. And I don't know if I can do that before a thing. You can't do it twice. Can I not? Change layer? You can? Pretty sure. Well, you're guessing, right? You, since you're saying I'm pretty sure, you're guessing, right? You have to reform it. Layer? Yeah, but the thing is, guys, I... What if I... Uh, delete the quest? No, it doesn't matter. Delete the key? You have to reform it? Oh, man, that sucks. Bro, why does it double spawn them? What the fuck? No, if I if I delete the quest, I can't do it, right? Yeah, it's because so this is the this is where are there even supposed to be multiple of these areas? I have the map, I can come and spawn it again if you like. If, if only somebody had warned you? Yeah, but I mean, I still wait, what could I do? Just like not do it? Like I still have to try, right? Delete the key, I did it a few days ago. So you're saying if I delete the key, I can talk to this and spawn them again. I don't know if that's true. I mean, I might just delete the key and not being able to take, pick up the quest then. I, I think you're just straight up guessing, right? I could summon the map guy if you want. Oh, you can summon it, Chucky. I mean, do you not need it yourself? The, the quest, by the way, doesn't give XP. Why did, what is this guy doing? The quest doesn't give XP. It's straight up just items. The mage's horde. Wait. Oh, the mage says he can summon it or what? Delete the key, it's true. I, I don't know. I don't trust that. Because I, I need... Whenever someone does the quest, I can pick up the chest, right? I don't know what you're talking about, Chucky. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> the chest is not a single use. If someone else can spawn the chest, you can both click the chest after. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So if somebody comes and spawns the chest, then I can pick it up, right? But, and then they can pick it up as well. You, oh yeah, because the mobs drop the key. So as long as I have the quest, then they can drop it, but I can't activate the thing. Could you summon it then? Uh, could you come? Oh, he's in feral ass, so we wouldn't have to get, like, another person to summon. I checked on Wowhead, and apparently you can re-click the flag if you trash the key. Sure, okay, I'll try it. I mean, if... Yeah. If, if I delete this now, and someone comes and spawns the mobs, the mobs will drop the key anyway. And I can't even loot it without the mobs being here, so it doesn't really matter. Right? Okay, I can. Okay, sick. But, is it still gonna spawn extra mobs though? Because... If it spawns 10 again, then I, I I literally can't do it. Like, it's I can't kill 10 mobs in time. 
that's too little time for me to kill it. Wait, Irvana, so you're telling me you refarmed all the mobs again? <laughs> All right, let me try this one then. Let, let me see if this one works. And if if I like edge all the way to the side here, then maybe. Okay, let me let me try. Let me try. Okay, it seems like it only spawned five. Okay, okay, so if anyone is doing Quergo's Gold, do this one here and then be all the way to the edge, guys. Okay, we got it, Pat, we got it. Okay, so, yeah, you, you can delete the key, you can summon it again, and you can do that. Okay, that's, that's good, that's good to know, actually. That's, that's nice. You see, and they dropped the Quergo's Key again. The key was the other thing that was out of range from you? Yeah, 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 yeah. But we got it now, so that's good. Oh god, I wonder how many people in chat, like, went and reformed that thing. Because I saw quite a few people saying that they did that. Oh god, that's actually horrible. Oh shit. Uh, two guys, I can handle two guys, let's go. I mean, good to know, dude. Good to know. So, you can delete Quergo's key, and then you can just re-click it, if you fail it. Alright. Man, I, that was actually stressing me out a little bit, because I was, I was trying to pull way too fast, because I wanted to, like, kill it in time, right? Okay, good shit. It's just those there. Dude, easy fucking club, boys. Uh, yeah, we just killed this dude here, and then we root the other guy, and we yank it, and we dip the fuck out. Dude, I even used the freaking uh, magic dust on that, man. Come on, dude, that would have been so cool. I magic dusted one, I freaking rooted the other one. There was the five mobs, I went over there, and I pulled it. Like, that would have been so sick. Yeah. Hey, okay. Gazoo. Hello. I bet you can't beat this maths question because you are Danish. Ready? Okay. What's 20 plus 30? It's, it's 50. That's not a hard question. It's 50. Yeah. 50 is nuts in your mouth. Achievement, boys. We did it. We did it. Against all odds. We pulled through. And we got the achievement done, boys. Easy clap. Easy clap, man. Yabba dabba do. Yabba dabba do. Yabba dabba do. What do we get, It's gold, I'll take it. Aegis. Bitch. Yeah. What's up? What's up? Be good. Be have good. Have a good one. Have a good one. Be okay. good. Cool, and we have a lot of quests over here to turn in. And this might actually think us 46, will it? At least we're very close. Yeah, we're very, very close. What's the next achievement? Good question, actually. Let me check. Uh, next achievement is... Him jail indeed before 52. That's the quest in Ashara. I think that's like a uh, elite or like an escort uh, wave quest down here or something. Sulfurak now. Yeah, we'll do Sulfurak. We'll do Sulfurak, guys. Well, don't worry about it, man. I said we would do it. We'll do it. I just need to make sure that I get better at time management because I said 
five hours ago that we would do Zulfrak in an hour and a half. And that is uh, five hours ago now. No. No. What's the weird power quest in the Sharam? Yeah. You so Yeah. It's fine. I'm just waiting. Got all day. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Got, 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 got. I'm just doing some frank question. Going to be the silver mic. Could I come and heal you, Tua? Um, I think you you might be a little bit too high level heal, Tua. I'm not gonna lie. A, a, a bit too high. I think I think it's a bit too high. But let me just see what we can do here. I asked you to wake me up before my nap to Sulfrak. I've slept for 19 hours now. No, oh, sure. How many achievement points do we got now? 180. Fuck yeah. They're working on making more achievements, by the way, in um, OnlyFangs for the add-on. So that's badass. Andrews, what's up? All right. Hey, how you doing? Hey, how you doing? Hey, for real. Some more boots. Have a good one. What is that? Oh, that's power infusion. Hey there. See you later. See you later. Have a good one. Have a good one. And then one quest here. Man, I'm so close to dinging, actually. What the flippy flip? Yeah. I, help. I could actually 11,000. I should buy seven and a half, seven and a half drinks. That that then gives six. No, five point four, five point one hundred two. They give you no skill in that. That was just pissing me off. Okay. Let's go, dude. Let's freaking go, man. Actually popping off. 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 The sulfur rack. Yeah. Who's down for some sulfur rack, boys? Should we get the paladin that's been, that farmed the freaking uh, the mallet man? I can heal you. Oh. <laughs> Are you what? <laughs> you what? <laughs> uh, you want to come heal? I mean, your cell phone priest. You know, kind of works. Get the mallet man in. Level for I mean we'll level them in the dungeon, we're fine, dude. Okay, okay. If the mallet man wants to come, he can come. Sure, we'll bring you a sentry, we'll bring you man. Why aren't you in our guild? You wanna join the guild or 49 mage in Danish, 49 got mallet. Uh Pat McGraw I'm still up for it. We'll bring the paladin, your DPS, right? Yeah, get Enyo in. I don't know if Enyo wants to come. If he wants to join, then uh, he's welcome to. Because I kind of told him that he would be able to join like uh, five hours ago. But I don't know if he's here now. You can heal or you can DPS. Uh, go DPS. Do you trust that healer? They seem nice. Dude, I met, I met this healer back in... in, 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 in uh, Teldrassil, guys. You know? There's a rogue, no songflower. We need two DPS. We could get a rogue, cell phone, hunter, Möpa. Etika, me, me, me. Ivana, you're like level 60 already, aren't you? 54, that's too high. 44 warrior, cell found. 49 mage, 45 mage. Yeah, I'm not sure if Enyo is here, Yeah, if he actually wants to come join, but uh, I think a mage and then like a uh, some sort of a melee would be good. Big meaty warrior. <laughs> God. Mage, not cell found. Uh, I'm banned from joining because I joined the chest from you. Uh, I think I'm going to get some new people for this because you, you joined for the Uldeman, if that's okay for Uldeman. Yeah, yeah. Rogue. There's six of a 45 mage. We could get the 45 mage and the 45 rogue. Yo, yo. Be good. Time is money, friend. I think that sounds good. On the, yeah, do you want to join? Did did you want to join? You're on a mage, right? We can get the rogue. I could do a little frag too. Okay, are you like online right now? What level are you? 47. Okay, and then we get the 45 rogue. 
I think that's that's fine. I'll I'll take this group. Tank? Who do you think I am? I'm the freaking tank. Hello? Alright guys, um Where are y'all at? Are y'all all here? Okay, he's over in Booty Bay. Hi. There is quite a high chance that we might do another Sulfur Act tomorrow. Because I might want to get some gear from there and uh, troll tempers and shit. So there is a chance that we might do another SF tomorrow. Yeah, depending on how, how we get with the loot and stuff. All right, let me let me just vendor some stuff first here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> Glad I could help. Oh, do I have a deal for you? Baba. Right back. I got what you need. What the heck is this? You will die at forty nine. There's also a bank. I know. I know. There's a bank. There's a bank. There's a there's a bank. I know. Oh, you had your hearthstone to here. No, this is a freaking auction house. This guy is called Gold Scam. Oh, he's probably sitting and botting the auction house, waiting for people to like put stuff up to like swap from from horde to alliance, and then he's yoinking it. Yeah. Yeah, that's the classic neutral auction house. I don't know if he's botting it though. He might not be botting it, dude, but I know a lot of people definitely uh do some saucy action on the uh neutral auction house. Okay, I'm gonna just craft all these and then we're gonna go and then do the dungeon, guys. We are heading into Sulfurak right now, okay? Sulfurak is happening. Yeah. On SK, do you want to have a trauma on nightmares on the pit in the middle room and Drake's come out? What are you asking? On SK, do you want to get have some trauma or nightmare a pit middle? Oh my god, I know what you're asking me. You're talking about the hole in Sunken Temple. If I have trauma. No, I have no trauma with holes, okay? I played Silent Hill recently. And there was lots of holes in that game, jumping into holes. And I went through it just fine. Yeah. I went through it just fine. Need one for... Uh, you you want to... Oh, you got the guild? Okay, you got it. Okay, you got it. Got it. You have a quest in bag. You can get 46 instant if you hand it in here. You have a quest in my bag? I don't think I do, man. I mean, I could go to Booty Bay and then hand in some quests there and ding, but... I, I, we're almost at the dungeon, right? And all the all the gamers are at the dungeon already. So I'll just head over to the dungeon. I could also just do the water quest here, but I'll just dig inside the dungeon. It's not a big deal. What's that boar over there? Okay, chilling. Nice. Sulfrak gets swiftness potions. We'll be fine, guys. Okay, there we go. Nice. I am pretty happy right now, guys. Type 1 in the chat if you're happy as well. Guzwa in chat, first time catching an Ananas live. Happy times. What's up, local Lipsy? Good to see you, man. Alright, let's go to the dungeon, guys. Let's go to the dungeon. And, uh, you know, for all the people expecting Sulfurak five hours ago, uh, four hours ago, uh, I don't apologize. Because we do stuff at the time when we do it. Yeah. Because we have a saying in Denmark, guys, and that saying is "Ting tat and tilten tat," right? And it means stuff takes the like th things takes the amount of times that the things takes to take, right? Ting tat and tilten tat. 
That's how we say it. Yeah. Tink tart and tilt and tart. Yeah. It just, it takes as long as it does. It takes as long as it does. It doesn't matter, you know. Sometimes it takes long. Sometimes it takes little. It is what it is. Remember when Gusu said we're gonna play God of War? Do we believe him? Listen, Rami, just do a little skill deck, okay? I am gonna set up God of War on an emulator, and we will start God of War this week. Don't worry about it. God of War 1 will start this meet week, okay? And we're gonna beat Ares' ass, and we're gonna rip the wings off of uh, Helios, or whatever he that guy is called, and it's gonna be great. Forty-nine, dude, stop with that! God, all right. My gear before we do the dungeon. We have pretty decent gear: handcrafted gloves, imperial leather belt, trip on dungarees, excelsior boots, seal of rin, sea fire band, insignium, smith's mighty hammer, dusky bracers, raptor tunic from Tethys. We got dark tide cape, flesh hide, amber glow, and hog eye. We have uh, oh, we have mage here. Self-found mage. Oh gosh, you got some pretty decent gear. See, you're wearing tailoring as well. well. Not too shabby, not too shabby. We got our paladin. This was the guy who did the um, the mallet quest. Self-found as well. Bonebiter. Pretty decent gear. Then we have Sendry. We saw Sendry very early on, actually, in Teltracell when we made this character. Sentry has been keeping up in levels, and uh, now we're doing a dungeon together. And where's our rogue at? What the heck? Are you hiding in the corner? What? That's kind of weird, man. Okay. Okay, so pretty average people. Pretty average geared people. You know, we'll make it work. He's... Dude, you got freaking goggles from... Yeah. Let's go in, guys. Let's get it done. Dead mines, weapon, and soul frack. Listen, I am trying every day to get the crowd pummeler, and it's never dropping. Okay? It's never freaking dropping. Okay. Buffing people up here. By the way, guys, last time I was tanking this dungeon, if you guys remember, was on a character called Flop. I went in at level 44, and we died to the first boss. This time, we're going into the dungeon almost taking 46. And we are now a druid, with apparently zero threat. But let's not die today, okay? Because I've died, actually... I've died two times in Zulfarag. On a rogue and on a warrior. Yeah. Fenris, what do you have to say to the stream today? Oh, great oracle. Knower of all truths. I have a question. Mm -hmm. Speak, child. At what level will Gizu die on his droid? This. This is forbidden knowledge to know. However, if you must know, it is level 49, what? 49, 49, 49. Why do you keep saying it? Stop. Dude, stop. Seriously, stop. I don't like that. Stop doing that. Alright. It's all for Ike boys. There's lots of really good items from here as well, by the way. If we get lucky, we can get Cerulus and get some nice feet from that boss. And obviously, the head from the last boss, Embrace of the Lycan, would be massive, right? And there's also like a bunch of random drops, right? Okay, as long as mana is okay. I'm also gonna bring out Japlo because he likes being along for the journey, you know? So, we're gonna make sure that he's out as well. Yeah. Bracers is feet? No, they are feet. They just look like bracers. They're like angle socks, you know? Yeah, good. Watch out for the basilisk this time. Yeah, I know, I know. Guess I'm gonna try to kill the, the totems. As long as I have acro, I'll focus the totems. There we go. Have we had anyone die in our dungeon shit? I don't think we have, actually. Have we? No. 
Yeah, I know Saryu had a death in, in Wailing Cavern some time back. But we have a pretty good uh, record, I think, so far on the Druid. Yeah, I would say so. Ooh, Shriveled Heart. Just like mine. We lose too many stats for that to be worth. Oh, I got it anyway. Wish I could... Yeah, I guess I could kick if I charge. Should we go back here and pull some more? Yeah, our oh, healer has mana, so we can definitely pull. Interrupt that. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's minus 13. No, it's plus 13 stamina, minus strength and spirit. Because you, you're a powerful... It, I think the, 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 the connection is you're a powerful human being because you have a lot of stamina. But you've lost a lot of your soul during the journey and also strength. So like, even though you look like you're strong and you have a lot of health, deep inside, your strength and your spirit has, has, has faded, right? It's like a shriveled heart. Oh yeah, we need to let the mage poly, I guess. Let, let mage poly more if we're pulling like mobs like that. Yeah. Okay. Doing, the healer's doing a good job, I guess. Wanding in between and keeping the health up. Oh yeah, I can scare piece the alligators, true. Wait, that's a hunter. I'm not a hunter. Uh, is mana okay? They're all drinking. Okay, I'll pull you. Y'all can just keep drinking a little bit. I'm gonna just crank it up as you're, as you're drinking. Maybe change your talents to more tank bear. Might help with aggro. I feel like my talents are okay right now. I think, I think we're okay at the moment. I'm gonna get natural weapons soon and the clear casting. That's gonna help a lot. Oh, yeah, I can hibernate. That's true. I can hibernate them. Oh, yeah, and I can actually entangling roots as well. Missing the armor bonus. I think it, this is like bait. I don't think it's as good as you think it is, except for like max level. Maybe then it's good. Uh, are we good here? Yeah, we're good. Hi, Nizos. What's up, Nizos? Kill the totem. You reached diminishing returns. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Ah, oh, we're looking good. We're looking good. This guy here. Three months till I move? Yeah, you're moving to Korea, man. Sure. Okay. I guess we focus the shadow casters. I I, I think the uh, hunters or whatever shadow hunters or whatever have prio. Why did I leave bear form? What wow, what that was really stupid. Okay. That was kind of silly. Let's not do that. Forty-nine. Stop. Yeah, because the shadow hunters can hex and stuff. Good, 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 good. Kill the scraps, I guess. We need it for the quest, right? And also getting some rage before the pool is nice while they're drinking. Why are you hoping the pre? That's fucked up. Okay, are we good here in mana? Kind of want to pull more, but I feel like okay, a little bit more. I don't want to get too overconfident, man, in this in these dungeons, dude. I'm not gonna lie. Okay. Okay, kill the ward. If we do a big pull like this, we just have a little mana break afterwards, right? Yeah. 
What was it, Ulderman, where we just pulled so much? Yeah, Ulderman was crazy. When will you die? Chat, like, a lot of people watch me, like, think I'm gonna die, man. Like, that ain't gonna happen, dude. Okay. There was a pad ward. Good to see you, bro. But then it's gonna... Skull! Okay, I'm gonna get another... Hopefully, Cyrilis is up. He pats around the area here with, like, a few, uh... Mobs and stuff. Up, we'll see. How many greens yet? We, I don't think we've seen this. I mean, we've seen the shriveled part, but that's it, right? I need to make sure that I keep like tap targeting with my fairy fire as well. Watching the stream for four hours until he didn't die was the point of where, where's my dopamine? Is your only dopamine you can get is is that for me dying? Come on, bro. Be more supportive. Ah, uh, the rare isn't up, guys. Sad. That is sad. That is sad. I'm just here for the death clip. Bro, we watch death clips in the beginning of the stream. Chat, in this stream, we don't do the death clips. We just watch them. Uh, let's kill this mob here. In case we got a run out, right? It's good having stuff cleared, just in case. Yeah, the the rare... True, actually, the rare can respawn mid-ID. So it's like kind of nice checking in the end. Let's pull these guys and an LOS with the pillar here. Oh, there's only one guy? I want to have some few more here. There we go. Build them around. Okay, and then this guy. Let's bring him close. Yeah, yeah. You have the number one death clip in hardcore. Bro, I checked the other night. I was looking through some of my stuff. And, uh, Keps, what's up, dude? I have an area in my backyard I call the Big Stew, it's a pit I dug where I dump old batteries, gas, household chemicals and Dr. What? Pepper, I stir it once a month. What? Yesterday I dumped like 200 smoke detectors in there and now the air tastes like pennies, also do a kickflip kazoof. What did you just say? Don't do that. Don't do that, bro. Hey, what's up, Balo? Have fun with the uh, hardcore, man. All right. Do we want to clear this? Just I, I think in case we got to run out afterwards, it's kind of nice having the middle cleared. So we'll do it just for that, right? And then we'll go over here afterwards. It's a pizza cake to clear it anyway. Yeah, I, I was looking over some of my vods and my clips the other night, and that freaking sunken temple death clip almost had freaking half a million views. So ridiculous, man. Yeah. Only? That's so insane, man. Famous for the wrong reasons. Bro, I've done so much cool stuff, and I'm like, I'm the whole in- I'm the whole guy. I'm the whole in one guy. Yeah, I guess. Alright. We're almost at the first boss, and... A lot of people always think about the freaking staircase event when it's Sulfurak, but honestly, the Antu Sul, the first boss, he's the highest level boss in the dungeon, and he kind of freaking cranks. I think we'll be fine. We got a decent group here going, but he actually kind of hurts. Yeah, that's, that's where I died on my warrior. But I made the mistake of doing the run at level 44. Now I'm almost 46, so... Uh, is that... Oh, good sheep, good sheep. But I think... Yeah, that's a pull, that's a pull. We're fine, we're fine. We got mana on everybody, so we're good. Yeah, it's okay. Wow, wow, okay. We're getting healed, so we're chilling. So far, so good. I think I'm getting a lot of these troll servers. I guess I'm just getting really good RNG with them. We might have to do a... I, we could do another CF run tomorrow, but let's see how this goes today first. 
Guzo might not have a lot of deaths in hardcore, but he has the best ones. I don't know if that's a compliment or not. But thank you, I think. Yeah, PI is spell damage in vanilla, so it is nice for everything, really. Okay. I don't have a ton of hardcore deaths. What do you mean? I've just played hardcore for a while, so ultimately you are gonna build up a few, like, backlog of some deaths, eh? There we go. Just pulling some scraps for the quest. We'll probably clear all these scarabs, right? It's a good way to get it done. There we go. Plague. We can just... Yeah, we can remove the disease. Good shit. When are we getting variety? Uh, I'm gonna set up... A, um, God of War 1. And we're gonna be playing it one of these days. Uh, um, maybe tomorrow, but no promises, okay? Okay. So I'm gonna test. I can I can hibernate these guys, right? They are actually immune. Okay, good thing I tested that. Okay, just so I don't rely on it. I should be able to uh, root them though, but I guess we can't hibernate them. They're a beast. Yeah. So this is the gaze, the petrify. Sorry. That's the shit that that has killed me before. Petrify. That be some God of War. Looking forward to it. Yeah, it's gonna be the original one, BLG. Like, God of War 1. Okay. So, on this boss, it's very important. We kill the totems. And I, I think we want to focus the boss, right? Just kill, kill the little uh, children basilisks when they spawn and then focus the boss. He's 48. Look at that. Can, could I ding 46 before boss? Or... Uh... We'll see if we think from these two. If we don't, we'll just send it. It's fine. If you're playing hardcore, so you're not putting learn how to die in hardcore. We're not gonna die, dude. We're not gonna die. Don't worry about it. Should I build up some rage before boss? I think that'd be smart. I'm gonna just build up rage now. As much as I can, I guess. It won't be a lot, but. Oh, good chief. Ooh, and there we go. 46, guys. 46. Now we get natural weapons. Just more damage in all forms. This means that the boss is yellow now, right? Oh, okay, he's yellow. When I was here on my warrior, he was red. Full rage, boys. Okay, as soon as uh, Grinder has mana, we'll go. Want me to know where the big basilisks? Sure, I'll drag out. Yeah, okay, okay. Let's go. Lunch has arrived. Yeah, we can kill the children giga fast because they have like really low health. Yeah, and then we focus on this guy. Okay, rage is full, dude. I'm gonna just crank him. Yeah. Servant of Antusul. Oh, you can't. He's actually immune to bash. So this is the thing that can kill you, man. If you don't deal with the totems and like he keeps spawning these freaking servants over and over again, it just gets bad. Because there's one more now, right? Oh, you actually can't over them. That's good to know. Okay, I'm stunned. I'm stunned. I'm stunned. We're good. All right, we're good. How did we die to this guy? Man? How did we die, man? I guess Druidus is built different. Yeah. Just fucking build different. Dude, I need to do freaking uh, like some like Mar Marauder on a level 47 or something, man. There we go. Do we get the mini Thunder Fury? Dude, it dropped. Mini Thunder Fury, boys. Hand of Entusul. Okay. Yeah, it has like a Thunder Fury proc. It's kind of funny. You could do Marauder on 48. What, what level is Princess? 
50. I will probably do Morata on 48. I think so. Yeah, Morata will be a 48 uh, angle. She's 51. We'll, we'll, we'll bash it at 48. Alright, this is where you're gonna be uh, enjoying yourself, Grinder. I guess after we kill this guy, we'll do a bunch of scarabs. Okay. That's where we die. No. 49. Do it at 49. I almost died to Princess on Gussie, I remember, because I over aggroed on Gussie and uh, she flurried my ass and I almost died. Okay. We went to Moonkin and the Mini Thunder Fury, same armor spare form. This is really good though. It's actually not a bad weapon. Oh, you should immune. Okay. Oh, tablet, and then also... Is this for a quest? I don't think this is for a quest, right? Yeah. Alright, so we'll we'll do some mobs, and then we're gonna let this grinder do his thing. I'll, I'll pick up some. I'll pick up some. Okay. Just like this much, I think. This much, this much. Yeah. And then uh, just do your thing, do your thing. Just make sure you don't die, obviously, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, how many clips have I seen of people dying here because of that, dude? Holy shit. I get a little bit of mana, we could do it again. No thorns? Oh my god, what a silly goose I am. You're right. Where do I live? I live in Denmark. Yeah. Would a druid tank ever need demonic runes? You should pick up just in case. Okay, well. Ready? Alright. Buffing myself, healing myself. Okay. This is good, this is good, this is good, yeah, yeah. Oh, you start with the cock? Okay. I'm just trying to, like, get, get him off. Uh, get, like, the little mobs that's going on him, get him off, right? Like, bash one of them, charge the other one, taunt one, right? Oh, not bad. Oh, I'm done with my quest, so we can just move on now, guys. <laughs> I'm kidding. All right. Loki Bera, thank you for the prime. It looks like we have mana. There we go. Okay, okay. Are we on this? Yes. There we go. Hey, what's up, Miki? How are you doing, bro? Do we need... I think we killed almost all of them, except this one, I guess. There's gonna be some more scarabs we can kill as we go. There'll be more scarabs. Oh, we got it. Nice. Okay, cool. Uh, I think we should do the graves, right? The boss can drop some nice loot, so we might as well do it. What's the expectations of the event on the 13th? I don't know. I will be doing a, a watch party for um, Wild Direct on the 13th. Yeah, we're gonna do a watch party for that. So in case anyone is interested in, in watching the uh, Wild Direct together with the community, uh, I will be streaming it. Yeah. yeah. It's just a few of these zombies, right? How many? Can we do a little bit more? Not too many, not too many, right? Eee, that's a little bit many, that's a little bit many, but it's okay. You know what? Let's innervate our healer. Okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Okay, I was a little bit overzealous there, guys. Yeah, I, I saw like the, I saw like four mobs and I was like, okay, I'll just open two more and they spawn two freaking more, uh, four more. We're fine. Jesus. Yeah, mages can uh, farm this for like a big giga loot or like uh, XP and everything. This is like the mage place. 
Uh, oh, I'll loot these guys. Don't worry about them. I already loot this. This is a necklace, by the way. You can you can put on a twink if you want. You know, if you have like a twink you uh, you really like, you can put like a necklace on them. It doesn't do anything, but it's just like you know you have a twink you have a twink necklace, so it's cool. Okay, six mobs here. A little bit more, maybe. There we go. Oh yeah, nice. I get there's no stats on it or whatever, but it's just kind of cool. Just let the mates farm all of them. Yeah. I wonder if there's anyone that's gonna actually farm these in like OnlyFangs. Maybe I could see Ampy doing it, but I don't know if he's that dedicated. Right? We'll see. Fred Hayes, thank you for the 30 months. Thank you for the awesome hardcore content. I'm a YouTube Andy, but I want to show some love uh, for the stream. Yo, thank you, Ryan. I appreciate the prime, dude. Thank you. Mana's okay, so let's do a few more. Okay, that's enough, that's enough, that's enough. Jesus Christ. Did the rogue use the maze? Uh, he did win it. I don't think he's using it right now because of weapon skill. But yeah, he did, he did win the maze. Uh, I don't have acro on half of these, but it's okay. Ampy will farm Pyrus till 52. Dude, Ampy is gonna literally be level 60 while I'm level 20. <laughs> what the fuck, man? Unless he dies, I guess. Then maybe I'll be 60 first. Alright. Yeah, apparently Tyler 1 is gonna be playing. I don't know if that's actually true or not, but... Yeah. Old Goose who smokes everyone. Okay, you may not believe- Guys, I'm actually not bad at leveling. I just like taking my time with the game, you know, having fun. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Nice, a little bit more, a little bit more. Oh, okay, we don't get a lot of zombies here, do we? There we go, there we go. The dead heroes, by the way, these guys drop hella troll timber. So if you're lucky to get his loot, then you can get hella troll timber. Hi, Savix. I'm not washed up. I'm just having fun with the game, okay? Like, I, I could fucking level... Fa I, sorry, I could level fast if I wanted to. But I just like taking my time, enjoying the journey, man. You know? God damn. Kind of hot here, dude. Am I, am I just, am I just, I'm, I'm just the one yoking everything, I guess, here, okay. Yeah. I, I could see Tyler one definitely grinding it out, but, uh, I don't know, I don't know how much he'll commit to it, though. That's the, some of the, some of the things with these, like, big, big streamers. I don't know how much they would want to commit to playing Classic WoW, because, you know, maybe they just want to grind their main game. Okay. You're a big streamer now. I mean, I'll, thank you guys very much for watching. I do appreciate that, man. It's awesome. You guys want to chill in my stream, man. There's a lot of great streamers to choose from, and you guys uh, enjoy hanging out here, so that's awesome. Yeah, Tyler one is if he if he actually enjoys it, he will not give up. He's definitely very dedicated to his stuff. Okay, we're almost done with the graves now. Dungeons really go fast, actually. They they re, re speed. Maybe it's because I'm a druid, and we can just go sat that fast and everything. But I feel like we're really speeding through it. I'm gonna buff people here. Are any Danish streamers joining like Uber Danger? I don't know if Uber Danger wants to join. Uh, I'm not sure. I, I I haven't spoken to Uber Danger privately or personally. Okay, let's go. There we go. That's plenty, that's plenty, that's plenty, that's plenty. Oh god. Oh, you don't have mana? Oh, you were buffing, grinder? Okay, it's fine. Just put a mana pot. Minus one mana pot. Sorry, I didn't see you were buffing. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Okay. Uh, I don't have innervate, er, 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 innervate for you. It's okay.
It's fine, it's fine. We got uh, Red Tree Aura, we got Thorns. We'll, these bobs will die slowly. Yeah. We need Swag Victus and OnlyFans. Oh, OnlyFans. Um, yeah. Uber Danger is Danish? Yeah, he is. Uber Danger is Danish. Alright, let's have a little mana break after this, I guess. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. I didn't pay attention to the mana. Apologize. Uh, uh, Knacky, what's up? Explain what Danskvan is. Danskvan is uh, sparkling water. We call it Danish water in Denmark. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why we call it that, but that's what we call it. Mana is okay. Then we can go. There we go. Can we go all the way? All the way. All the way. All the way. One more. Are we missing one? No, we're not. I think we're good. Or? Got all the threat. Hey, bitch. Come here. I can't get aggro on this one. I'm sorry. I think we're missing one, right? Let me just go check it out real fast. Yeah, there you go. Just getting the last one, guys. Dude, man. I, I mean, I saw... Dude, we might just do freaking Maradon at 48. I think I think that's the plan, dude. Get 48 to go through Maradon, man. Maybe we do BRD at, like, 49. I don't know. Like, holy shit. I feel like we actually can't die. Yeah. 49. Okay. Alright, uh, this guy can drop some nice nuke for casters, so let's hope. Bear brain. Am I and am I building up overconfidence right now? There's also like uh, Sunken Temple. I mean nothing bad could happen in there. Sands consume you. Okay. We did Ultiman run yesterday, yeah, Leonardo. This guy, I think it's a really nice staff, right? He can drop. Can he stun him? Oh, he's stunnable. Wolf. Wolf. Maybe some stuff in the chest? Nothing in the chest. Just literally silver, okay. You said the same thing on Gussie 10 minutes before you died. Oh, shut up! I'm sorry, it didn't drop, man. Dude, that's such an ugly laugh. Oh, a cry. Okay. Oh, I'm petrified. Priest healer is the best healer, man. There's no shot. They can, like, disp dispel everything. It's so powerful. Okay. I got thrown on everything. We're good. What's up, Elunius? The chat is act acting extra saucy today. Chat is being very cute today, I think. I think we're having a cute chat. Oh, Pat McGroin is the one dispelling. I am so sorry. I'm sitting here. Uh, I'm sitting here glazing the priest, and it's you doing it, groin. Oh shit. My bad. My bad. Okay. I think it's smart, kind of clearing at least this area here when we're doing a uh, staircase event. Yeah. Okay, getting a few more mobs. You can call me a little bit of a speedrunner, guys, here. Okay, got aggro on everything. Nice. There we go, guys. There we go. Okay, the chat is on fire. The chat is dead. Nah, we're chilling, man. We're chilling. Have a good time. I want to see your bear flying down a hole. 
I, I mean, I think I don't die now. I think we're good. We do have some scary achievements and some like some dungeons along the way that's gonna be sketchy, but I, I feel pretty confident. I feel pretty confident. Unless we end up doing something stupid like doing a Makaratus against someone. Who knows? Maybe I'll, I'm gonna build up that much overconfidence that I'll start Makarang people left and right. You know? We'll see. Sorry, is two ears. Yeah, maybe I should start collecting some uh, some ears as well, dude. I don't feel super confident on, on dueling on Druid though, but maybe we'll see. You want to do a Lamakra or? All right, let's pull this camp and then we'll do the staircase event. Sar has three ears. Oh shit! Okay. Oh, yeah, I saw he dueled that. Uh, was it a paladin? Yeah, it was a paladin, right? His Peter Sandala. <laughs> okay, all right. I'm definitely like after OnlyFangs and shit. I'm definitely gonna do some character where I go engineering and we go full on Makara mode. I think that'd be so fun. Yeah, we're gonna do like some Makara character where we just try to get as many ears as we can. We just make the goal to do a cell found like Makara farmer. I don't know if I'll do a rogue. I said I did say rogue, but I think maybe a mage or maybe a priest or something like that could be also a vibe. I say rogue because rogue is what I feel most comfortable on, but we'll see. Do Shami? Shami could be fun too. We'll see. We'll see. That's probably gonna be for after uh, OnlyFangs. Unless we start Makarai in OnlyFangs. We'll see. I don't know if uh, if, 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 if Soda Poppin's gonna uh, be happy about that. I'm already being threatened of being benched, you know, so... I, I'm, I, you know, I want, I want to do a, a, a good impression. I don't want to get benched. Okay. So that's scary. Yeah, I'm a little bit scared of him, I'm not gonna lie. Nice. Alright. Whoever got the key, bring him up. Uh, Alright, boys. Staircase event. We're already here. You made it. We made it, boys. I would he bench you. I think there's a lot of uh, people in the guild, so we'll see. I mean, I hope I don't get benched, but if it, it does end up happening, you know, it is what it is. For me, it's all about the journey. Farming, like, getting up to 60, farming my pre all that stuff, you know. But we'll see. Gazoo, it's always been VC. Never called DM unless it was a rare occasion. Thank you for being an amazing we? boss man. Thank you as well. Can we... Alright, alright. Go down and pull them all. I don't know, man. It's it's all on, on grinder for that one. Hurricane pull. We can do a little bit more, you know. So just a little, 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 little bit more like that. That'll be fine, that'll be fine. There you go, there you go. Okay, speeding up the process a bit, you know. He's still got mana. He's good. He's good. He's good. If he can get to drink, then we can crank it again. Savix here? I'm not sure. He was here a little bit earlier. Ah, let's not pull another big pack here because he doesn't have any mana. Okay. I smash my keyboard if I get into Goose's scripted death group. What do you mean scripted death group, man? Okay, let's do a little bit more, guys. Grinder, do your thing. Do your thing, Grinder. Just a few more is coming. Yeah, I'll just AoE on this shit, and then Grinder can crank it. Oh! Wow! Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Do that. Bash that. Nice. Oh, we dropped a little bit low there. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. All for the glory, as Sorry would say. We're good, we're good. Don't worry about it. Alright, now we just wait. 
Yeah, now we just wait, dude. 55% panic, bro. Do you, you think I want to die, lizard? You know what, lizard? I don't want to freaking die, man, okay? We're good, bro. We're good. I don't know why you guys are even panicking, man. Like, what the heck? Guzu's ready for hardcore PoE. At some point, I want to do a hardcore Diablo 2 run. Kill Bale on, uh, on Hell. I don't know when that'll be, but uh, that'll be a fun vibe. Yeah, we recently did like a Diablo 2 uh, play. Can you go to the playthrough? We, 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 we killed Bale on Hell, right? We, we, we did an Amazon all the way up to Hell, and it was pretty fun. PoE mentioned. I've actually played PoE too. I, I, I went to Gamescom and I got to uh, talk to the developers and, and play some PoE too. It was pretty fun. It was uh, quite fun, actually. I'm looking uh, forward to seeing it. Okay. Was it ruthless? I think so. Oh, cool. Did you have any footage of it? Yes, but the USB file got corrupted. So, I don't have any. I ha I recorded an hour-long gaming session of PoE 2 talking to the developers as I was playing. And uh, the file got corrupted, so I couldn't upload it anywhere. Okay. Oh, Scheiße. Um... Yeah. We're gonna give him a little innervate and then we're chilling. Don't worry about it. Do a little innervate, a little innervate. We're good, we're good, we're good. Got a few more guys coming and then we'll be good to go. Why did you Val up the file? I have some of the footage of where I filmed on my phone, but it's like you're just looking at my chin, basically. We're good, we're good, we're good. I wanna see your chin? You can't even, because I have a beard, right? It's hiding it, man. Why do you think I have a beard? You don't, I don't want you to see my chins, okay? Alright, we're good! Easy fucking clap, dude. Do I watch football? Hell yeah! I love it when they kick the ball! Oh my god, I forgot. Jesus Christ. Yeah, but I will do. Brandy! Comes out! If so cool! Yeah. I, I don't really watch football, guys. I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay. Good shit, guys. Ooh, nice chest. Actually, I, I kind of want that. I'm not gonna lie. 27 more armor? Does the rogue want it? I don't know if you... I, I kind of want that. I lose 6 stamina and 3 agi, but I gain 20 spirit, 4 strength, and 27 armor. Nobody else wants it. I'll just take it. Look at my armor, guys. Baba. And that's even without my armor kit, right? I think I'll take it. Yeah, I'll, I'll freaking take it. Armor's massive. All right, let's uh, yeah. destroy these guys. See you later. Uh, focus the I'm girl, I guess. All right, no, no, kill. Uh, where's the other girl at? What? Yeah, kill, kill, uh, Murta, Murta. Yeah, strength is huge. Strength is huge. That's actually a nice chest, man. Good. Okay. Yeah, but I went I went to one football match in my life. I, I don't know which P 
people were playing, uh, but it was a football match in a city called Drammen in Norway. One of my friends uh, knew the people that was like uh, organizing the event or something at the stadium. So uh, yeah, we went to see like a football match there. And apparently people in Norway, they strømskosset, yeah, that's where I went. They eat hot dog sausages in pancakes. It's really weird. That's like a thing for like football games. So they put like a sausage in a pancake. Hot dog sausages in pancakes. Yeah. That's what I just said, yeah. All right, everybody get the rod. Ooh, that tablet sells for 24 silver, yoink. Pulse i waffle, so good. Really, yeah, I mean, okay. Let's see what your chest looks like. Let me just give you a good look at it. It looks like this. Okay. Sure, okay. Uh, uh, uh. Wow, wow, we wow. Okay, let's go up here, guys. We can get some good and uh, good helmet from this boss up here. Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm gonna take my uh, uh, take my cloak off here, I think, and then uh, maybe just for now, just take the other thing. Okay, let's uh, see what happens here, guys. Let's go, let's go. I swear, did I see you in Brøndby Stadium versus FCM? No, I've never went to a football match except on Stramsgossel in Drammen. That's the only football match I've ever went to. I didn't have many uh, friends in, in middle school because of this chat, because everybody in Denmark loves football, okay? And uh, I didn't like football, so I, I, I missed out on a lot of friendships back then. Okay, we can do all these guys, right? Yeah, easy, easy, easy. Because everybody in recess would go play football, and I would just sit and eat pot noodles uh, by myself. Okay. Our friendship with football friends. Yeah, we have something in Denmark called Demplo Bo, which is like a uh, a book where you write stuff about people uh, when you like. I don't. What is it called? A uh, a yearbook, like an end of yearbook, whatever the heck. And and mine literally says in Danish like plays way too much World of Warcraft and hangs out with the World of Warcraft gang in school. And then they said, what are you going to be when you go grow up? And it says, uh, game, uh, freaking reactor, whatever the heck, some sort of a thing. It literally, they literally call me a nerd in my freaking thing. This desert Let's go, divine. boys. Okay, Predicted? I mean, kinda, kinda. They were right, though. Yeah, at some point I can find it. I can show you guys the book. It, it, it's kind of funny. They were wrong, yeah. Oh shit, I don't have thread on any of these guys. Okay, I have it on this guy. If we get the head from this boss, guys, I will be happy. It's not the wolf shit helmet, but it's the good. It's green. Giga stats. Little did they know I was gonna become a professional nerd. <laughs> True. Alright. Come on, come on, come on. Feel the fury of the sand. Come on! Let's just kill the slaves if they come out, yeah. There we go. Good luck. And I got the freaking. What are you. What? And I got the tempers, man! Oh shit. Alright. Yo, Nico said, Hey Guzo, I had a two hour journey home and I was freezing how I'm cold and may get sick. How was your day? Uh, my day was pretty good. I woke up, I had breakfast, and now I'm gonna win this Empress of the Lycan right here. Good luck, El Elitgar. 
Good luck. We got all the troll tempers. We got the freaking. Oh, let me see that head, dude. Let me see that head. Hold on. So we do this. We bang. And then we. Holy! Yo! God damn! Alright, let's go finish off this uh, run, guys. Dude, how much attack power? Hold on. If I if I go burr... Look at my attack power. Look at it. Look at it! <laughs> what? That is so much attack power. What the fuck? Bulba Bear says you're about to turn me into a furry. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck? That's insane. Short stream today, by the way. Fuck, we've been live for seven hours. Dude, I literally told myself today I'm gonna do max six hour stream. I told myself when I started the stream, I'm like, okay, max six hours. We gotta do a short stream today because I gotta like I gotta get some stuff done, man. But god damn it, man, this game is too good. Alright, go back here. Start farming the map for three hours? Well, I had to get it, dude! <sighs> yeah, Mo Grains might dropped, and I, I I passed on it because I thought I could get the freaking uh, Wild Pummeler, but I couldn't get it. Okay, re patrols are coming, patrols are coming. Yeah, I'm a little bit of a workaholic, guys. I just really, uh, you know, I'm working a lot lately. Okay, I'll do this. Pull it back, pull it back, yes. I think we missed a Shadow Hunter, by the way. Okay. Thank you, by the way, Nico. I'm sorry you had a, a rough time getting home, but uh, at least you're home now. Get to spam some park champs, you know? Thank you for the 32 months, Nico. Appreciate it. Alright, get the tablet, get the other quest as well. Nice, and now we just have Gasrilla left. Oh, you're... Wait, there's a guy from behind! Oh shit, I was... I'm sorry. I wasn't paying attention. My bad, my bad, my bad. I thought you outsourced all the work. I mean, I'm, I'm on the job right now, you know? Shit, dude. I think the new helmet sits a bit too tight on your head. Yeah, maybe it's like uh, <laughs> making my IQ go down, you know? Rebuff the group. Uh, they got buffed 17 minutes remaining, they're good. Yeah, the main the main thing that kills people here is the, the patrols. Bro, I look so cool now, chat. God! I look so cool. Okay, we're gonna pull this just- this is a big pack, big pack. See, so this is what people ask pull. They, they have that patrol coming and then they pull the little pack here to the left. And then it's just everybody roaching out, right? Hi, Julius. That's usually how it goes down here, right? Let's kill the uh, totems. Nice. Yeah, I, I really am trying not to die in this dungeon because I've had two deaths to this dungeon on two different characters and I'm not gonna make it a third, okay? Okay. Uh, how many tempers do we got? Pat McGroin needs uh, seven, uh, three more tempers. So we could maybe get Pat done with the uh, with the tempers too. We'll see. What characters? I lost a rogue called Guzui. 
to uh, this place. Actually, right here, I lost a rogue while we're standing. And I also lost Flop. Flip, flop, flip, flip, flop, flip, 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 Should we clear around here? We could also ring the gong, but uh, ring, gong, ring a ding a ding. All these guys. Bjorn, Bjorn, and Bjorn, exactly. We need temper regardless. Yeah, true. I don't think we can get everybody the, t the tempers though, because Itigar needs elite guard, not Itigar. Elite guard needs ten, and Sentry needs ten as well. But we can get Pat done with the Timbers at least as well. God of War 1 after Soul Frag. I haven't set up God of War yet. I need to set up like an emulator or something to be able to stream it. And I haven't done that yet because, uh, you know, I've been playing a, a lot of World of Warcraft lately. I have to do this dungeon again for the head, so no problem. Oh, okay. Are you going to solve the mallet? Uh, the paladin in the group actually didn't. Okay. <coughs> Mamma mia. Get the blood ringer as well. Uh, yes, 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 yes. No, no, not, not like an ethical emulator, chat. Like a, like a legal ethical emulator that will not give me permabant. Are we taunting? In, in a legal way. Right, we are we're not doing anything illegal, guys. Don't worry about it. Good shit. I would like to get Groin finished. That'd be nice. With his quest. Yeah. Alright, let's do a uh, big fat stupid Hydra guy. Yes, really, boys. Oh, Groin needs one temper. Yeah, he needs one. But God of War, I haven't seen this room before. What is happening? This is not God of War. Oh, yeah, we can bring him under the arc. Yeah. So we don't get uh, knocked up into the air. I'm glad you hide for it, Ramulus. Yeah, there you go. There he goes, dude. The big groin. Oh, shit, dude. Yeah, for some reason, I, I recall this guy being level 50, but he's really not. Alright, come, come over here, big boy. Wait, can you stop being... Brother, move! Okay, I... I, I need to, like, I want to bring him over the... Under the thing, but... He's really not moving very much, is he? Wawa! Wow, wow. Okay, there we go. Nobody's getting knocked, right? We're good, we're good. Stand below the bridge, you don't get knocked. Or, like, the arch, I guess. There we go. LOS? Yeah, I should have LOS. You know what? My bad. My bad. I've been live for a while now, okay? Blame it on me. Dude, that means we're gonna get a carrot. I'm gonna get a carrot before even getting a mount. What is this? Good shit, guys. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. He's been live since 6 a.m. my time. Yeah, early streamer, man. Uh, should we get the one thing for groin then? Oh, I'm gonna skin this bitch. This mob, sorry. Um, maybe we get it for groin and then we we, we can we can clear our way out, I guess. We could do that. Check for the rare too. Yeah, let's just clear our way out. Let's clear out, I guess. 
here. Why not? Re equip your tabard. Yeah, yeah, I need to do that. I just wanted to look at how the chest looked like, right? I, I, I feel like I wanted to see the new, the new drip we got. Making sure it looks appropriate, you know? We should get a lot of XP from this dungeon. Yeah, bro, we got like third of a level and we have like uh, five, six quests to turn in as well. It's really nice. Mana is okay, I think. They, they're drinking while I'm cranking it, so it's fine. A little bit more mobs. There we go. Mana is completely fine here, so we're chilling. Alright, we're fine. Just kill the totems there. Absolutely fine, absolutely fine. Oh, I can't wait for my run, dude. I'm already imagining Blackstone Ring dropping, bro. Get level 48, 49, do Marauden, Blackstone Ring, dude. Holy shit. Good shit, guys, good shit. I'm playing on Stitches. I am on Stitches EU. You don't even have a weapon? Bro, I'll get the crop hummel tomorrow, okay? Mother effer. I'll get it tomorrow, man. Doubt. Okay, bro. Yeah, we got like two or three more packs and then we're done with the dungeon, dude. Can get a lot of XP. We'll be a little bit deep into uh, 46. We'll be like over halfway, I think. You could just skip this here, but let's just kill it in case someone has pulse. Will I stay feral at 16? Uh, yeah, I think so. I think so. I mean, I'm hoping before OnlyFangs comes out, I can get to get to level 60 and then do like some in-game content, like do some previous farming and stuff like that. You know, it could be really fun. We'll see. Depends on when OnlyFangs gets announced, right? Because it's in like... 2, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. In seven days, they're doing a uh, meeting and then we'll see, I guess. In this part, I yeah, don't need that. I guess I'm a druid, but Ooh. I cannot uh, count in English very well. Sorry, I gotta. Whenever I'm counting, I gotta do it in Danish. Okay, little bro thinks he's gonna be on OnlyFans. You think I'm gonna get benched? I mean, dude, if we get benched, we get benched, okay? I'll at least be there for the journey, okay? There we go. Benched, Sue? What the fuck, man? Hopped over second grade. I don't know. I, I, I'm, I, I am not a math guy. I, I'm not very great at math. I, I will admit to that. But I can do basic math, right? Whenever they started using uh, letters in math class, that's where I, I hopped off. Oh, uh, is it called letter? Yeah, whenever they started using letters, algebra, that's where I like, you know what? I'm fucking done. I was so fucking good at math until they introduced, introduced algebra. I was fucking farming in math class. I was insane. And then they're like, what's A plus C minus seven? And I'm like, you know what? I don't know. And I gave up. I had insanely good gra grades in math, all the way up to like seventh grade. And then it was like, so bad. It was diabolical after that. Yeah, I peaked in elementary school. Okay. Mm, that hurts. That really hurt us actually. Okay, 
Okay, I'm gonna barkskin myself. I'm gonna innovate the healer. And I'm gonna go back here. Picking up the mobs. Innervate is such a huge button, dude. It, it's fucking... It's insane how big that spell is. Cold Snap is good. Yeah. Yeah, that would have been a really bad without Innervate there. Actually, would have been horrible without Innervate. Good shit, guys. Good shit. Nice. Did Pat get his uh, temper as well? I hope he did. Oh, he did. Nice. All right, let's go out. Peaked at kindergarten. What's a prime number then? Bro, don't... Uh, guys, seriously, I do not ask me about math. I, I, I will sound stupid. I do not know math very well. Wait, uh, what are you doing, Grinder? Okay, run out, run out, run out. Just run out, run out, run out. Bro, oh god. Okay, I'm gonna stay back with the rogue. You have vanished, right? Okay, I'm gonna... Why did you do that? Don't run out yet. Do not run out yet. Do not run out yet. Don't run out yet. Please, 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 please. Do not run out yet. Wait for the priest and the rogue. Okay, okay, okay. Are we good? Alright, we can run out together now. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, good. Well, <laughs> what a way to end that on. Okay. Jesus. We're good, we're good, we're good. We're shilling, we're shilling. Solo bolo. Easy clap. I thought we were running out. Yeah, we don't have to pull all the mobs on the way out. A prime number is the amount of Twitch primes you get donated per stream. Oh! I mean, we've had, we've had a decent prime number today, then. We need room in the guild. Don't question my methods. Okay, fair. Yeah, maybe we can get some more prime numbers today, then. Yeah, we like prime numbers. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Chat, the thing is, I may not be good at math, but my in extreme skill at Vanilla WoW, you know, carried me. Guzu, you're gonna waste so much time playing World of Warcraft. Go outside. Go do other things. Look at me now. Professional video game player. Yeah, professional video game player. Let's go turn in some quests. What skill? I got rank 14. The most prestigious thing in the world. Full-time online male entertainer. Exactly. You're a professional yapper. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Whatever. Well, you know, it is what it is. Oh, good spin. I like that. Uh, yes. Can I assist you, Ashartela? Like after finishing a dungeon, surviving, it is absolutely delicious. Just being able to go around Yo. and then turning in quests. Have a good one. Fraternity ring. See, this is what I would probably Keep replace my Sila Rin with. So I lose three strength, four int, and. F Three spewing for one stamina and ten agi. I think that's actually worth. What's up? Hurry back! <laughs> Glad I could help. Yeah, I I think that's worth. Even over this, I could trade six stamina for one agi, one strength, four int, and three spirit. It's a net gain in terms of stats. Hmm. 
It might be worth, honestly. But 6 stamina is a lot of health, right? 60 health, to be exact. Nacha, thank you for the prime. Not worth? Yeah, I don't know. I like the stamina on the Seafire Band a lot. Can you link the Flip Flop song? Wait, just... Just go, like, go, go on, go, go. It's called Pilfinger Dance, and it goes like this. It's a good song. It's a it's a it's a national treasure in Denmark. Okay. All right, let's Be get a carrot, it. boys. Be seeing you. Oh, oh 7k. Obviously, we don't have a freaking mount yet. Uh, we actually could go buy a mount though. Yeah, we're gonna go to darn asses after this, so we could go buy a mount. Can I join the guild? Uh, is the guild full? I'm not sure. The guild is actually full at the moment, guys. Um, Dennis Kufur do. Then it's full. The, the guild is full at the moment, guys. It's full at the moment, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry, man. You remember a kindergarten song, but not Danish math? Or oh, basic math. Well, the thing about math is that... What the heck? Where should... What the... F what? Fair enough. Uh, uh, okay. Look at him go, yeah, he's fast, dude. He's fucking fast. Flip, flop, flip, flip, flop. Oh, we also have Searing Gorge coming up. Oh my god. Dude, it's starting to get exciting. How is he doing that? I think it's just a visual buck on my end. Yeah. That is the hardware store. It is indeed, dude. It is indeed. Searing Gorge is dope. Yeah, it is. It's nice. Uh, guys, the guild currently is full, man. Okay. Uh, I'm okay. Yeah, the, the guild currently is full, dude. We also have a quest over here. We gotta turn in, but I'm thinking I kinda just wanna go train some skills, maybe. Yeah, I need to train 46 skills. Yeah, time to purge the guild. Dude, the guild is like fully full always. It's crazy. That damn song's gonna be stuck in my head for the rest of the week. Flip, flop, flip, flip, flop, flip, 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 flop. <laughs> It's not even words. He's just, he's just, he's just yapping. Yeah, it's just a random yap. Real Danish. You think so? Do -do -do. I think you need a second guild. Uh, maybe, but I don't want to like. I, I mean, I'm gonna be doing only Fang soon as well, right? So I don't, I don't want to like, like set up a bunch of different guilds and stuff. Like, there, there is a ton of like hardcore guilds outside the one that we have as well. There, there's a ton of them. They're and they're all like really full. They're all like a lot of people in them. Only fans too? No, only fans. No, it's just Fang. It's just with a Fang, right? This is hardcore, Martin. Yes, Martin. So we see you for Dance King. Self found is only as full at 1k, it's decent. Yeah, there's a lot of really, really big guilds that you can join if you do have a desire to do that. Where's the NPCs? Yo. They're on a lunch break? Oh, okay.
Booty Bay? No, there's a quest here. The troll that's supposed to be right there. He flip-flopped out of there. Kind of weird, I'm not going to lie. Reload? I don't think reloading is going to help. No. I, I want to sort of leave the group, guys. Thanks for the for the, for the group. Um. Delete system thirty two. Okay, I can try to do that after the stream. Maybe that helps. Clear that up, maybe. Okay. Uh, I mean, I have Hearthstone back here, and I I gotta do more quests in Tanaris anyway. So I, I, I can just just go to Darnassus and then turn in. Oh, I'll, I'll relock and if it doesn't work, I'll just Hearthstone too. I'll, I'll go Moonglade and train some skills, okay? Because we gotta go back to Tanaris anyway. Respawn time? I don't think this guy is supposed to leave. Oh, Appa. No Hello, man. Hello, man. I guess he is supposed to leave. Oh, the ancient egg! This is for, um... Sunken Temple. Yeah, that's for Sunken Temple. Do do do. <laughs> yeah, that's for Sunken Temple, dude. Yeah, I don't know, I, I feel like, 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 like... Next dungeon is Maraudon. Okay, next achievement, by the way, first things first, is le level... 52. So we got plenty of time for that. Next dungeon is Maraudon. 51 for boss. I think we do it at 48. 48 will do Maraudon. Yeah. Forty-eight Maraudon. Greetings. What do we got? Uh, okay, what do we get? Oh, Shred? Hounds? F new frenzied region? Wait, 10 rage per into 10 health. 15 health. Ooh, 5 more health per rage point. New dash? New bash? New moonfire? New reuve? May the stars guide you. Okay, we don't need to put on our fail uh, things. Oh, I can't afford mount now. Wow. <clears throat> Level 46 just died. This last word more smiley face. And a level 51 also just drowned. Milk that travel form? I mean, I am milking it. I'm, I'm milking it so hard, bro. New fairy fire? I, I use feral fire, so I, I, I don't train uh, fairy fire because I have feral fire. Yeah. Farewell. Actually, we got a flight of Darnassus. Dude. <clears throat> Embrace of the Lycan and Jinxed Voodoo head skin is really awesome. And now we're, our cat form sprint dash is really good. I got something in my throat. Wowie. I think something went wrong the, the wrong pipe. I am honored. Alright, let's Near go. Do we train feral fire then? I do. It's rank three right now. Uh chat. Oh, I'm not gonna lie. I told myself I would do a short stream today. And now it's seven and a half hours later. I'm gonna call it now. Okay. Tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. Are we gonna do Moraudon? Hmm. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Tomorrow, we're gonna continue the leveling. We got Tanaris Gaming. We got Syrian Gorge. Maybe Moraudon. I'm not sure on that. Okay. Don't know. I'm also gonna try to set up God of War, guys, so we can start our God of War playthrough. Because I wanna do a little bit of God of War each day, so we do like. 
five, six, whatever hours of WoW gaming, and we do like one, two, three hours of a little bit of God of War variety, right? God of War 1. I don't know if we're gonna do it tomorrow. I'm gonna try my best. We're gonna see how it goes. But we are gonna be doing some more hardcore gaming tomorrow, guys. Mark me on that one, all right? I hope you guys enjoyed today's stream as much as I enjoyed streaming it. Because I will be back tomorrow for another gaming session, guys. We conquered the, the Quergos Gold. Conquered Solferak. Marauden is on the horizon. God of War as well. The very first one or the first remake? I don't know. I think... It depends. I need to talk to some people that knows more stuff about it. And we'll figure it out, right? Um, but yeah. Crowd Pommeler tomorrow. We are going to get that tomorrow. I need to go get some food, guys, because I'm starving. Absolutely starving. Um, have a good big one, guy. Have a big one, dude, guy. Th I can't even speak, man. Have a good one, big guy, is what you wanted to say, I think. So thank you for that. Um, what the fuck, man? That, I can't even speak today. Uh, but yeah, I mean, thank you very much for being here, guys. I, I really do appreciate all the support with everything. It's been super awesome. It's been super, super cool. I, I really appreciate you guys so much for hanging out. Uh, follow the stream if you haven't already. Uh, join the Discord, guys. I would really appreciate if you guys would join the Discord too. That'd be super, super awesome. And, uh, and yeah. That's all I freaking got for you guys today. Let's send you guys over to Graceful Days today. Hey, I like that guy. He's cool. He's playing a druid as well. I think we're actually we're the same level. Yeah, I think I think we're the same level. Alright, uh Okay. And uh, that's it for today, guys. Uh you know what? I'll I'll give you guys this for the outro song today. I need to find a specific outro song again. Have a good day, guys. Thanks for being here. Bye-bye!